This episode's gonna be awesome. I've just got an Iron Man jetpack. Boosh! We're definitely gonna die using this, but I am getting the, the general hang of things. So we've got a plan. I wanna go and collect this chest because I think I've got the lockpick and skill to, to, to do it. Oh, actually, question. Question. We've picked up some new ones of these. No, I like this one. Lockpick and bootworm's good. I mean, it does give us plus five armor. We're using this. No, we're not. We're using this one. Poison. Yeah, we're using the we're using the best stuff. Good stuff. Let's go. We're gonna collect this chest, see if it's anything good, and then we're gonna go to the iron mine, and this that's gonna do two quests for us. The one we have to get iron ore to make the weapons for. The girl who wants to cultivate us to have good ploughing tools. <laughs> it's for the girl who wants a good ploughing. And it's also for the guy called Scrappy which wants us to work in the mine anyway so it's, it's, it's worked out well. So- oh! Look I'm dead already. Oh my god I knew it. Oh my god, I, I, I just, it's because what you've got, you've got to turn it off before you run out of fuel so you can land properly. Okay, well we, we completely fucked that up. I knew it was going to happen. I need to get used to it. That was a close one. That is so good though. Look at the skills. Where was it? Oh there it is, right right in the entrance. Easy lock, we can get it. Fucking easy lock. It's the hardest lock I've ever had to do in my life. That's it. Got it. Damage Warbo. White Gemstone. Bonus Companion Health. Okay, it wasn't the greatest, but never mind. On to the Iron Mine. We'll go from... Yeah, it's probably the, the fastest way. All those hard creatures here, we'll have to avoid them. We put ourselves at serious risk by remaining here. I agree. We are certainly are at risk. Probably going to get our fanny smashed. Our oh, Falk's already engaging because he's, he's a hero. Is the hero we truly deserve? Nice. This is so good for getting about. How fast can we move now? I wonder if you like fly head first into a mountain, does, does it kill you? Breakneck speed, quite literally. It's nice having these extra extra fuel. We've probably added about 50% of what we originally had. Or feels like it anyway. Yeah, these people are dead. I knew they'd be dead. 
two raptors. I don't mind avoiding them. Look, we got a jackhammer. We can finally mine ore. Jackanakanori. Loads of jackhammers. I've had enough. This is my last log. Kicked out of the seedling fields, banned from working as a scrap collector, and sent to the mines. Telling I'll you, wait here. whoever listens to this, Rat is doing this on purpose. I'm getting the fuck out. I'll start I'm my here. own gang, hire some of the old boys in a terrace. I'll leave my shit here. I won't I'll need wait it anyway. Here. Not if I can rob enough to keep my head above. Oh shit, it's toxic. Finally, they said I just need to work this week. It's about time for me to get some daylight. I'm starting to need a break from the grind. Water. Fucking Thor Hild and fucking Scrappy I'm here. can kiss my fucking ass. Seriously. Whoever finds this shit can keep it. And if you're fed up with the Berserkers too, come find me. I'll bring back the glory days of the old outlaws. No Baxter or Rat, no Logan or Nasty. I'll be the king. And anyone who questions me dies. Once my gang is big enough, I'll take back the fort. Yeah. Hey, Willie, what are you doing back there? I'll fuck off, you. So William wants to be the next warlord. The air here seems to be contaminated. Yeah, it does seem to be contaminated. Let Scrappy to... know. Seems to be fucked. I've got poison resistance on this thing here, though. That'll help. I'll wait here. This could get dangerous fast. The fucking bastard. Mind more work faster, he says. He doesn't have to exhaust himself swinging away at the fucking rocks every day. That arsehole should get his hands dirty. Do some work himself. I wonder if Scrappy knows how Grom treats us. But Grom sounds like a bit of a prick. I'm keeping an eye on my health here, so I'll just, um... Well, there's Grom's dead. Oh, <gasps> you can't shit! I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. You can't do that. You can't heal poison. Shit, I remember that from the same from the first game. I'm here. Oh, okay. Let's try that again. I'll wait here. Yeah, you can't heal poison, it's brutal. We're definitely fucking dead here, like. Hey, what am I gonna do? I'm loading up this save. The reason why I'm loading up this save is because. I think if we go back and see Scrappy, he's probably going to give me a gas mask or something. Because I don't I've think we can do had this here. Enough. This is my last log. Kicked out of the seedling fields, banned from working as a scrap collector, I'll and sent here. to the mines. I'm telling you, well, whoever listens to this, Rat is doing this on purpose. I better scram. I'm getting the fuck out. I'll start my own gang, hire some of the old boys in a terrace. My shit here. I won't need it anyway. Not if I can rob enough to keep my head above water. <laughs> fucking Thor Hild and fucking Scrappy can kiss my fucking ass. Siri. The air here seems to be contaminated. Oh, does it? I oh, fucking let Scrappy know. Coughing our fucking lungs out <laughs> here.
Run, bitch, run, bitch, run, bitch, run, 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 run. I'm here. Shit, the bed. That was close. Okay. Let's go back and see Scrabby. Because that's not good. That is fucked, mate. There's got to be a better way of doing that. If we get a, like a rebreather or something. the skills. Look at the health. Lads, if we lost any sort of health there, we would have died. You have a gas mask, bro. I'm back from the mine. Everyone's dead. What the fuck you talking about, Jax? What the hell happened? I think the mine was flooded with gas. It reeked. Well, damn. That explains why the poor bastards ain't been sending shit. You wanted into the fort, right? Go to Fenris. Someone's gotta tell him what happened. If we ain't getting no iron from the mine, well, that's a real shit sandwich. But you gotta hurry, son. This is a fucking emergency. Okay, then. Fenris is just... Yeah, he's just there. It's funny because like we're not allowed up here, technically. We're gonna get kicked out, but like I'm I'm helping this fort so much. Holy scrap, bitch. See look at all this stuff we would have missed if we didn't have these glasses on. Watch this. We're not gonna get caught. Oosh. I'm here, friend. Scrappy sent me. Everyone in the iron mine is dead. Are you... are you serious? The mine's full of gas. They suffocated. By the sword of Ragnar, just what we need. Without supplies from the mine, we cannot make weapons and armor. It'll only be a matter of time until we're overrun by those creatures. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Take these shards to Scrappy. What for? Tell Scrappy to use the shards to fix this, however he can. I do want to do this. I, I want to fix that one. I need to be in that mine. I think you might just give us a gas mask. That'd be the easiest Ugh. way to fix it, wouldn't it? I have pace myself. You think you can steal from here? You're sorely mistaken. Mate, I'm not even stealing from you. I ain't that type of guy, man. I'm an upstanding citizen. Upstanding citizen. I love them. I love this game. I really do. Fenris sent me. It's about the mine. So, what'd he say? Fix it. He gave me money. Huh. Well, that's a shit ton of shards, but what in the hell are you supposed to do with them? Stuff them in the fucking cracks to stop the leak? You got any bright ideas, son? Gas masks. By gas masks? Huh. Guess we could. Fenris gave us enough shards for that. Good. But that ain't so much a solution as sidestepping around the damn problem. I don't even know where to get them. I'll ever think. Not total shit as far as plans go, but we gotta do better than that. Any other ideas? That's a shame because I want the gas mask for like my adventuring. I won't bother about the mine really. Seal up the source of the gas. 
How about sealing up the source of the gas? Well, that sure would work good. But some poor son of a bitch has got to go down there and find the source. Yeah. I know, old Scrappy's Well, get the gas mask and I'll do it. But would you do this for me, too? It's a big ask. That's exactly why I'm asking you, son. We ain't exactly farting out options here, are we? Oh, look at me. Skinny old bastard all busted up by chems. I wouldn't last a damn minute. It better be worth the effort. I'll make damn sure it is. You should take some of Fenris's money. Yeah, baby. Get yourself some healing potions or some shit like that. Mate, healing potions don't work. You know what? Hang on. I think I got a mask. mask around here somewhere. It's crap, but it might help a little. You look around the mine. I'll think up plan B. Fucked if I know what it'll involve, but leave it to old Scrappy. Yeah, I like this quest. It's a good, good little quest, this. Ooh. Ooh, I didn't know he had that there. You shit yourself? Why you squat? <laughs> Mate, you just make him do a Michael Jackson 360 and he, um, he didn't see you pick shit up. Nice, we can upgrade this jetpack again. Right, wait there. So where are we going? Back to the mine. Let's just fly there. Can we fly there from here? Rocket man. Oh, it's it's good. If, you, if you're close to the ground, you don't need to, like, jetpack up to stop yourself from dying. Yes! All more games should give you jetpacks. Okay. We've got a jetpack. Sorry, jetpack. I meant a gas mask. Let's have a look at this. Sixty poison resistance. We'll use this, and we'll use this. We've got like seventy poison resistance. This should be good. Come on then. I'll That's so here. much better. Is it really? It's a bit shit, you know. Right, we'll take a left. Mine are dead loot. I can't take much more of this. That's fine, bro. You're doing good. I like it how it doesn't it doesn't yeah. like hurt you as much. Your health bar lasts longer. Only thing is I can't see things because I've took the glasses off. I've been waiting for three days now for that useless shit of a cultivator to bring me new tools. I wear out my ass cheeks sitting around and waiting for him if he takes any longer. If he thinks he's getting out here in a week, he's got another thing coming. Oh, I don't want to mind. Looks like the source of the gas. I should tell Scrappy that this source probably won't be closed off. Shit, 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 shit. Whoa! I'm dead? Motherfucker. Did you see? I didn't realize that that standing at the source of the, the gas was making me take much more damage. That, that, that was bullshit. You've got to admit that was, that was fucking dog shit there. You motherfuckers. I'll wait here. Well, at least we'll go this way first because we can always like loot these guys on the way back. <sighs> this could get dangerous fast. This 
looks like the source of the gas. I should tell Scrappy that this source probably won't be closed off. <coughs> yeah, no, that is, this is the safest way to do it. Let's get outside. I don't want to risk it. We've come too far. I'm here. Right, we'll just clear up, get some, as much iron ore as we can because we need it for the, the, the tools, don't we? I need 25. I should have 25 by now, to be fair. Okay, that didn't that didn't work as well as I, I planned. I thought I was just gonna zoom through the tunnel with my jetpack. Right, chill out there. How many iron ore do we have? We've got twenty five. I'm good. Materials. I've got forty one iron ore now. Okay, we've got enough to do all the quests. Let's take this shit off. Brilliant. Brilliant. And we'll get now. So we, we can do both quests now. But who was the... It was for the girl down there. We'll see her in a, in a minute. We'll go back to Scrappy. Sealed up, baby. I found the source of the gas. High volumes of it are emanating from the back of the mine. Don't think the source can be blocked off. Well, shit. You saying there's no way to get rid of it? Doesn't look like it. Son of a bitch. Ah, but wait. Old Scrappy's got an idea. Well, was your idea, actually. But let's talk about you. Take some of Fenris's shards, okay? Have someone check you out. Gas is dangerous shit. So, what's your idea? Gas masks. <laughs> no shit. Need gas masks. Where do we get them? Getting folk to work in the mine with just a gas mask is about as wise as shoving a stick up a troll's ass. But I ain't got no choice. We need the iron. You'll need new miners as well. Oh, shit, huh? <clears throat> Didn't think about that. <laughs> but we can buy masks from the Morcons. The Morcons? The mole trader fuckers is in the fort. Oh, yeah, I know this guy. They must have that sort of shit, living underground and all. I'll see if I can find anything. Here. This should be enough to get some masks. Now I gotta figure out how to convince some other poor bastards to work down the mine. Hm. How many gas masks do you need? Five should do to start. Look in the trade district. Should be some going there. If our luck's pure shit, we'll have to go to the Morcons. Them moles will definitely have them. He might help me because I was doing a quest for that Morcon guy. I actually stopped him getting beat up. How are you going to find new miners? Guess I'll just hang up a few flyers or something. Still got some floating around. Might not mention the last lot dying. 
Why don't you hang up a few on the bulletin boards? I'll take care of the area around the main gates. Where do I find the bulletin boards? There's one near Chloe's Tavern, one near the fields, and one close to Skinny's Soup Kitchen. Uh, be careful out in the fields. Thorhill would be pissed if we try and take her workers. Got all that? Well, off you go then. If you need me, I'll be hanging around the main gate. Okay, right, well, let's play this, let's play this correctly, let's play this smartly. Why don't we go make Thorwald happy by giving her the, the iron first, and then we'll hang up the posters, because she'll not be too bothered. Right, hold on. So. Let's go and give him the, the iron ore. He'll craft whatever tools, I think he said it's going to take him three days, didn't it? Wait there, this is not right. Lass. Look at my jetpack skills. Got your shit, son. Here. The ore for the tools. Well, the supplies are no longer a problem. Now on to the next thing. Time. I said I'd give you three days at the anvil. That'll get five quality tools, or ten basic ones. I always say quality is worth it, but five won't be enough for every cultivator. I won't guarantee quality for double that many, just so we're clear. So what'll it be? Come on, decide now. Ain't got all day. I'd rather have quality tools. Make me five quality tools. Good. Tell Thorhill she got her way. Next beer's on you. I'll deliver them myself. No need for you to come collect them. Well, that's I'd rather have a quality tool than a shit one, to be fair. Right. So we've made that decision. Hopefully it's a good one. Now, let's... Oh, he's going to del deliver them himself. Happy days. I still want to go and see her, but I need to gas mass for the miner. Well, wait there. Let's plant these things. Should be a notice board down here. That was lucky because I had no fuel, I would have died if I'd went over that wall. Hey, what are you doing? I need to find new mine workers for Scrappy. Go see Thorhild. You need permission before you poach her workers. Oh, fuck off. I I'll do it because she I, I do like Thorhild. Plus, she'll probably be happy that I got her some quality tools. If she wanted 10 shit tools, then I'm shit out of luck here. Tell me where they are right now. Last made you the work tools. Did it cause any problems? You'll probably mark it down against your name in the future. Typical. Anything else? I had to decide how many work tools he should make. That blockhead should just do his job. But good. I can stop worrying about it now. I'm just gonna say what's up. What's up? My workers are running away. And while I'm trying to fix their mistakes for them, they take the rest of the day off. 
You just let them go like that? What do you take me for? I was distracted for a split second. That's all it took for them to make a break for it. Just now, when the seedlings need the most attention. You need to get them back. No discussion. I can't do it myself. I'm gonna I want to whip them into shape. Sure the seedlings don't wither away. Where would your workers hide? If only I knew. They couldn't have gotten very far. I'm guessing they're in the fort. Eating, drinking. They want nothing more in life. You know, I want to tell I want to say this. Scrap, we need new well with there. Scrappy needs new recruits for the mine. More recruits? He has plenty working for him. Dead. There was an incident. It wouldn't be the first. Tell me, please, what have I got to do with it? I have to put up a notice here. And you think I'll just let you do that? Without the mine, the fort will be missing a crucial source of iron. And without seedlings, we may as well give up our campaign. Cut 22. About the workers for the mine. Ah. Doesn't everyone have a choice who they work for? Intelligence 20. Doesn't everyone have a choice who they work for? Of course. There's no slave labor here. Then you shouldn't stop me from putting up the notice. And what if people start to run away? If they don't want to work here, they won't be as productive anyway. True. Hmm. Might be onto something there. We certainly can't let productivity suffer. Put up your notice. No one will be interested in it anyway, now that I think about it. Who'd work in a musty mine shaft when they could be enjoying the fresh air of the field? True, especially this mine shaft. Yeah, fault man, I've got the brains, I've got the brawn. I got the big balls, baby. Look, I'm back to plant this thing. What are you going to do about it, you prick? Done. Did Thorhill give you permission? Listen, mate. Me and yeah. Thorhill are fucking best mates. Oh, okay. I guess that's fine then. We are best buddies. We'll put up this last notice, then we'll try and get them gas masks. Shit. Well played. As long as you tap just before you land, you survive. All done. I should get back to Scrappy. It must still be in the fort somewhere. Well, not yet. We've got to get the gas masks. Okay, so it's in the trade district. Over here. Yeah, the frame rate does suffer a lot in this, this area. Right, what I want to do first is I'm actually going to have a word with the, the Morcon. The Morcon. Here he is. I've still got a quest to do for this guy. I forgot what it was. <laughs> There's my trusty friend. My brother from another well, mother. Uh, did you manage to get a hold of my supplies? Oh shit, yeah, I didn't did I? Chloe didn't have your provisions. Seriously? You mean to say you've come back empty handed? That's not right. There's not a food shortage, is there? Not exactly. Someone with sticky fingers. They were stolen? Oh, for Ravak's sake, just my luck. The guards were probably too busy harassing me to notice. What do I do now? I'll make sure Chloe holds her end of the bargain. I'll make sure Chloe holds up her end of the bargain. I won't ask how you'll manage that, but I'm not going to argue. Let me know when you have news. I need gas masks. I need gas masks. With or without filters. What's the point of a gas mask without a filter? <laughs> Fashion. Okay, point taken. I usually have a few in stock. Have a rummage. 
Cause it's you, you can have it for a special low price. Yeah, baby. Spare me the sales spiel. Is he actually gonna give me for a low price? Let's trade. Sounds good. He's got eight. He's got eight for 240 gold each. Good rebel clothing, five grand. Right, hold on. So he's selling them for 240 each. Of course. He doesn't have anything. Only one of the shop. Any so nobody but him sells them. Fine. Right, we need to buy five because I want to keep the I want to keep the one I've got in case we come across any other gas. Oh, and we'll we'll buy five. Let's trade. That. Right, we'll come back to his quest later with Chloe. Needs. He asked me to bring them to him. Scrap you just there. Happy days. Boost. Oh shit! And he died. Scrappy. I hunt the flyers. I hung up the flyers. What's going on with the graphics? Look, he's disappeared. That's what I like to hear. Motherfucker's got no face. Here's a little something for your trouble. You're a good one, you are. Now if you could just get a hold of some damn gas masks, we'd be able to work the mine again. Jobs are good. That's the last thing I need from you. Swear on my late mom's undergarments. What? I have the gas masks you need. You got them? Seriously? Fuck me, son. You're a damn hero, you know? Ain't got a damn clue how I can thank you. Ah, you know what? Take more of Fenris's money. You've damn well earned it. Oh, well, shit on a plate and call it cuisine. I think we're still on the transition. It. This mine will be up and running in no time. I'll make sure Fenris knows what you've done for me. Thanks again, boy. You're a damn good son of a bitch. Yes, I am. Now I'm off to get my new workers together and head down to the mine with them. You need anything else? I'll be down there. I'll see you around, son. What does this guy teach again? Sure. He does teach me to build weapons, and I can actually do it. Should I do it? You can craft simple weapons. Right, okay. Excellent. Yeah, I think we're still on the transition where like it loads part of the level, and that's why everything was flashing there. Right, hold on. Inventory. Look, I've got loads of weapons here, haven't I? How do I tell if it's a simple one or not? See this, this damage runer blade is, is incredible, right? I've got seven of them. But the thing is though, would I, would I rather not just use a legendary weapon than I don't need to craft anything? You know what I mean? I could. I wonder if I can make money this way. If I get that skill, craft them together and then sell them, maybe. A damaged Captain Axe is worth 2,500. I wonder how much a, a regular one is. Damaged Enforcer Blade. Only got one of them. A simple sword. Got three. I might I might buy it and try it. Is 
Double barrel shotgun, 55 dex and strength. Okay. Yeah, I kind of want to go dex and strength because that means I can use weapons as well. Because none of these are... None of these require... Constitution. It, it, it's hard to make a build. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll do that in a minute. He, he's... Look, 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 I've disappeared! Where's my fucking face? Save it there before anything goes tits up. Hold on, so what was I... Right, right we'll, we'll do that later. We'll mess about with the crafting system. Why don't we go and see... Uh, meeting with Hank. I want to go and see Chloe. See if she can give this guy what he what he what he deserves. A damaged broadsword. I would don't like this. Don't even think about stealing anything. Oh oh, oh sorry. What are you doing sneaking <laughs> around? This guy, this, guy, this guy was watching me square try to steal that. That was fucking hilarious. So there's Ivan. I'm gonna talk to my husband later. We better hide Chloe's our there. better. You do that. See you later. See you all got your yeah, the graphics start. are all kinds of fucked up in this this town. A few things you gotta know before we get started. Come on, come closer. About Ivan's groceries. Is the upper district accessible now? Oh shit! Now? Yeah, I haven't. No. In that case. Right, 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 right. Okay, upper district. How do we do that again? We need to do this. This is what's like holding us back. Upper district. Okay, so it, it means is it, is it available in the upper district for me? Well, then I think we should just go to. Yeah. I'm going to do this for Thorhild first so we've got everybody on our side. Cult of it, that's somewhere in the Thor fort. I'm actually, I'm actually where they are. They're in here somewhere. Fools. Apparently they're still in I think it might be this guy because this guy's named and he, he hadn't said anything before. Man, I'm still not done with my drink. Come back later, man. He brought it on himself. I was bound to go wrong. Can't make it any clearer. Yeah, Cultivator. That's the end. That's the minute. Can't you see I'm diet. busy? I don't believe Butch? That. Who the fuck's Butch? In the area too. You're thirsty, aren't you? Shouldn't you be looking after the seedlings? I can wait. Thorhill doesn't see it that way. And that old lady should pay us some real money. We're not screwing around for the hell of it. We know a lot's riding on these seedlings. That's why we're busting our asses looking out for them. But just a couple of shards for all that? Just, come on, man. What's wrong with these shards? Not enough of them's what's wrong. If we do anything wrong and the bitch cuts our pay. Why don't you bring it up to her? She doesn't give a shit. Only cares about that green stuff. And always find something to complain about. Rearing these seedlings ain't easy. Well, maybe for her it is. Been working the field all her damn life. But us? Look at this ragtag bunch. Most of them are from the gutter. That smart ass attitude of hers doesn't help. Tossing a few shards our way is the least she can do. Bro, you sound like a bitch. I want to threaten him. You'll get your asses back to work whether you're paid or not. What are you saying? Get back to work or I'll <laughs> make you. Careful, man. I'll knock you flat on your ass and you'll be done. You're not. If you don't want to work, there's going to be consequences. You deaf? Didn't you hear me? <laughs> I'll knock you on your ass. Butch, I want to destroy you. Settle this right here and now. Uh, fight. You can do better than that. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I don't even know what the fuck's going on. 
should be <laughs> This can't keep That happening. was remarkable. That was remarkable. I got me That's awesome. That's gonna be the craziest thing I've ever well, heard. Get this straight. Right, tell you what, I'm loading the game because the frame rate's in the gutter. I don't know if there's like a memory leak or something. Just don't think about it. We have our way. It should be enough. Right. We have our way. It should be enough. Really? Right, what we need to do is we need to save it. I need to heal. Ugly situation. And we need to lure these guys outside because the Yaka can't fight in here. In the area. Can't make it any clearer. You don't have to do that. Right. Oh, what now? Get wrecked. Oh, my fists are itching. Lock onto the right guy then. This guy is not susceptible to the spot. Get in there. You can start any time now. Boring. Why aren't they Got him. Watching? That was remarkable. What do you think of all that, dickhead? No more fighting, okay? Back to work. I, well, we, well, am I gonna have to repeat myself? I'm going, I'm going. And now you're getting paid fuck all. <laughs> Dickheads. Get back to work. This is how we, lad, this is how we play the game. Rule it with an iron fist. Okay, let's go back to Thorold, or whatever she's called. Sleep, fight with, and take the edge off. What the hell's going on here? Last one's optional, I guess. Tools are already down there. And just don't forget, the mine's chock full of gas. So change your filters out often, okay? All right, let's go then. Nice, okay, so they've got mine. What I think I'm going to have to do is, I think, because I've actually been playing this game for about five or six hours, like, straight. I haven't turned the, the, the computer off. Maybe the game's got some sort of memory leak. We'll, um, what are you up to? I'm having to sleep in your bed, mate. Maybe that's what's causing the graphics to flash. Although, oh, it only ever does it in, in this town. Maybe because there's so Damn much it. going on. The whole world is going to end and everyone's still going about their daily lives. It's a crazy thing to watch. Perfect landing. Forward roll, that was some poor call shit there. Oh no. Do you think this is enough supplies? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I've done the work. Butch and his friends are back to work. How on earth did you manage that? Butch took a pretty persuasive beating. Unusual methods, but effective. There's still one more thing I could use your advice with. You've never given the impression that you're looking for suggestions. You don't say. That's why I'm asking you now. What do you know? What, what do you want? I've got some time. What do you want to know? Something's telling me the shards won't keep the cultivators satisfied for very long. True. I'm not surprised. They're unhappy. But how? They even have the work tools they need. Have you ever tried listening to them? Why? Their role here is clear. I've explained what they have to do, more than once. Did you also show them? No. Why would I demonstrate what I've already explained? Exactly. Have you ever praised their work? I haven't needed to. Do you show your workers the same respect you show your seedlings? Not really. We are dropping knowledge bomb yes. bombs on her. That's what I thought. I'm starting to understand what you're trying to say. I think I know what has to be done. You've given me a lot to think about. 
Thanks. Did you want to know anything else? Not right now. I'll report to Fenris that you've been a big help. We've done it. Now, please excuse me. There's some things I need to explain. Nice. So we've got everybody's um, approval. Look at look at look at him. He just <laughs> folks just rocking up. Right. Well, I think we should join the berserkers now. Let's go. We've done every single. We've done every quest for them, and we should join so we get access to the upper district, which unlocks more quests, or at least quests we can we can finish. Stop! <laughs> the upper part of the fort is for honorable citizens. I'm already those... outside the You're... upper part. I'm already outside. Oh, I've got a jetpack there. Right, hold on. So let me, in case we make a mistake here, let's save. Let's see what this guy says about joining the Berserkers. How am I doing? Well, Scrappy seems to think highly of you, so it seems you're doing okay. Thorhild seems satisfied, and she isn't easily pleased. Good work. Tylus says you really helped him out. You've done well. Right, now you have an advocate. You only need my approval. For that, you'll have to pass Rat's loyalty test. Oh, Rat. I should warn you, though. So far, no one has passed. So don't get your hopes up, okay? Let me worry about that. Your confidence is admirable. But listen to what Rat wants you to do. What sort of test is this? As you know, this is the former outlaw camp. Many of them have joined us. But not all of them hold us berserkers in high regard. Have you noticed the outlaw propaganda that's been circulating? Yeah, I talked to Wolf about it. Ah, I see. Well, that simplifies things a little. I'll keep it brief then. I was going to send you to Wolf anyway. Help him find the source of this damaging propaganda. Already done it. If you manage that, I'll let you up to see Rat. We already found the source. What? Honestly? I'm a beast at this game. You're more efficient than I could have imagined. Can I go to the upper district now? Well, let me see. You have at least one advocate, and you managed to find the source of the propaganda. I must say, I'm impressed. You officially have my permission to enter the upper district. First person I can send up there with a clear conscience. Still, you should see Rat straight away. He's going to want to talk to you. He's the only one who can initiate new berserkers into the faction. I'm sure when he hears what you have done, he'll accept you, or at least give you a reward. I'll see you around. I have some things to do, especially now that the upper district is open to more people. Brilliant. I'd rather improve my fighting skills. Ah, let me guess. You visited the City Watch's fight instructor, but he needs my approval. Yeah. Oh, I remember now. You snuck into the <laughs> upper district without authorization, and then shamelessly asked me for permission to train. So what? I couldn't let you in back then. Even I have to follow the rules. But the City Watch instructor is something else. He follows every rule, no matter how ridiculous. If he hadn't been a berserker for so long, I'd think he was a cleric. Tell him I trust you, and if he still gives you trouble, have him take it up with me. Nice. Where can I find I already Rat? know where to find Rap, but I'll see what he says. Go to the upper district and tell the game. Okay. Be... Tell Lothar. So Lothar must be the, the, the heavy boy. Stop. The upper part of the... Stop. You're not coming in. Bro, I'm a fucking Fenris beast. Fenris gave me his personal permission to go in. Let me in. I'm the one who found the source of the outlaw propaganda. Getting rid of the outlaws. That was you? You better not be lying to me. I will check. Well, good luck with that, bro. 
Nice. Okay, now what we'll do is before we go and see Rat and get in, in, introduced, introduced to the Berserkers, why don't we explore all the people? We've got a proper armor now. I only sell the Berserker. Oh, so I'm not technically a Berserker. Okay, fair enough. Fenris said you could teach me something. Okay, what do you want to know? Don't think you'll get special treatment or anything. You gotta pay for anything more than the basics of fighting, okay? But I'm sure I could teach you a few things. What can you teach me? What are you- Oh, we can teach a lot. Stamina, stamina regen. Oh, that's cool. You can, you, you can teach a lot, which is nice. Six cents, I don't need any of this stuff. Health regen. It would be nice if it gave us a figure, but then again, we need 60 constitution, which I'm, not, I'm probably not going to have. Wait there. Okay. How much is this? 45 strength, 30 dex. I could get that. I think we probably should. But not yet. Okay. This is free. You're allowed to do that. It's free. It's it, it's free, man. Socket and bench. Oh, Halvar. Hmm. A new face. I see the guards have eased up on the restrictions to let you in. Mm, I don't like it, but I guess I have to accept it. So. How do I get you to leave me alone? Pay me money. The warehouse shelves won't stock themselves. What's stored in here? Nothing here would interest you. I don't run a storefront, and I'm not interested in making friends. I can tell. What's your problem? I don't know you, so it's none of your business. Just so you know, there's one thing I care about. A well-stocked and well-managed warehouse. But some stuff's happened lately that's thrown that to chaos. So I'd appreciate it if you'd let me... I can help you with that problem. Work. I can clear that warehouse for you in, in like a minute. I'll put it all in my pockets and you'll have a nice clean warehouse. A stickler for law and order like you should be able to teach me something, right? Sure, I could do that. But why would I waste my time on a pathetic good-for-nothing like you? <laughs> this guy looks Don't like Mel Gibson. Worry. I'm a quick learner. Hmm, is that so? Well, I'm not teaching you anything until I'm sure you've got the brains for it. So, I'm going to ask you a question. Listen up! If one and a half raptors eat one and a half beggar corpses in one and a half days, how many beggar corpses does a raptor eat in one day? Oh, what the fuck? If one and a half raptors eat one and a half beggar corpses in one and a half days, how many beggar corpses does a raptor eat in one day? One and a half raptors eat one and a half beggar corpses in one and a half days. Oh god, I've actually got no idea. What do you think it is? One and a half raptors is no such thing. One and a half raptors? There's no such thing. That's not the point. This is about numbers, not biological accuracy. <laughs> Just use <gasps> logic. Given these conditions, one raptor would eat just one beggar corpse well, that's in what one I was going and a half say. days. Consequently, if we calculate how much it would eat in one day based on that, we end up with two thirds. Simple! Ah, well, now that we've cleared that up, I hope you're planning to teach me something. Given your complete inability to do even the simplest Good, we've got access to it. It's probably best if I give you a lesson or two. I wouldn't have gotten that right. I would have I'll said one, but it was actually two thirds. To make up for the lost time. Let me know when you're ready for a lesson. 
I want to learn from you. Attribute point skills, which I think are a waste of time. Ooh, receive more experience from enemies killed. 5% experience. What a waste of time. Bookworm, I've already got that. 5% from completing missions. I mean, it's not bad. And that's all he can teach. What's wrong? What happened? Hmm. Security here isn't what it used to be. Do you mean the invaders? I mean the damned thieves. Some heathen went and stole my ring. Oh, that was me. It's stolen. You know what that means? I stole it. You're gonna have to have a new one made. Oh, spare me your bullshit. This is serious. If I've been robbed, then my warehouse might be next. Demand-oriented supply? Psh, gone. Special rations? Bye-bye. Gone. This place will fall into chaos if the inventory doesn't match the ledger. And what do they do about this? They ease access restrictions to our district. Insanity. Plain and simple. Insanity. Do you need help? Indeed I do. Only, I don't know if we'll get along because... Out with it. Can I trust you? If I tell you my plans, you can't tell a soul. Can you promise me you'll keep a secret? Pinky promise. Of course. Hmm, you're a bit too eager to please for my liking. So, we're going to do things differently. What I'm going to show you is very sensitive. So I'm going to need assurances. I'm going to need collateral. Like what? You give me some shards that cover any possible losses as a show of good faith. You'll get them back later, of course. What's in it for me? Do you remember me saying that I don't <laughs> hand out anything from the warehouse? Hmm? Well, help me and I'll skim a little and fix the ledger so no one knows. You'll also get to buy from the warehouse. Now, that's a rare privilege. It's up to you. How much? 100 shards? Fuck yeah. Here's some shards for collateral, so you'll know I'm serious. I want to rob this warehouse blind. Excellent. I'll take good care of it. Oh, this theft problem is going to take some time to resolve. When you have the time, let me know. I'll assume you want to catch the thief. No, I wanted to keep going. Only you'll be the thief. You're gonna have to explain. What does this, this guy to me. want? The law of averages says things are going to start disappearing around here soon. It doesn't take a genius to figure that out. But since we don't know the exact time, we're going to determine it ourselves. <laughs> What's the purpose of that? If other upper district citizens are robbed too, then they'll all realize that we need to change the security rules. I can't be the only one who's been hit, hmm? Then, Rat won't be able to refuse the need for more security. So, the sooner that happens, the tougher it'll be for the actual thieves. A pretty clever plan. So, about the thefts in the upper district. What exactly am I stealing, then? It's not just the what that's important, but also the where. The where. Sneak into the guard's dorm and see what you can find in their footlockers. Only take what's valuable, leave anything else. Now I'm taking everything. Why? Why? Because we're not real thieves! So, you're just going to return whatever valuables I bring you? Hmm, that's the plan, but I still need to figure out how I can bring them back without getting caught. Keep an eye out for little pouches with shards. You may not find what you're looking for in every chest. After all, not many people are smart enough to put something aside for a rainy day. Anything else? Uh, uh, don't come back until you've got some good, valuable stuff. You'll draw too much attention to yourself otherwise. 
There's got to be an easier way for you to get some security. Nope. Rat always shoos me away whenever I bring it up to him. Why should the warehouse get special treatment and security when there's already guards on the upper district? And he won't budge from that. At least, hmm, not without a little push. Huh? Why don't you just do them yourself? Oh, <laughs> I'm a planner. I need someone to do the grunt work for me. Exactly what he thinks I am. And you look like someone who's used to, uh, grunt work. Which in all fairness I am. That was impressive. <laughs> that was impressive, mate. But this is free. All of this stuff's free. And there's stuff in here is not. Hey, that's the right choice. Get out of good decision. Right, okay, so we spoke to him. We've got new training, which is nice. Give me this free scrap. What are you doing? I'm taking this free scrap. Wait, this place looks like a shithole, I'm cleaning it up. These are just random berserkers. Who's this? Halla. Halla Berry? Wanna learn to fight? Go somewhere else. I'm only responsible for training berserkers. Talk with Ejnar, he can help you. Maybe. Why the attitude? Lots of reasons. I'm gonna have to give you details if you want to understand. I'm from Goliath. Magic is par for the course there. But here, I had to start from the ground up. Even though most people have some experience with Elix, it's not enough for me to build on. They've only used it to make chems. <laughs> Good thing we banned that. True. The fact is, to do magic, you need mana. But people who know how to use that are far and few between. That's why I have a ton of work to do every day and not enough time to do it. So I would appreciate if you would get lost again. Okay, so she trains berserkers. So when I become a berserker, which is very soon, don't do anything oh, stupid here. Oh, look at all the chests in there. Look at all this loot, son. Hey, this shit ain't free. Bro, how, how do you even know? Caught? No, I know I'm not, not going to be caught. Take it easy. What do you want? Shh. You looking for something? Shh. Nailed it. I don't know how to. I don't know how to do this. There we go. Done. That was pretty tricky. That one. Lads, we are fucking nailing this. That 
that didn't work. That didn't work. That's it. Lads, I'm such a thief. That wasn't even locked. Not now. Can't do. Don't have the skill to do that chest. Watch out, Falk. Come on, we've got one more chest to do. This is this is professional thievery. Medium lock. This one's hard. That's it, done. Done it. Entire barracks cleared out. Let's just check we've... There's no pouches just lying about. I mean, there's a goblet here, which... Is a... Now mine. Shame I can't get into the safe. La da dee da 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 da. You saw nothing. Nothing at all. Right, okay, what we'll do is let's call an episode here. When we come back, we'll go and see Rat. See if we can join the Berserkers. And then that'll be awesome. We might get, if we get access to their magic, I think she's probably going to be the trainer for it, and I'd like to do that. I might, I, I might join the Berserkers. Um, like you say, we did go with the clerics, but I've never seen. I, this is the only faction I've seen. Jesus, where, where, where get everybody else behind? The area is so massive. I mean, this used to be Ignadon, didn't it? Interesting. I don't think the Berserkers are as bad in this as compared to Elex One. Right, lads, we'll call an episode there. See you in the next one. We'll see if we can join the Berserkers. Last episode, we did everything we needed to do to... I think we've got the Berserker's Trust. But we need to do one more test, and that's to go and see Rat and find out what he wants. Now, I'm interested in seeing what Rat's got to say for himself. Because we he knows me. And when I saw when I snuck into this area and saw him before, he, he um, said, Oh, you'll be okay if you pay me 100 gold. I paid him 100 gold and he kicked me out. What a mug. Now, does this guy say anything? No. I was there when we laid the foundations of Goliath and Edon. Those were the good old days, let me tell you. So you better show me some... Mm. Same shit. Well, let's go and see Rat. Yes, my lord. Alone? It seems Wolf the Guard helped him. That is very good to hear. Very nice. Tell the guards the upper district is open again. Very good, sir. Here he is, the man everyone's talking about. Welcome to my humble home. Now you're talking to us. So good to see you here at the fort. Doesn't even make any sense. You remember me? Of course. I'm sensing you don't remember me, though. I do? Let me help you out. In Logan's day, I was a nobody. Just another rat down in the dirt. It was you who helped me. Gave me the push I needed. When everything fell apart here, Logan and the other rats jumped ship. Not me, though. I was the one who stayed. I fixed the holes in the ship. And now, I'm the captain. But that was a long time ago. I suppose I can't blame you for forgetting me. I know exactly who you are. Fenris sent me to talk to you. You managed to get rid of that outlaw propaganda the Claws were spreading. That nuisance went on for far too long. 
To thank you for putting a stop to it, I'd like to give you a little money. Something to help you start a new life here. Uh, what about the money you've already took? Took off me? Hmm. I'll take the money. Later, I'll take all the money I can get. I can't say no to that. An excellent decision, my friend. I like to provide for the people I know I can count on. You know, should I ever need it. I, uh... And I know I can count on you. Now that I think about it, I could use your help right away. I've come across a prob... No. A challenge I could use your help with. How much money are we talking? What kind of challenge? I'm actually interested. What kind of challenge? I don't trust some of the individuals in the upper district. I try to look for the positives, but, well, there are limits. Two people in particular. Barrett the Trader and Ejnar the Trainer. Go and see him. Find out what you can. Can't be too cautious, especially since someone tried to kill me. A rat always has to make sure no one steps on him. And the bigger the rat, the bigger the danger. I need someone who isn't known here. Someone who can blend in. Who can be a simple worker or a merchant. And what exactly am I supposed to do with these two? Just talk to them. Get to know them. Find out what they're up to. Start badmouthing me. Difficult, I know, when I'm such a great <laughs> guy. Just see what they say. See if they like being berserkers. I'm sure you can figure it out. I need to know if I can trust him or not. We've got a deal. Sounds like we got a deal. I knew I could count on you. Off you go. You're a natural. You'll be fine. Rat's paranoia. So let's let's get more info on these guys. So these two, Barrett and Ejnar. Where do I find them? I think I've already met them. The upper district. It's not that big. You'll find them. Yeah, I want my deposit back, you bitch. I want my deposit back. <laughs> what are you talking about? You took it from me without permission. I want it back. This isn't the time to get greedy. You took my money. Is that not enough? Hmm, right. I don't know if I actually want to join the Berserkers. But I'll do this. I'll do this quest. Excellent. Excellent. Right now, what we can do is, remember, we've got a quest here for the claws. I've got to rob this guy. There's the chest I need to get to. What is the... It's a hard lock. So ideally, I need to get another point. I think I might spend my points to get... If I can get the ability to crack medium locks without any... Without any... Oh, we can go downstairs. Without any equipment. Once I put my equipment on, I'll be able to unlock hard locks. I think I want to go for that. Am I allowed down here? Energy cells. Bolts. Bolts. Money. Small cash box. Where's the good shit? Da, 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 da. Love that. In fact, I'll take everything. Wanna wipe your ass? Come see me. I got millions of toilet papers. I thought she said there was a something to because there's there's two items I need to get for the claws. One's in that chest up there. And she said there's another in the basement, but I'm not seeing. I'm not seeing it. Oh, yeah, here yeah, it is. No, nah. just can't do it's, that yet. It, it, these are these are top level. Top level things. I'm taking this guy's plates and forks and things. Go on. Good luck enjoying your meal. 
and eat it off the fucking wooden table. Okay, right, we need to level up hacking. We actually need to get both. I would like to find an item that boosts my hacking, so I don't need to spend the points in it. Because it, it requires a lot of, I think it was cunning. Okay, right, so Rat's Quest, what's going on here? Rat's Paranoia. Rat's Valuables. Yeah, 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 this is the one where I need to, I need to steal. Fair enough. So let's go and speak to these guys. Find out what they... What they think of Rat and the Berserkers. He's just a regular guard. I've got some questions for you. If you're after a free lesson, forget it. Hmm. A few questions about Rat. I want to ask you a few questions about Rat. Uh, okay. What do you think of him? Well, he's our leader, right? Not the question. Why are you asking me that? You fishing for information? I just thought we could have a little chat. About what? Oh, you know, about you. Do you like it here? If I... What's this about? What in Ra... The devil? What do you want from me? You're not answering my question. I... Well... Uh... Lothar! Stop him! What the fuck? Stop! Stay right where you are. Explain to me why Ejnar is running from you. What did you do to him? What the hell? Get out of my way. No. Not until you explain to me why our trainer is running from you. I won't ask again. I'm working for Rat. I was questioning Ejnar. He made a run for it, okay? Uh-huh. Anyone could say that. I barely know you. You're a punk bitch. Do you want me to tell Rat that you're Ejnar's accomplice? Oh, shit. Fine. Just don't make me regret this. Get out of my way. Oh, I may as well ask him this while I'm here. What do you know about Ejnar? No, not much. He's a trainer with the City Watch. What's going on here? Rat suspects Ejnar of being a spy. Apparently, he is. And I just helped him get away. Damn it! What a mess. You have any idea where he might have gone? Nah, no clue. He's been here for years, but as far as I know, he doesn't have any friends. Maybe you could search his things. He lives just around the corner. Hey, I'm sorry I treated you like a suspect. You will be. I'm gonna stick my sword up your ass. Well, the good news is, he's run away. Which means the thieves go and play. This guy's house is getting robbed. If this guy's innocent, I'm still taking all the stuff. Oh, it's not, it's not, it's not even stolen. No. It, it's free. It's free for everyone to take. Look, I've seen loot. Journal. Made of human skin. What the? I'm going crazy here. I have to write down my thoughts or I won't be able to stand it in this place any longer. I have no one to talk to. If there are any other Morcons here, it seems like they want nothing to do with me. I think I'm assimilating into Berserker society pretty well these days, but I don't like it. I haven't heard anything from the Grotto for more than a month now. Have they forgotten me? Second month with no contact. Why haven't they been in touch? I'm starting to get a bad feeling about this. I feel lost. I don't belong here. I can't even practice my rituals. Rituals? It would give me away immediately. Third month with no contact? Or is it the fourth already? I've been pretending to be a berserker for almost a year now, even managed to get housing in the upper district. I'm a good fighter. Ravak chose me for this mission. That's the word he said. He nearly came out and said that when we were talking to him. With good reason. I managed to convince the berserkers to let me train them, and that's how I won their trust. Without contact with my Morkon brothers, without my blood rituals, without Ravak, life is painful. Okay then. I must make sure to hide this book well so that no one finds it. For my part, I should probably forget it even exists. I wouldn't want anyone to find it and get suspicious. I found this book again after all these years, reading the lines I wrote so long ago as reopened old wounds. 
I had nearly forgotten that I was ever a Morcon, and I'm sure the Morcons have forgotten me. Maybe I should burn this book, finally deal the kill and blow to the Morcon in me. Rabak can kiss my ass. So he's not actually that bad. Looks interesting. So he's he's not he's he's happy being a berserker to be fair. Now wait there, where's this pointing me? Oh shit! What's this? Edgenar's probable location. Oh, this is cool. It's taking me to a new place. I like this. Right, here what we'll do. We'll speak to this girl and see what she is. She gonna do a runner as well? Not even her. I've never actually spoken to her. What do you want? Show me your where. You Bastard sword got good damage. Damn. Fifty-six and thirty years. No, it's not even that far to reach that. Iron shield. Large elect drink recipe. These are only a hundred gold. I might as well buy these recipes while I'm here. Medium elect drink. Mana portion. Plus a hundred mana. I'll spend that. Five hundred gold for this. Fuel. I don't know if I want to buy this. I hope she didn't disappear because I might lose that. That thing, right? I'm going to... Accept trade, 300 gold. A good deal. How do you like it with the berserkers? <sighs> By the pilgrim's beard. Rat sent you, huh? <laughs> Is that obvious? That obvious. Ah, uh, you ain't the first. You even know why he's got a problem with me? Didn't think so. Let's hear it then. I'm an emissary from Goliath. Ragnar sent me here to get equipment to the guards. Means I don't pay shit in taxes to Rat, and that slimy bastard can't stand it. I can believe that. He's dying to get dirt on me. Anything to get me kicked out of Goliath. He ain't getting nothing, spineless dipshit. So you go back and tell that ugly scumball that I ain't going nowhere. I'm going Fucking to vermin. Lives I agree. to his name. Yeah, I think Rat's a bit of an asshole. I mean, I didn't, I didn't really like him in the first time. I mean, he made us a lot of money, but uh, that's that's a separate. Oh look, his ladder's over there. Why would there be ladders? Are you okay? What are you doing? I'm having your crystal, bruh. Tell you what, let's, let's speak to this guy because I've stole all that, all the, them things for him at the end of the uh, last episode. M maybe I've got them all already. No, I don't. Hold on a second while we're here. Oh. The last thing I need to do is hack this. Not now. You looking for something? Not possible. It's okay. That's you another quest we can't yourself, do yet. Okay? Wait, what I'm gonna do is, we're gonna go and find this guy over there. We're gonna go on an adventure. I, I really wanna do this. Big berserker. We're gonna go here. Boom. But first off. Let's go and see if we can get level 2 lockpicking, which means we'll have maximum lockpicking. I have to go. Because we've got a, an item that boosts it. That's exactly what I want to do. 
Because if we're going out on a journey, I want to be able to lockpick everything we find. And also, we've also put lots of chests on the map. That we found but couldn't unlock previously. This is going to be good, baby. I've got plenty of points as well. This, this is why I like to save points. In, when I played Elex 1, I saved quite a lot of points. But that just meant that whenever I want to get something, I can just get it straight away. Instead of having to wait for a level up. Because level ups are pretty, pretty hard to get. Like it takes a while. I want you. Right. So what do I need for this? I need 35 decks. So ideally, I only need 30 decks because I've got the the amulet on, and 30 intelligence. Right. Okay. Okay. Dex is 22. Bonus plus five. Hold on, I don't know how this works. Does this does this take into account? It takes into account. Oh, that's good. That's good. So uh, when that says 35, that's actually when we're good. So that okay, okay, right, we're with it. Boom. Thirty-five decks, thirty intelligence. I want you. Thirty-five decks, thirty intelligence. Let's go, baby. Five hundred gold, bargain. We've got level three lock picking now, effectively. This requires, see this requires far too much cunning, so I'm not, I'm going to wait till I find an item with that on before I can do the level 2 hacks. Just fair enough. Trusted? Advocate? Nah. Pickpocket? Nah. 50 into, ah oh, nah, we're not spending anything on that. Right, let's go baby. We're ready. We're going on an adventure. Oh, we've got enough jetpack fuel, we can boost straight out of that. Now actually we can, f oh we can fast travel here. Although... This is Bastion, tell you what we'll do. I'm going to go to Bastion, I want to travel south because there's a building there and there's a building there. And then once we reach there, We'll go directly that way. That is a plan and a half, that. And I've already unlocked this chest, so take that away. Boom. We've got chests here as well. Let's go and get this chest. Might be some good loot. Oh yeah, I remember this. Baby lads, want to get some awesome loot here. Well, we better. I missed these. Hard lock. See what we'll do. We'll save this because this this is gonna be this is actually gonna be hard to do. It can't be this easy, can it? It actually was. It, all the way to the end, all the way back. Open. Damage, slaughter axe. Lifeblood, elixir. Yellow gemstone. I mean, it wasn't... Not great. Right, let's take that off the map. These are hacking. Now, we might be able to do the hacks as well, actually. Because we've got level 1 now. Lads, I love finding loot. There's just nothing better. Oh! Oh my god, it's, oh, that was lucky. 
Oh, hello. It was definitely in here, I remember it. Here it is. Nice. Do you know what I want? I want some armor. Like if I can get some leg armor. I've already got chest armor, which we found uh, either last episode or the episode before. Right. Something is greater than something. Five is greater than four, which is great. Five is greater than four, which is greater than... One, which is less than two. Five is correct, but we don't know where it is yet. Okay. Well, at least we know four, one, and two aren't in it. Eight is greater than seven, which is greater than five, which is less than nine. Okay. Seven is greater than six, which is greater than five. Five is less than six. No, no, wait there. I've tried six. Seven is greater than six. But there has to be seven, eight, five, and six. How the fuck? Eight is greater than seven. It can't be. Okay, okay, okay. Wow. Ah. Eight's, eight's going to be on the end. Be seven is greater than six. Is greater than five, which is less than eight. <sighs> Last chance. So it's five and what else have we used? Seven is greater than five, five is greater than zero. Bang. I'm in. I keep forgetting zeros there. Ooh. Damaged chain sword. Damn, look at the stats! If I, if I upgrade this to regular chains, if we find three of these, we can make this 181 damage. Are you crazy? Plus 10 strength. Plus 10 maximum stamina. That, that, that is good. I lose 5 dexterity. Do I even need... Do I need that? Question. If I take this stat thing off, do I lose the ability to lockpick level 2? Maximum stamina is excellent. Two out of three lockpicking. I don't think we lose it. That's we don't lose it. You can use modifiers to get skills you want and then just take it off. Oh, that's awesome. That is awesome. Right, one more to get over here. Hello. If I can get out. It, 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 that, that's a hard hack. Fair enough. We'll leave that one there. Okay, so what we're doing is we're actually traveling south here. We're going to go to... Oh, we can go here, actually. 
It's not the it's not the way I was actually planning on going, but we might as well since we've got a chest a uh, safe to hack. That is just too good. It's too good. Dead. Oof. Ooh, that hits hard. Oh, shit, the bed. What's going on here? Berserker dead. Bloody burger. Crossbow. I think yeah, I'm going to invest in the create weapon skill. Actually, mm. I, I think I've got enough uh, stats oh, as well. Yeah. Oh, I remember being here. Got them horrible creatures outside. I don't know where the front door is. Must be in this room. There it is. Not oh, bad. no, we can do it. We're being attacked, apparently. Even though we're not. Something is less than something. Oh, it's going to be like... One is less than two, which is less... Less than three. Can't be that. It's less than four, which is greater than three. Oh my god, we got a first try. Bastard sword. Good shit. That was a nice find. I'll tell you what we could do. We, there's, there's so much to explore. Lads, there's either houses here. What do you think we should do? I think we should go... I think we should continue directly south. I'll put that map marker there just so it's on the on the quest. And we're just gonna go south if I can see. This way. Look at all these runes. I'm getting to be a professional with this jetpack. Oh, there's no items here. Actually, no items. Nah, that's too much for this one. Who said that? There's enemies here. My problem. The He's friendly. Hello? Really? That's so. Ain't got the time for you right now. Vandal. Not again. Oh, these are Morcons. That's not the story I heard. I don't have time for you right now. Oh, shit. The cheater becomes the cheated. Not my problem. Yeah, they seem to be pretty hospitable. That would take I'm allowed all that shit. Are you sure? Oh, what is this bad boy? Look at this weapon. That's just rude. Yeah, that's stealing. She's not happy about that. Danka. But I gotta admit, you Danka got shot. guts. Pretty ballsy to wander around a Morcon outpost like you own the place. 
I do. Aren't you scared, kid? Should I be? Should I be? Let's just say it's lucky for you I'm not hungry. What are you on about? Oh, not the cannibals. I'm a Morcon, right? Everyone knows we eat children and defile corpses. No? Not ringing any bells? Not familiar with that. Never mind then. Wasting my time. You got some shit going on with your armpit though. <laughs> What's going on with your armpit, Pat? What is this place? Oh, well this is an ancient old world burial site. I'm joking. Look around. It's an outpost, dumbass. Used for all kinds of things, but mainly an early warning system for the grotto. Anyone stupid enough to try to attack us will know about it. Gives us time to beef up our defenses. Okay, cool. That's what the, the notepad said. Can you sell me some good? No. You no, can't. I can't. I'm not Bruh. a merchant. I just make sure everyone in camp has everything they need. I divide up the rations, replace blunt weapons with sharp ones, stuff like that. My weapon's blunt. My weapon's blunt. Huh, sure. That's what everyone says. I'm serious. You couldn't slice butter with this thing. Okay, let's say for argument's sake, I believe you. Still can't give you a new weapon unless Tengus approves it. Tengus. Besides, you're not even assigned to this outpost, so your chances are precisely zero. Anything else I can do for you? Well, you're overall pretty fucking useless, aren't you? Is there no way I can buy anything from your stockpile? What part of no chance don't you get? Unless you have something really convincing up your sleeve, you're out of luck, kid. I got a big dick. Ten shards. Would this do the trick? <laughs> nope. Hmm. I don't fucking care. She's just already got shit stuff anyway. Right. What's going on here? Stealing. Let let the thievery commence. What do you think about that? You've got some nerve. Hi. What, what about this? Oh, what are you gonna do? I'm stealing all your shit. Give it a rest. Okay, we're not allowed that. That's the gods. Can't do anything wrong. These aren't named people. Yeah, I don't think there's much going on here. We'll probably have to fight these guys later if we go on the wrong side of them. Right, well that was uh, interesting. What is to the northeast? <sighs> I'd already forgotten about it again. If I don't get a handle on it, that thing is going to happen to me. Teleporter, baby. This is exactly what we need. Watch out! What's fighting us? What the hell's this? Oh, it's a it's a fucking air lurker. I don't I don't like I don't fuck about with things that fly. No thanks. Get inside, get inside, get inside, bruh. Uh, these guys are pretty troublesome. This air lurk has fucked my deal up like. Oh, what the fuck's that? Where's the Big Joe? Big John, whatever he's... It's so good. Oh, look at this guy. How fast this fucker? I'm hiding here. Is your car old or broken? Oh, what the fuck? Scrap dealer. We have deals, 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 and we're as honest as the day is long. Let us shredder and 
burn some cheddar. Fuck, I'm stuck. I can't get out the fucking way. What's happened, lads? I'm stuck in the roof. I've just, I've just phased it. Oh my god, this is fucking wild. Where's, where's Joe? Whatever he's called. Wow. Shit's insane. Right, we're not tell you what we're not we're not going in there, this is a fucking joke. That thing is a that thing is 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 crazy. See ya. I hate flying creatures. Why the fuck did they put them in the game? Is that still hunting me? No, it's this thing. It wouldn't kill this. This, this thing's not even that hard. Maybe it is. with the creatures in this area I, I fucking hate it I ah, fuck these guys ah, 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 we're, just, we're just playing running man here rocket man running man so yeah yeah fuck fuck these creatures it's crazy this is like a massive oh what the f that was easy It was a bird. Over there. The kick is the best thing in the game. It's instant stagger. Dead albs, these are the first albs we've seen. There's a bed there. Don't know how that's exactly going to help me. How did I not die? I wonder what's in this collapsing building. Lots of shit. Don't know whether it's gonna be good or not. Oh, what is that? I thought it was a massive gun. It was a carton of cigarettes. The biggest carton of cigarettes you've ever seen. There's a way in this building, I just can't see how. There's like items inside. Found it. Something's going ape shit. Nice shot.
Enroll yourself and loved ones to our aptitude tests. Infinite skies, yeah. The thing is that, that that's what happened in the first game. Everyone was there. Um, the the people who got off the planet using the infinite skies. They were the rocket leaving leaving this this planet for whatever reason. And the rocket was Kalan, worshipped by the the clerics. Even though the people knew it wasn't a god, it was a fucking rocket made by infinite skies. There's nothing in here at all. I thought there would at least be some good, good shit here. I suppose we got some money. Money's always good. I, I don't complain about money. I think... Like, the items in Elex 1 weren't that good. Like, there was no point in really... Like, you couldn't really buy anything good. You found everything. But I think with this, money seems to have a, a lot more use. Because you can... I've noticed you can buy some good stuff from merchants. Okay. Let's make a beeline to the quest. I think we've seen pretty much everything here. Is that an enemy on the floor? What is this? Broken stop sign. God, what the fuck? Something just pile driving is. What the f fuck is that? I just got pile driver from Norway. John Cena from the top rope. Man, the, 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 why are we even here? Is this 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 is far too high level for me? We're gonna get there though. But today I think we're just gonna use the jetpack. I see items. I hear creatures. Probably gonna get fucking pile driver, John Cena style. At least we've got cover from these walls. Right, that that was good. That was good. We we maintained cover there. Don't mind fighting one or two jackals, but these flying fox. Look, something's chasing him. <laughs> something's chasing Falk. What the fuck? Yeah, whatever's chasing him is not giving up. It's still cold. Yeah, that thing is. That, well, let's fight it. It's not gonna stop, is it? A lurker. <laughs> Go on, hit it. Hit it, hit it. Hey, I'm, I'm. It went wild. What's going on? Fucking see ya! Oh, to the base plant. I'll tell you what though, we're where we're supposed to be. Seems to be infested by rats.
Oh, this is easy, this. That's more, that's more my level. 10 XP. Not long enough to kill this. Oh my god, this motherfucker's back. We need help. What are these? What the fuck am I looking at? Yo, they don't look they don't look friendly like. Oh they're robots. Lackeys. Are these the new clerics? I like how the have you noticed the the enemies didn't walk follow us in here? Because they would have gotten destroyed by a mech warrior there. Okay. Oh, we'll go, we'll go inside to find out what's going on here. This does remind me of Ignodon. But it, it can't be, it's in the wrong place. Yeah, Ignodon's over here. It's very similar. Or whatever we're looking for, we've missed it. Stop! You're standing in front of the Holy Grotto of Ravak, the oh, god well. of oblivion. What's your business here? I seek oblivion. Holy? It's a hole. You know that, right? Watch your tongue, boy. Or should I cut it out? Ease up, okay? He doesn't know the rules. Let's start again. What do you want here? Answer or leave? Looks like he's in a lot of BDSM with all that leather and shit. I want to come inside. Let in a stranger? Don't make me laugh. You should advise. Nothing more. You're a stranger. Why should we let you in? Do you know what awaits you in here? No easy life. We're Morcons. Our life is hard. Work is our way. Work and pain. Oh, sounds sounds great. Sounds a uh, fucking what, what, sign me up. Sign me up twice. Work and pain. Oh, yes. No. What kind of work? What kind of work? I get some money. Anything that needs to be done. Oh my god, this guy's so like. No, no, I hate fuckers that don't answer questions. Like, oh, what kind of work? Uh, just any any work, anything that can do. Well, be more specific, you fucking bell end. I'm not afraid of hard work. Easy to say, harder to prove. Understand this: if you enter and we don't like what you do, you will not leave. Is that a challenge? I'll take the risk. Good. You may pass. Do you really intend to let him pass? What is wrong with you? That's not your decision to make. Bring him to Khan. He should decide. Eh, good idea. You stay beside me, got it? Follow me. Khan. Right, let's scope the place out as well, because I can see... Okay, I don't think Marat can hear us anymore. Which means, no more pointless bickering. I'm not taking you to Khan. I only said that to shut Marat up. I'm Dimitri, by the way. Now listen, if you really want to stay here, there's a few things you should know. Mm-hmm. Such as? Such as it's a fucking bad idea for you to run around on your own down here. If someone doesn't tell you the rules, then you will get in serious trouble. So that's what I'm gonna do. Khan can wait. This guy seems okay. Come on then. 
See that big passageway up ahead? One level below us? Behind it is Ravak's Cathedral and the Blood Cistern. Only the higher-ups are allowed you to pay homage there to Ravak and his eternal oblivion. You shouldn't even try to get to the Cathedral. If you want in, you'll have to join us or make one hell of an impression on Khan. Let's move on. Still lots to see. We're just about to enter the War District. That's where we poachers have our cages for bringing new recruits into Morkon society. You joined up voluntarily. Otherwise, you'd probably be in there with the prisoners. Besides the cages, there's also the arena. You can see that later. You sound like the clerics. So weird. I'm just stealing stuff as I go. <laughs> Watch out for the guards. Not all of them are happy to let you go from one district to another. So just watch yourself, okay? Can I fight in the arena too? Even though you're not a Morricon, you mean? Hmm. It's very unusual. But the arena master is just over there. We can go ask him. I like the idea of an arena. If say yes, do me a favor and don't do it now. We haven't got the time. If you get killed in the arena, I'll have to explain it to Khan somehow. I'll wait here for you. I don't think you fought in the arena yet. It's true, but my will is unbroken. I want to get out of here. This is the arena then? Yeah, yeah, but are you... I'm gonna go and do a spot on a bitch. Have Arms dealer. May you find oblivion. This guy has seen better days, hasn't he? Weapons, ammunition, whatever you need. We stock them all. Show me what... No. Oh. No. Stranger. I'm a stranger. He's not going to do anything. What a cocksucker. It makes you wonder how many people once lived here. It's a big place. How, how have they even got this? Did they dig this out themselves? Medium bag of Alexit. It would be rude not to. Chest. Easy lock. <laughs> I think I will. This guy's giving me the tour and I'm robbing I'm robbing him blind on the tour. What I'm, I'm my god my character's so good. I mean nothing too spectacular about it. It's funny. Are you the arena? Attila the Hun. Look at this! I don't believe it! An outsider in our grotto? <laughs> I don't know about that. It's true, is it not? The world out there really has lost its reason. I bet you've come a long way. What are you doing here? It's my job to test anyone who wants to leave the grotto. Test? Most of them have never been to the surface. Not like you have. Gotta make sure they're ready for the dangers out there. That's what the arena's for. And they fight there against your prisoners? What? No. The prisoners are all to be new followers of Ravak. We use creatures in the arena. Oh, I was hoping to fight humans. Anyone who beats them gets to leave the grotto. And if they fail? Then they stay here where it's safer for them. That's assuming the creatures don't kill them, of course. Which is what happens most of the time. So what are you doing here? Dimitri told me about the arena. He should be keeping watch, not telling damn stories. It's me who decides who fights in the arena. You don't need your skills tested, though. You came from outside. You already know the dangers. So, why should I let you fight? I want money. Is there a prize? If you want to win shards, then this isn't the place for you. The arena isn't for entertainment. If that's what you're looking for, go find Gosta in the cellar. He also cares nothing for honor or glory. So in the arena you can't win anything? You win experience and respect. Also, you can keep the possessions of the Fallen. We waste nothing here. But 
We have no fights happening right now. Not enough creatures. Venya's people usually catch the beasts. But they must be having problems since they haven't brought us any new ones. Come back later if you want to know more. Okay. Dimitri must be waiting for you. And I hate to leave the gate unguarded. May Ravak be with you. A pretty cool place there, so they must have two arenas. Oh, look what I see. Two seconds before I steal this. Wait for it. You shit yourself? Why your squad? <laughs> shit, shit myself. Where are we going? You shit yourself? Why your squad? Does this guy got eagle eagle version? Who's who's looking at us? I can I can I get it anymore? Got it. Oh, I got it. <laughs> Cocky. Flip. Right. Okay. I got it. I got it without being seen. <laughs> right. Where's uh, Dimitri? Dimitri. And you think that's enough? Would you like to go bowling? There you are. Can we? Let's move on. Sure thing. I'll wipe the floor with those animals. You have strong lungs. Finally, we get to the heart of the grotto. The residential district is a holy place for many of us. A place of tranquility, contemplation, and Stealing? Drinking. <laughs> Oh, drinking. I thought you meant stealing. We don't relax often, but when we do, it's in the cellar with Gusta. <sighs> I see fuel. Not being funny, right? But these guys have got the best castle. No one's getting in here, are they? Where the fuck? Where's 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 Big D gone? Oh, here he is. The, the, this guy is taking me to some somewhere around. He's taking me to the dungeon. Besides the residential district, there's also the quartermaster's district and trader's district. Who knows how calm will react to you? Take this opportunity to buy a few things. You might not get another chance. I suggest you talk to Tengus. He might allow you to trade here. Then your journey won't have been for nothing. Okay then. You really all live down here? Eh, you get used to it. And it's safe. But watch out for the tunnels at the back. They're old and in danger of collapsing. I wouldn't have thought you'd have a bar here. You mean the cellar? Yeah, as long as the goddamn resistors don't try to get it closed down. It's a good place, and its owner, Gosta, is a useful man to know. So where's your quartermasters? Are you blind? Just over there. Come with me. Talk to Tengus. He decides who can and can't trade here. What do you want? The fuck, but Luga. Don't let your kind in here. Hey, or get out! You won't get a single shard from me. I haven't asked for one. Come on, tell me what you want. What I want? Blood or sweat. What? That's what you can pay me in. So, which is it gonna be? Ball sweat, I'll pee in ball sweat. Blood? You mean I have to kill someone? No. Just a duel. No killing. Against you? Well, it's that or you pay in sweat. What does that mean? Work. So, 
What's it gonna be? Same for me. <laughs> Is he your master, or are you here by chance? We are cooperating in the spirit of friendship, if that helps. Exactly. It does not. But you may both enter if your friend meets my requirements. What is your decision? Blood. Blood. I'll fight you. You promised me blood, remember? Now it's time to pay up and do it gladly. Endure and earn back some respect. Run and you'll never have any. But it's gonna be a hard fight. I'm ready. Then come at me. Are you guys gonna stop this uh. in? Oh my god, this guy's got infinite health. What's up with you? What the fuck? Go on, hit him. It didn't help that he's fucking phasing in out of fucking time. Okay, that 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 didn't fucking go to plan like. Right, I didn't want to fuck that. Was remarkable. Fucking blood or sweat. This guy's hard. I don't think. Talk to Tengus. He decides right. who can and can't let's, trade here. Let's not do this yet. I can beat him. I'm probably going to beat him. I just got to get the parry timing right because he's got massive delayed attacks. Wait, hold on. Right, I know he's there. Let's let's not fucking talk to this prick. Where's uh, this guy that I need to speak to? Each man gets one ration a day. But Master Tengus, that's just not enough. Perhaps you'd rather eat nothing at all. Forgive me, Master I. Never question me again. Yes, praise be to Ravok. And blessed be the balance, yeah, yeah. Go on, get out of here. Tengus? Tengus Khan? May Oblivion find you, stranger. I see you've traveled a great distance to be here. What do you want? My approval? All I want is to be able to trade. And why should I let you do that? <laughs> An outsider. This guy's got cool armor, though. Believer. You won't get anything here without my say so. Not a job, not a crumb of bread. No exceptions? You're an uninvited guest in our home. You'll have to give me a reason to help you. Uh. Yeah, give me a job. Maybe there's something I can do for you. You do something for me? You have a job. <laughs> I am the master of steel. Whatever I want, I have made. And anything I lose, I can have found. Guess I'd better be going then. Wait. Are you a man of war? Yes, I am the god of war. Of course. I thought so. Now listen. Until you've been given permission to stay, you will not be allowed to trade, and you will not waste any more of my time. We'll see if circumstances change. Now leave. Yeah, that armor is cool as fuck. I don't know about the spine hanging out of his chest like, but uh, it looks pretty cool. So what's what 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 what, what do you say? May you f I'll go back to the tour. Let's get this tour over with and we'll call it an episode and then wow this place is fucked up. How did things go with Tengus? Did you get your trading permit? Nope, not yet. Mm, thought not. If everything goes well with Khan, you'll have enough time later to convince him. Let's keep moving. Don't worry. I'll convince Khan to let you stay. Let's go and see him then. Stay close to me. I'm already friends with everybody, as you can tell. Need to know. You don't speak unless Khan speaks to you. Understand? You got it. <sighs> don't tell me that. Lads, I want to back chat this guy. I can't even help it. Actually, can't even help it. 
He's going to be talking to them. I'm just going to interrupt him. What are you doing here, Dimitri? You'd better have a good reason for leaving your post. I need to talk to Khan. But the Great Khan doesn't want to talk to you. This stranger is asking for refuge. Hmm. Interesting. Morat and I both think he'd make a good Morcon. We've lost a lot of people recently. We need good new replacements. And he came here voluntarily, you say? Yes. That's unusual. Khan will consider your request. The stranger can stay here until Khan has made his decision. He should return tomorrow and await Khan's judgment. You get all that? Yeah. Come back tomorrow. Why didn't he tell me that himself? It's the rules. As a Morcon, I'm superior to you. And also responsible for you. It's a privilege to speak with the voice of Khan. And an even bigger one when Khan addresses you personally. So, you heard him. Any more questions? Yeah, why didn't Khan speak himself? Is, is, he, is he like telepathic or something? Why doesn't Khan speak himself? Khan is a resistor, and he takes his devotion to oblivion, to the void. I guess you'd say nothingness? Very seriously. He holds his tongue as a sign of his absolute devotion to the silence of Ravak. Sounds a little over the top. You think that's over the top? There have been followers of Ravak who have taken their own lives to be one with the void. To die is to rejoin the purity of the oblivion. Idiots. <laughs> Does that mean you all want to die? Of course not. Just realize that no one is expected to devote themselves to Ravak as much as Khan does. All that is expected of an ordinary Morkhan is that they honor the balance. Speaking little or seeking the peace of death is honorable, but we're still people with free will. But if you want people here to respect you, you have to prove you also champion the will of Ravak. Oh, and don't forget to check in with Khan once in a while. If you really can't wait, you can pass the time in the cellar. Or just sleep. <laughs> I'm busy already. Good, good. Then I can leave you alone with a clear conscience. Marat's probably complaining already. I better get back. You'll find me at the gate if you need me. See ya. Do I actually like this faction? I think they'll, don't get me wrong, I think they're all a bunch of twats. But, I mean, they've got a cool base. Got pretty cool armor. Am I allowed in here? I'm gonna get it wrong for being in here. Now. You better Sorry. get out of here. Sorry, sorry. About time. Good. Also, Khan does have a voice. Let me save it here and have a word with this guy. Watch this. We're just gonna break all the rules straight away. <laughs> he just went. <laughs> oh, you must be the outsider Dimitri spoke of. Look, I. Enough. I don't want to hear from you. The Great Khan will decide your future. Once it is decided, I will find you and deliver his... Okay. And, and what about... Right, so what we'll do is we'll rest. We'll rest and we'll go and see them. But what we'll do is we'll call an episode here. Pretty interesting. Now, this is, this is only the second faction we've come across. I've never seen the Albs. I've never seen the Clerics. I've never seen the... Outlaws yet. Cool, cool, cool. I, I like it. Anyways, I actually quite like it here. I think they sound pretty fucking crazy with their, their devotion to death and all that shit, but uh, I mean, I can work with that. This guy. God's going wild. Right, lads, we'll call it episode there and I'll see you in the next one when we'll. I'll explore this place thoroughly. I want to see if I can beat that guy. Although he's got infinite health, I think I might be able to cheese him with the kick because the kick's so overpowered. You can kick, hit, kick, hit. I don't think they can break it. If I can parry him, I can get him down. It might take a while, but. I want to kill this guy fair and square. See you in the next one, lads. So, last episode was a weird turn of events. We've found or stumbled upon another faction, which actually we we, we, we were taken here via trying to get into the Berserkers, which, which we still haven't found the guy. Supposed to be a guy here. Edgenor's probable location. Maybe he's outside the gates, which I've missed him. We'll have to explore. Unless it's underground. 
No, I don't think it is. I'm gonna have to explore this area, but saying that. This guy's having a having a whale of a time. He's absolutely buzzing this guy. Right, wait there. I do wanna to speak to What's this book? Greasy notebook. Right, we don't need that yet. That's probably a quest item. There was a guy somewhere here. That we could fight. I've actually lost my way around here. Jagon. Now wait there. Did we walk through here? Yes. I want to fight this guy. I think I can beat him. It might take a while because I don't do massive damage. What are you? Want? Right, let's get through this, guys. Um, you're not going to get a single shot. He beat me last episode. Blood. Blood. We're going to duel this guy. Now I'm going to try and um, use my technique. I'll fight you. I'm ready. Right. Does that, do, I don't, does that do damage? I don't know if that fist does damage or not. Somebody call the Undertaker. Shit. Get in close and hit him hard. Oh look, he's nearly dead. How the fuck did I do that much damage to him? You think you can win with that? Oh, you just gonna knock him down? Got him. That was remarkable. Oh my god, I actually killed him. See? Much better. See? Much better. Nobody has ever beaten me in a duel before. Ravok's name, who are you? I am the god of war. Name's Jax. <laughs> I never heard of you. Now I will never forget you. You've won my respect, Jax the Outsider. You will always be welcome here. Good. Ghosta will serve you right away. May Oblivion find you. <laughs> Batluga, you just got your shit pushed in, mate. I broke my foot off in your ass. Do you have anything else besides guarding the cellar? I pray to Rava can try to strengthen my spirit. I also teach pain, but you know that already. There are just too many who want to escape pain. Suffering is a necessary experience. But if your question is about the practical aspects of my work, I'd be happy to share my expertise. He's a trainer. Teach me something about fighting. I'd be happy to. This guy is training us and we don't even need to be part of these guys. So he teaches the standard stuff. Which I don't really... What's this? Stamina. Need 30 constitution for that, which we don't have. And that's it. Fair enough. Cool, that's cool. Right, here we'll go in the cellar because... Did they not say there was beds down here? Can't keep your mouth hey. shut. Do you... Uh, have a few shards to spare for me? Why? What do you need them for? Just thirsty. Is all. Got dust in my lungs. Go on then. Here, take these. <laughs> Thanks. That's that's good of you. Now the day looks a little less bleak. What are these guys doing? These slaves. Impressive. That was impressive. Are these guys slaves down Smelled here? Like trouble. He's taking the piss out of me. This is a fucking bar. We should clean up our own house first. I guess you could see it that way. You've got These your ears everywhere. Non-named people. They just threw them out of the city. Gosta. So you made it past Batulga, huh? Welcome to the cellar, where only the alcohol counts. Here, this one's on the house. Thanks. If you want anything else. Just holler. Holler for a dollar. I don't serve piss here. Just the finest hooch from the hands of our dead enemies. 
Is everyone treated so well here? Of course! The best wares bring the best customers, as I always say. Not every innkeeper can say that with a straight face. Nobody here keeps a tab. So, the guy at the door was an exception, right? How so? He was asking for shards. Is that right? I'll deal with that right away. Hmm. Right, so. Now this is our chance, right? Well, he leaves. Let's... Off the stool, scum. You have no business here. Get there's lost. A, there's a massive chest yeah, in there. Just fuck off already. He's going to want to have a word with that guy out there, right? No skulking around. Around. Ugh, I'm not gonna waste my breath. Let's get this guy. I actually fucked up there, like. Yeah, I annoyed them too much. So it doesn't look as if we can get in there because because everyone sees us. Oh, we'll go and follow this guy. Oh, he's got a shotgun. Well, somebody's got to take care of the idiots. Still, just as many of those cutthroats. They just threw him out. Of you the selling to my customers? No, no, I. Looks like Batulg is getting sloppy. Best remind him of his duties and introduce you to each other. You know the rule: no shards, no seller. I'll be sorted soon. Promise. You'll be a bloody pulp soon. Get out of here, you fucking parasite! Can't keep your mouth shut. We're only gonna make things it. worse. That damn beggar's back. How did they even let beggars in here? You've got your ears everywhere too. Somebody's gotta take care of the idiots. Uh, don't worry about it. I hate beggars. Those low lifes have no business in my cellar. Eh, what have I got to be upset about? You want to buy something? What are you buying? What are you selling? I need information. Ah, then you've come to the right place. The only small problem is that talking gives me such a dry mouth. Of course, I'd love to just help myself to a drink, but I wouldn't be able to stay in business if I did. There's a rat what in mean? your kitchen, mate. I'm watching you it as we speak. Payment. To the point, huh? Then, yes, some small remuneration is required. Gotta make a living after all, and times are hard. How much? Cheer up though, first one's for free. How can I earn a few shards? You're looking at your answer. Uh, I'm not sure I'm cut out for bar work. <laughs> Not what I had in mind. You're a hatchet man. You got in a fight with Patuga after all. So how about taking part in my little contests? All you need is guts and some shards for your wager. And this is all legal, right? Legal? I hope of this is a fight course. Course. Absolutely. Just a harmless way to let off some steam. And nobody needs to know if a few shards change hands, do they? We could make some good money here. How did you come to have an inn? The cellar ain't just any old inn. But how I came by it is a long story. Could give you the shortened version if you're really interested. I'm all ears. Okay. Well, I inherited the cellar from my father, Ravak bless Yours his soul. Ravak's the god. Back then, he was a thorn in the resistors' side. When the dispute between the poachers and the resistors worsened, there was a change of thinking. In what way? Let's just say alcohol is good for more than just wrecking your liver. It can take the edge off pain. So what? Well, 
Pain features pretty heavily in the Resistor's punishments. Haven't you heard of the Blood Cistern and the Tormentors? Nope. If not, then lucky for you. Not every Morcon who claims to serve Ravak can cope with torture without something to lessen the agony. The Resistors know that. That's why they turn a blind eye to booze. Don't practice what you preach, as the saying goes, I think. And all of this so the poachers don't go to the barricades. I see. Then what? Well, rowdy drunks are just as dangerous as a couple of troublemakers. So I devised a clever system to keep some order. But Tulga... Isn't that bad for business? Not at all. But Tulga makes sure that only those with deep pockets are welcome in the cellar. <laughs> Alexit has a nasty habit of disappearing out of the pockets of those who don't know how to defend themselves. True. The system works for me. Yeah, some scum slips through here and there, but Batulga is always happy to take out the trash. Okay. Who's fighting in the contests? <laughs> nice try. Wait <laughs> first. Yeah, so you can't... You... I need to bet before I know my opponent? Yeah, of course. Where's the excitement otherwise? Soon as I see your stake, I'll tell you a bit about your opponent. Interesting. Just tell me when you're ready. I like this. Right, I'm not ready to fight yet. I need information. What do you want to know? Remember to put a few shards on the table first next time. My mouth gets... What's the word in the grotto? 20 shards. I don't really care about that. What do you have to offer? What do you have? Take he just sells potions and shit. Okay, right, let's say um, I think we're going to bet on ourselves here. I've heard that before. Right, I'm ready to fight. I'm ready to fight. I'll bet maximum amount of shards. That's what I'm talking about. How many shards are you going to wager? As much as I've got. 250. All in. I'm all in. <laughs> You're not messing around, are you? I like your style. Your first opponent's Dixon. Former outlaw. A lucky catch, if you ask me. Knows a thing or two about manhunting. Broke his arm, though, and we didn't have any quack salvers, so it healed badly. Doubt will give you much trouble. Already beat your doorman. I imagine I want to be able to kill everybody here. Where is he? Where can I find Dixon? If he ain't just outside, he'll be in the war district. Just head up the steps towards the arena. You can't miss it. Okay, Dixon. We should clean up our own house first. So next to the arena. Oh, where the hell is that? This place is a maze. Did we walk through here? This does not look familiar. I have got a fucking clue where I am. Ah, well why don't we just look on the map? Nobody's on the map. The war district. Need to put up some fucking signage around here, that looks the same. You, come here and state your purpose. <laughs> no one assignment came from up top. I have an important assignment. Came from up top. You can't fool me with lies. If I wanted to swallow bullshit, I'm quite capable of feeding myself. <laughs> I know you don't belong here. I can smell an outsider from three tunnels Must away. Must be your upper lip, son. Tell me. What is the general situation beyond the grotto's gates? 
Magalon's under assault from an advanced alien race. Yes. We've seen the Dark Towers. The intruders will be dealt with when the time comes. You're Jax, right? The outsider I've heard so much about. The former Alp Commander who ended the war between the Free People and the Alps. Well educated. Oof, you have quite a reputation there. Knowing all that, I'm surprised you'll even tolerate me being here. No, you're not the powerful leader of the Free People you once were. Your word carries little weight now. But perhaps there's still a use for you. I didn't get this far by discarding all but the most effective tools. I see immense destructive potential in you, just waiting to be unleashed. Maybe you can give me a glimpse of what you're truly capable of. Did you know some Morkons slaughtered the Berserkers at the World Heart to the west? Oh, did they now? I assume that's Dragon and his band of infidels. Forget him. He's an unbeliever who puts material wealth above all else. The worthless scum that follow him only do so as long as they're paid. One day he'll wake up with a knife in his back. Well, they, they're not real no one here will be surprised or particularly bothered. I strongly suggest you adopt the same attitude towards him. Nice. You're a Morcom patriarch? Victor is the only name I go by. Grandiose titles are like bad prostitutes. Use them once and you're stuck with something unpleasant for life. <laughs> Sticky Vicky. This world is a festering cesspit. We weren't put here to make a mark in the filth. Our role is only to ensure that the eternal silence returns. Never forget that. You're preparing for a large-scale conflict, right? We have a sacred mission to fulfill. All our efforts must be focused on improving our military capabilities. We have no place for those too weak. Too indecisive to embrace our vision. The tormentors will see to that. What does this sacred mission entail? Alb and outlaw scum to the north, berserkers and clerics to the west. All festering sores on our world, pestilent growths that plague our existence. Plagues must be eradicated. They must not be allowed to spread. That is Ravok's will, and so it is our responsibility to see it enacted. Oh shit, okay, maybe these guys are a little bit fucking tapped. You're talking about open warfare. Of course. But all we need is improved military strength. We will achieve our goal. Failing Ravok is not an option. At this time, a large-scale offensive would be unwise. But if we're patient, the newcomers to the Battle of Magalon will do their part. Let the foreign interlopers run riot for now, and we will deal with whatever is left. I don't know if that's the best plan. How will you deal with the aliens? Exactly. The dark towers that descended upon Caracas are a sign. The time of deliverance is close at hand. Ravak will guide us. That's the shittest plan I've Patience ever heard. Patience is our most powerful weapon. Just wait. So this guy's basically just said, just wait. Soon the heretics will atone for their sins. And don't forget, in the beginning there was darkness, oblivion, balance. We came from nothing, and so we must return to nothing. This we do. In Ravak's name. Now darkness, everybody, darkness. I have business to attend to. I've got business with this. I'm allowed this. Uh, okay. What? Well, you're not using it. Right now, we where, where the f lads? Where the? F Where is the like, oh, this place? Is I know it is. I wouldn't join this faction because I simply hate the fucking place. Right, we're there. 
We... Ah, this is... No. Dimitri. Oh, wait, that's the entrance, but we came in there. Okay, we, we kind of got our bearings. We followed him through here, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, we did. We followed him past there because I remember looking at our fuel cell that I just picked up. I think we... he showed us something. We went through here and down the stairs. Then he showed us the... The pit? Bruh. Where in the actual... F Lads, ah, this place is a fucking maze. We definitely haven't been there. Well, that's the main guy's house. That's that. It must be. Fuck that. Here. Yeah. Fuck now it is. This is fucking dog shit, this. Gorda's contest? Oh my god, I didn't realise this was a proper side quest. Dixon. He's above me. He's actually above us. Yeah, the graphical glitches definitely need work here. It's, it's weird. Right, well let's go up here. He's on this level. Ooh, a face first into the wall. Like a true champ. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, it's nasty. That'll teach you to talk back to me. So she's no longer an outlaw. She's a bit of a bitch though. Well, look what we have here. Just in time for our little party. Hmm, looks like this one's finished. But I'm not. So what do you think? Want to take his place? <laughs> You're just disapproving you look. Changed. Can't say the same about you, idiot. Still wasting your life in that shithole? Not anymore. A lot's happened since then. What are you doing here anyway? Thought you were with the outlaws. Used to be. I'm done with those assholes. Berserkers are in charge of the fort now. To hell with that. Then there's Baxter up at the crater. The fucker wanted me to work my way up from the bottom. You believe that? My own people. Figure I might as well hang out with the crazies here. What about your brother? Still in touch with him? Logan? Screw him. Ever since the Berserkers kicked him off the throne, he's just another asshole. Hangs around the coast these days. Still acting like he's a duke, though. Murder, robbery, the huge. Who cares? I have other plans. Looks like you got a good thing going. Hey, they're a bunch of violent psychos. Of course they love me. You know how it is. We both know how to land on our feet. Okay, I wonder if we can get her as a companion. Where the hell's this come from? That's Kaya. Yeah, that was when we had the romance in the first game with Kaya. Or maybe she's jealous. Still hanging out with that little tramp? Yep, yeah, she is. What was her name? Kaya? Heard you two had a kid. Yeah, it's been, uh, interesting. Whatever. None of my business. Like what? 
The Morcons might be crazy, but at least they get right to it. Something needs doing, they get it done. No fucking around. Sounds like the perfect match. Not the smartest bunch, though. Could be taking over the world, but they'd rather hide down here. You ask me, they should have climbed out of this hole a long time ago. It's like they're scared shitless of everyone out there. What do you mean? What they need is an emissary. Someone to tell the other factions how it's gonna be. Since when do you care about other people? I used to care about you, didn't I, asshole? Or have you forgotten already? Did you though? Oh yeah, she was the general, wasn't she? In my army. Look, so being with the Berserkers was canon because I was I had the cleric uniform when I did this. Anyway, things have changed. It's a whole new game. What kind of game? You been out there lately? There's giant towers all over the place. War, plagues, all kinds of shit. Of course, the Morcons have no idea what's going on. The odd Vandal comes back from a raid with a scrap of information. It's not enough. We have to start talking to the other factions. Either that or we get slaughtered. She's got a, she's got a point. She's got a good um, head on her shoulders. I need people I can trust. I could really use someone like you. I'm listening. Renegades and anyone willing to fight the invaders in their towers are gathering at the Bastion of Caracas. Yeah, I heard. Why do you think I was telling you my plans? But first, you'd have to do something for me. What? I help you with your crazy plan. You help me with mine. Uh-huh. And just how much trouble am I getting into? No big deal. Just the other factions... Well, they kind of have issues with me. I need someone who knows how these assholes think. Someone who can get me in the door with them and have my back if things go south. Okay then. I'll, I'll, I'll help you. Okay then. I help you with your diplomatic mission. Folks missing his face look. fight at the Bastion. Noted. Deal. Okay. Let's see what group of freaks you've put together at the Bastion. I bet it's a big old bunch of losers, drunks, and deadbeats. You'll fit right in. <laughs> Guess I'll be seeing you. And quit staring at my ass! Oh shit, she got me there. Look, look mate. Everything's disappearing. This game is just 10 out of 10. Right, so, is this the guy I'm looking for? It is Dixon, right? I mean, you mean you're gonna fight? I'm going for a smoke. You're not. You can do that later. I want to smoke now, so spare me your advice. Hang on. You look familiar. That deadpan expression. Ah, you must be Jax. Have we met? Don't think so. How do you know who I am, then? Heard all about you, is all. You led some shit with the Alps, right? And then just disappeared. That's an interesting interpretation. <laughs> we all got our baggage. You and I are alike in that. Hadn't expected to see you in this shithole. Want something from me? If not, I'm lighting up. Let's fight. I'll, I'll do that in a minute. Let's, let's ask him some questions. You're not from around here, are you? Nah. I lived in the crater for a long time. Worked for one of Baxter's bootlickers. <laughs> a bounty hunter, if you're interested. I was a fucking mud on a leash. Whatever was going, I took it. Ah, but that was another life. I ain't proud of it. So what brought you to the Morcons? Happy coincidence, I guess. Was finishing up a contract. Had to put a bullet in some poor sap skull. Just pull the trigger and job done. 
Didn't realize the poachers were after my target, too. I was so focused on the hapless sod, I didn't notice them. Of course, they wanted to know who got to their prey first. I was stuffed. There were too many of them. It was either dig my own grave or be taken here. Hmm. Yeah, he didn't seem that happy. You don't seem that happy, though. Who can say they truly are? Think of this as my home, though. I ain't any better anywhere else. The Berserkers hate anyone who's eaten from Baxter's palm. And I ain't heard shit from the clerics in a long time. And the Alps sure as shit ain't an option. At least here there's clear rules, uh, clear structure. You've never wanted to go back? <laughs> if I so much as put my little toe in the crater, that'd be that. But if you're going there, you could take something for me. Okay. Don't worry, it ain't much. And I'll pay you for it. I'm heading to the crater soon. I'll take your package. Good, this is gonna take us somewhere we've never been. I'll get it together by tomorrow. Just in case you have a change of heart. Now let's have a challenge. Ghost sent me. Oh, great. Not the best time for a duel. Why not? Because my arm's busted. Oh, fuck's sake. A break don't heal overnight. Are you copping out? No, I was just hoping Ghost would send me someone who done owe his ass from his elbow. Look, no dirty tricks, okay? Won't be your biggest fan if I can't smoke and wipe my ass after this. Well, you might not be able to cut your lips off. <laughs> Any other wishes? Guess not. Say when you're ready. I'm gonna cut off your lips and make you smoke with them. Let's fight. Want to fight? I'll give you one. Get on with it. Get rocked. <laughs> He's attacking Falk. Come here. He's dead. Get wrecked. Execution! Is the fight over? Bro, you got tortured there. One arm or not. Now that wasn't exactly a fair fight, was it? Think I'll take a break from getting beaten up for a while. Enjoy my shards. Don't forget to give Ghost a his cut. Okay, right, we'll come back in a day, but we need to rest for a day anyway to see the... Oh, the graph. What is the graphics? Probably look at this. Let me just try something. Because I did... I changed this early on the playthrough, but then I fixed it using something else. That nah, didn't fix it. Nope. Yeah, the game's just fucked. Game's actually fucked. Look at the state of this. How can you release a game in this state? Then again, I'd oh, free free Lexus. All right. Now, if we can remember where we're going, which we can't. This way? Yeah, it is. Okay, I've kind of got my bearings, bearings now. My way, the wrong way. Money, money, money! Money! I beat Dixon. What do you want? A medal? Oh, my fucking money. It'll be a good few months before he's back in shape. Here, 
Take your wager and winnings. Minus a 10% organizer's fee. That's fair. I never said anything about a fee. Ah, oh, did I not? Must have slipped my mind. It's an unfortunate necessity, I'm afraid, if I'm to stay in business. Here, a little compensation. Let me know when you're ready for the next challenge. I'll tell you who your opponent will be. Right, I'm ready. I'm ready to fight. That's what I'm talking about. How many shards you gonna wager? All in. I'm all in. Your next opponent is Alexi. Tough bastard on the outside, but soft as tissue underneath. He thinks he can change his situation, make something of himself. Don't know where he got that notion from. Give him a good whooping. Maybe you can knock some sense into him. Where can I find Alexi? Well, he's often here in the cellar. But if not, you might find him in the cages. And as he ain't here at the moment, well... <laughs> okay. Right, so he's at the cages. We're only gonna make things what did you worse. say? Uh... I got nothing to prove. I really couldn't care here. less. The cages. Ravak's commandment. Fear is pain of your soul. Do not trust it. It will lead to the eternal damnation of rebirth. He's above us. So much free shit. Yeah, it's, it's weird. Let's get above. Rocket man. The cages. Is that here? What do you mean there's nothing? I can't change that. You should know better than anyone that Ghosta puts a price on everything. That's why I sent you to him. He never makes exceptions, not even for me. You think he even cares that the prisoners live or die? Well, maybe he's right. Why should you care what happens to them? Forgotten what's at stake, have you? Then ask the distributor. I did. No luck. Then I can't help you either. Just keep my name out of this in the future, you hear? Interesting. So this guy's got problems. May Oblivion find He's about to have another one. It's not often that strangers visit the cages. What do you want from me? You look after the prisoners? I just make sure they stay alive. They're no good to us dead. Wish everyone else realized that too. The resistors. Who else? It's us poachers. We're the reasonable ones. We know that death has to wait as long as there's these threats to deal with. But the resistors, if we let them loose, there won't be anyone left to protect us. If we stop them completely, we'll die a slow death. Now you see why we have to take prisoners. Hmm. Because you need more people? Because we need more believers. Trust me, sooner or later, everyone converts. Now, time to inspect the cages. Human nope. Resistors. Ugh. What? Oh, do I have to inspect it with him? Everybody's dead? Not again! Guards! I'll take them. Fuck, how's everyone dead? What the? Resistors. Another three dead prisoners! I thought they were just sleeping! <laughs> like you what were, an idiot. You mean? Find the cart and get rid of the bodies. Can't leave them lying around for the rats to find. Move! Idiot. 
This is a fucking tip top establishment you've got here. What a fucking shithole. Oh, I want to fight okay. you. Okay. Whatever. The guard. What about you, huh? You just gonna stand there? So what should I do? I've had it with being the only one who cares about the prisoners. If you take them prisoner, then you have to look after them, right? And the rest of these are already starved halfway to death. And a corpse is no good for serving the will of Ravak. So someone needs to help me feed him. Fine. What do I have to do? I warn you now, this won't be easy. Get some food, how all gonna be? It's expensive, keeping the prisoners fed. Seek out more cons who are prepared to donate shards to you. I can do that. Yeah, not so fast. Ravok blessed us with stubbornness, see? A single donation is not enough. They have to donate regularly. This guy's got monthly payment it's plans. To expect too much. I get them on direct debit, Especially don't worry about it. from those goddamn resistors. If you need anything else, just ask. Otherwise, get out there and start doing Ravok's work. Meet me here later. No. Okay then. Gosta says you're one of his duelists. The bastard. I only play his game because I need the shards. And it's still not enough. You don't want to fight? Oh, I want to fight. But out there, with my brothers and sisters. If you're serious, though, then I'll give you the duel you're looking for. Come on then, baby. Ready to duel? Well, I'm happy to duel you. What? First, we have to help the prisoners. What a bitch. About those prisoners. What about them? Who do you think would be willing to part with some shards? Not many here with much to give. Convincing them will be tough. And the resistors don't see the point of prisoners. Instead of potential brothers and sisters, they just see heretics. Don't worry about the merchants. I'll talk to them. Although there'll be little point unless Tengus agrees to take part. Tengus. The two of us are not exactly friends. I'll speak to Tengus. But if you think you can change his mind, go for it. Motherfucker, won't you listen to help the prisoners? Okay, I'll tell you what, we'll speak to Tengus. Um. Boom. Oh shit, there's loads of them. I'll speak to these two guys. Would you like to donate to the suitable cause? I'm collecting shards for Alexei. Why are you doing that? I know Alexei. He is not the begging type. They're to buy food with, for the prisoners. Ah, now I understand. He can have some of my shards. It's not much, but I hope it I need, helps. I need you on a monthly payment plan. Thanks. Huh? Monthly payment plan? Starving the prisoners. You have no idea how few shits I give about that accusation. It's a disgrace we let those heretics into our kingdom. Now get lost. Okay, well that, that's a fucking bust, isn't it? Well, everybody else on the right hand side's below me. There's a guy up here that's not. Dixon. Oh yeah, the guy I've just beat. Alexi needs donations for the prisoners. And <laughs> you come to me? Have you already forgotten the beating you gave me? I'm sure you didn't do badly out of that. He needs a regular inflow of shards. One or two just isn't enough. I can spare a few. No full well what those poor bastards are going through, after all. But I don't want the resistors to come down on me like a ton of bricks, either. But a few shards is better than none, right? Good lad. <sighs> yeah, I want to intelligence him. Why are you so afraid of taking a risk? I guess you're right. What have I got to lose? 
more outsiders join the Morcons, the better. Not everyone has to be a tight ass like the Resisters. I'll make sure Alexi is happy. Promise you that. Oh, lads, we are smashing this quest. Now, wait, I spoke to him. So everybody else, by the looks of it, is below me. Unless this guy up ahead is... Jagan. See? Below? Yeah, everybody's below. He's above, apparently. Maggots, get up! Hey, you. Fuck you. I don't talk to outsiders. <laughs> Fuck you. Maggots, get like, up! Jagan's a fucking prick. Get to work! Go on! You're telling me somebody's inside of here. What the hell? Oh, that's the... Is that where the boss is? Alexi needs a Lexit so we can give the prisoners more food. He's one of those bleeding heart poachers who wants to convert the prisoners. Throw them all in the blood cistern, that's what I say. No need to spend shards on food that way, see? <laughs> okay, forget it. Yeah, he didn't give a fuck him. I see you've been allowed to stay. How do you know? Because you're still alive. <laughs> Let me tell you something. You may have come here with good reason. To give meaning to your life, perhaps. To find a home. But you can't stay in the grotto without giving something in return. So, you'll do what we tell you to. Well, we'll see what about that. What does that mean? It means completing a job to my satisfaction. All right, we have an agreement. You're determined enough, I see. But keep in mind that once a decision has been made, it cannot be changed. This is our way. This is the way. You have prisoners rotting in cages. The dead don't need food. And you're okay with that? I am a representative of the Resisters. We see no sense in trying to convince unbelievers of our ideals. Now go. I've told you, there's nothing I can do until you've been given permission to stay. Hmm. What is it you want me to do? A job I can't entrust to any Morcon. Why not? If I could, I would have done so already. I need you to find Ivan, one of our warriors. I found Ivan? return as soon as possible. You can visit our merchants for equipment or anything else you might need for your journey. Have I already seen him or not? It's about Ivan. I'm listening. Where should I start the search? Yeah, he's in the fort. That's for you to find it's out. It's the merchant. He's not here anyway. What do you want from him? He was sent out to find supplies for our people. I thought you said he was a warrior. Of course he is. How else could he carry out the raids to secure those supplies? What matters is we're still waiting for them. We can't live on prayers alone. We can do this now. If I'm going on this search, I'll need some equipment. You can get provisions from our supplies. Oh, I was trying to get some free stuff here. And you'll probably need ammunition. Speak to our weapon. What about... Better to, but I don't expect you. Look for a ghost dog. Okay. Just. He's in the fort with the berserkers. Then go there and bring him back. Now. Now. I'll set out at once. Good. You are more of a Morcon. Don't get. Su 
We need the provision. Right. Okay. So, if we do this quest for him, he might give us some things. Now, we can do that guy's quest because we've now got access to the upper area in a, um, in the Berserker's faction. So, that's actually coming pretty handy. Tengus says you can fix me up with a few healing potions. A wise man. Please, help yourself. I can just take whatever I want. Wait, what? Well, oh, P. Did Tengus suggest? If you say so. Don't believe me? You're intimidated, though, aren't you? Admit it. Not at all. Nope. Just a little? <laughs> Not in the slightest. Fine. Then I want to see what can be done so you don't go squealing to Tengus again. I don't have much. Supplies are low, thanks to the Tavar Barbarian skirmishes. Take a handful of healing potions. Or you can even have the recipe. I'd take the recipe if I were you. As long as you know your ass from your elbow, you can make healing potions yourself. I'll take the recipe. I'll take the recipe. Good choice. Here you go. And the ingredients? Ravak, save me. This is theft. Fine. Just take them. Isn't there something missing? Yeah. Damn. <laughs> this guy's trying Look, to rob us. Just be glad I can... Prisoners need better care. What's that got to do with me? They're Alexi's responsibility. I'm collecting the Alexi he needs to keep them alive. Joke's on you then. You're wasting your breath. I've got no Okay. This guy's this guy's not gonna help. Whatever you want to tell me is probably unconvincing. So how many more people we've got? Jagan I've spoke to, Tengus I've spoke to, Zarnia. Upstairs, what? Two people. I think they're on a med like a me medium floor. Vic, no, not Victor. This guy over here. You got a minute? Heretics. It's always the same with you. Stick to us like shit on boots. Takes a lot of effort to scrape you off. That's your answer. You still here? Listen, if you've got something to say, then let's hear it. But I'll still be telling you to disappear afterwards. You're quite the diplomat. And you've got a smart mouth that I'll happily help keep shut for you. Well, you won't. And just so you know, I'm in charge of keeping things running smoothly around here. You don't like that? Then you best avoid me. What do you think of the prisoners? Undecided. Why? You know about the food rationing? Yeah, but that's just natural selection, ain't it? The strongest beat out the weakest, so nobody is a strain on the community. Seems fair enough to me. Hmm. Well, I think that's not the right answer. That I mean, you could have an awesome prisoner, right? But if you don't fucking feed them, they're gonna die, aren't they? It's not exactly gonna work. Okay. Zarina. Where is she? What's going on here? 
We are Ravok's chosen ones. We are his tormentors and his tormented. His bringers of oblivion and his angels of doom. Oh my god, they're allowed to ensure that the balance returns. And with it, calm and emptiness. This is some perverted shit. Oh, I like this. These guys are like electric shock sexual deviants. You better have a good reason for interrupting my prayer. You got a skull on your titties. Who are you? This is what you're interrupting me for? I demand respect from everyone, including you. Just remember this. I am the mistress of the Blood Shrine, witness to Ravok's mercy. You live or die at my command. You will be judged before me. Never forget that. All right, so what does that mean in the real world? But since you've already interrupted me, you might as well tell me again why you're here. Well, I'm trying to get fucking food. Alexei is having trouble finding enough food for the prisoners. And what? He expects Ravok's mercy to provide for them? The best fate they can hope for is to be sacrificed in his honor. Don't waste time trying to save them. Your flesh is spoiled. You too will be tainted with their sin if you get involved. All he needs is a few shards. Benevolence and altruism. Disgusting. <laughs> Disgusting. Alexei would claim for them what rightfully belongs to Ravok. Speaking of which, I don't remember you paying the required tithe. I don't even know what that means. I have nothing to give. And nothing in your head if you think you can lie to me like that. No, no, I've got it, but well, I've got nothing to give to you. So don't insult me. I'm not one for donations. And you think I'll let you get away with that kind of insolence? <laughs> you will pay Ravok what he's owed, or face the consequences like everyone else. <laughs> what are you going to do about it? Well, I'm waiting. Well, you'll fucking stand there for as long as you want. I need those shards myself. You are both ignorant and stupid. Such a short-sighted decision will have repercussions. I can assure you of that. And I'll be there smiling. Licking your blood from my lips as you are punished. What a fucking idiot. Tell me more about the Blood Shrine. It is where we atone for our transgressions. Should you commit a crime, you will pay a worldly penalty first. Then come here to cleanse your body of sin. To do this, you must sacrifice your blood to Ravak. Only by doing this will you be absolved. Now enough of your questions. I must return to my prayer. Well, that's fucking easy for her to say, isn't it? Because like fucking a man's gonna have to actually hurt himself, fucking cut himself to donate blood. She can just wait once a month and just fucking stand on top of this throne and just fucking let a period all over it. Silly bitch. Right, there's someone down here. From this false if we speak to this last person, what the hell's that? What, is this? Are you dead? Morkon's dead. One last person to speak to down here. He's actually above. And then we will go back to the Berserkers. Alexei needs Alexit to buy food for the prisoners. Good for him. I hate the way we treat them. They're people, not beasts. But what's this got to do with me? Your shards could help buy them that food. You know, you're right. At my age, shards don't mean that much anymore. Why not let the prisoners benefit instead? Thanks. Excellent. Excellent. Right, okay. What I'm going to do here is, let's... Make a hard save. We'll call it an episode here. When we come back... Ah, no, 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 well, no. Well, no, no, we're gonna do this now. I wanna do this, I need to get this done now. So, I need to find the guy that we came here to originally look for. Fake Berserker. He's got to be at the entrance somewhere. That's where this 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 
area of influence is. Once we find him, first thing next episode we can go back to the Berserkers, complete this quest, and complete the Morcons quest. Yeah, complete the Morcons quest so then we can get the leader of here to donate some money and possibly let us do more quests. Where is this fool? This mixture should be treated with the utmost caution. Bathing in it is not recommended. Yeah, it looks it looks toxic. Hmm. Where the fuck's this guy? Do you know what it is? I've just thought. He might not even be here. Because I remember from Elex One, people actually run. Do you know what I mean? Like it, it take it might take him a day to get here. We're gonna have to rest. In fact, it would be it would just be easier to watch this. It'll be easier to go here, rest for a day. And then go back. And then you'll probably be there. Yeah, you got everybody in this game is on a schedule. It actually takes them time to do things. Forgot about that. I need to keep going. There he is. I knew it. Fucking knew it. Sup, my brother? You running away? So you found me. Why'd you run away from me at the fort? You started asking questions about Rat and the Berserkers. I panicked, okay? I, I thought I'd been busted. It's pretty obvious Rat sent you, but now the secret's out that I'm a Morcon. Or I was. Yeah, because we read his diary, he's not even interested in the Morcons anymore, but he's had to flee because he thinks he's going to be persecuted by Rat. What do you mean? You were a Morcon? You found my journal. Did you read it? Yeah, I know everything. Then you don't need me to go through it again. This is my worst fear, being forgotten. I can't go back to the Berserkers, and the Morcons don't even remember me. They won't let me in. They said they don't know me. I haven't held rituals for Ravak in years. I look like a berserker, talk like one. I have... I had a good job. I was respectable once. And now I'm here. Homeless. Come back to the berserkers. And you've got no other place to go? You can come to my place. I thought I'd try my luck with the outlaws. Don't do that. I know a lot about the Morcons and the berserkers. That kind of information's got to be worth something. Don't do that. I could probably forget about the clerics. They don't really go for deals like that. And I'd rather be in the gutter than go to the Alps. Are you sure there's no chance the Morcons won't take you in? They won't. I tried everything. Everyone I knew there is dead. I offered to give myself up as a prisoner, but they didn't even want me then. I thought I could be a berserker spy, see? Looks like Zarina herself doesn't want me there. Said I was lucky they didn't kill me right there. Now, I'll have to find another way. What do you think I should do now? Yeah, I think I want to bring him back to the Berserkers. I can put in a good word for you with Rat. You do that for me? You know, Rat might kill us both if you take me back to him, right? He can fucking try, he's a bitch. So, 
I don't think that's the best idea. Nah, no, nah. No. no point risking our lives. I appreciate your offer, but the Berserkers won't take me back. Not after I left. What? So this is the only option then? You shouldn't show your face in the fort again. I wasn't going to, but do you have any ideas? Somewhere I can go? Right. Oh. Not the Alps. The Alps wouldn't take them anyway. The Outlaws. Outlaws are fucking useless. I'm going to send them to the clerics. Because as much as people don't like the clerics, the clerics are actually... Um, well, they were alright. Better than the outlaws, better than the albs. I think the clerics would take you in. The clerics? Really? Aren't they religious zealots? I don't think I want to get involved in something like that again. They've changed. It's not like it used to be. I mean, all I hear are rumors. I don't think I've ever met one in person. Okay, I, I trust you. You were just doing your job after all. I was the one who got myself into this mess. And I'll get myself out of it. Oh, uh, one more thing before I go. I'm not sure if you knew, but I was a trainer at the City Watch. I'm sure I could teach you a few things. If you want to learn something, find me with the clerics. Good. I better get going. Now, I'll see you around. I hope he's got a... Does he have a quest? Because he'll lead me to the clerics. He's going in that direction. No, he's not. Shit, which way do you think he's going? The clerics. I've got a fucking clue. What the hell is this? Oh, there's two traveling merchants there. So that's a town. That we've never been to. The amphitheater. Okay, well, that, that... That could be an area. Could be a town. Maybe this is the clerics. Because they did like the dome, didn't they? I know, I know that's not the dome. Okay, I think we made a good choice there, sending him to the clerics. Because um, the, the, the clerics aren't that bad, to be fair. Right, we'll call an episode there, lads. When we come back, we're going to go straight to the Berserkers. We're going to turn this quest in. We're just going to probably say, like, we killed him and every, everyone should be should be happy. And we're also going to help the Mork on there. So we can, we, we're going to play both factions, lads. We, we always play both factions because that's how I roll. See you in the next one, lads. Last episode, we were doing quests in the Morcon base. Actually, I was trying to do the fight clubs. Now, we did one fight for the fight club. We tried to do the second one. And the guy said, basically, I don't want to fight you unless you help us get funding for the prisoners. Um, but saying that, we've got a couple of quests to do, but we need to go to the Berserk, a stronghold to do that. We've got to go and see this guy. Is it the job? I think it is, he's in the... No, no, it's not him. It's Ivan. Sorry, we'll go and see Ivan. Because he's a Morcon that's doing a quest. But no, 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 we don't need to see him. We need to see Chloe. Because we've got to sort the trade of goods to this guy. Since we've now got access to the upper district. Right, okay, right, we've got a plan, we've got a plan. Once we do this, we also... There was the runaway from the Berserkers. And we spoke to him outside the Morcon base. I didn't kill him. Because I think he's in... I think he's an okay type of guy, but I've set him to the clerics. Now, that was kind of a five head move for me because I don't know where the clerics are. If we just look for him on the map, we're going to find out where the clerics are because he's going to go for the base. Okay, what are we doing this way? And also what I did was, I googled the flashing, like when we were in the Morcom base and it's happened in the Berserker base as well. Sometimes the graphics like, like buildings and that disappear in front of you and the floors disappear. It's a common issue. 
it, it, everybody's having this. It doesn't matter what type of hardware you've got. Everybody's got this issue. So it, it's not just me. It's just the game's a uh, the game's a little bit junk. <laughs> I don't even mind it. I don't care. I, I think the game is great. Right now we've got access to the upper district. So I think you're full of shit about Ivan's groceries. Is the upper district accessible now? It is. Civilians who have a guarantor are allowed back there. What? Since when? Since I made sure of it. It's about damn time. Then I'll straighten it out right now. Brilliant. You want to come? You might as well take this stuff with you. I'll give you a few shards for being my pack mule. Yeah, I will. All right. I'll go with you. Let's go. I want to make Get sure. Out. I'm sick of the smell of this place. You're lucky you don't have to run a business. Breathing the same air as these idiots every day? Ugh, it's enough to make you choke. Can't we pick up the pace? Just relax. It's good for the legs. This used to be the entertainment district. That's how the old Duke kept the peace. How'd you mean? Simple. Those who partied till all hours didn't get off their ass so quickly in the morning. That kept the streets clear. But I want to show you something. Come this way. Well, I'm glad we did Say, this. Say, rumor has it that you and Kaya, well, uh... That's my goddamn business. Ah, that subject's a bit of a minefield. So, let's drop it. Speaking of Kaya, we've never spoke to her since the start of the game. We probably should do her quest. But I'm too busy getting the sidetrack with the world which I like. What do you want to show me anyway? We're there already. This is the only place where you can really switch off. <sighs> Feel how fresh the air is here? No drunks up here? No stupid assholes with their stupid constant fucking pickup lines? Hey, cutie. Oh, wait, wait <laughs> let me just deal with this. <laughs> Somebody's just wolf cat called this girl. Got a problem, buddy? Keep walking. Oh, I, I, I just wanted to. Just wanted to get a kick in the head? I'm going. I'm going. That's more like it. All right, come on. I really don't want to talk to these assholes. Since I the do quite, took over I do the quite port, like Chloe. The number of assholes has really decreased. But there's still too many. She was a bit of an asshole when she was with the, the outlaws. Good friend of mine lives back there. Hello, Tyler. You prick. <laughs> you guys get along great. The old fella sells me his junk at exorbitant prices. And if I badmouth him, he jacks the prices up some more. So I smile in his face and silently pray for his death. Better clean the dirt off your boots. We want to make a good impression. They're not that dirty. It's just a joke. There's only one time for cleaning boots. When you kicked a few too many asses. <laughs> is that your specialty? There is no substitute for it when you need to bring recalcitrant staff into line. But enough of that. It's not far now. I'm glad we did this as a like building story, you know, like we would we would have missed all of this. I'm waiting for something to happen. Here we are. Leave the talking to me. Alvar is a damn nitpicker, but I know how to handle him. All right. What do you want me to do? Listen and shut up. You here again? It hasn't even been a month. You remember the tinned food and spices you gave me? That was, uh, let me think, 35 cans and, um... Good, you remember. I need the same shipment again. That's impossible. I'm in the middle of stock taking. Oh, who gives a fuck? Hand it over. My warehouse has clear procedures. I can't just... Pull your head out of your ass, or you'll be delivering the stuff to the dealer district yourself. You want me to go among the common people? Don't ask. Do! What? 
Oh, all right, all right. I'll see what I can do. Get it done. You're lucky. <laughs> you don't have to carry anything. You can tell your Morkon he's getting the stuff. Knowing Halvar, he'll have organized replacement stock in no time. And my shards? No pack, no shards. Oh, bullshit. Oh, Intelligence 20. I wouldn't have gone with you if you hadn't promised me the shards. I wouldn't have gone with you if you hadn't promised me shards. Ugh. I don't think I can argue with that. There, take this. Give me my money. Now I gotta get back before those idiots burn my place down. So long. Hey, little Chloe, yeah. As much as I like you, I uh, cross my palm with gold. Nice. Right now, we're gonna go and speak to this guy. Where is he? Boom, Ivan the Terrible. I quite like this guy, to be honest. It's so good, the jetpack. Honestly, the <laughs> I just love it. It's so beast mode. Give me this. There he is. I got your shit, mine. The provisions from Chloe are on their way. Really? That's... that's amazing! I won't ask how you did it, just... thank you. You know what this means? I can get all my stuff and finally head back to Caracas. Won't take long. Wait for me. Right, all done. You're coming with me, right? Yeah, I'm in. Yeah, I'm in. Great. If you've got anything you still need to take care of here, now's the time. When you're ready, give the word and we'll be on our way. I'll say this. Tangus says hello. So you've been to the grotto? I have. Although Tengus seems to be under the impression that you're a warrior, not a merchant. Eh, warrior, merchant, just words. In life, it's not your label that counts, it's what you do. Tangus said you should be back in the grotto by now. Well, that sounds like him. Not a shred of patience. But uh, you already know the problem. Come on, let's go. Actually, wait, let's trade. What does he actually sell? Let's trade. I know I got gas mask stuff in before. Sledgehammers. Headgear. Five grand for that. Yeah, he doesn't really sell anything that I want. Blueprints. I like how it tells you how many you've got in your, your inventory. Look, I've already got that recipe. I don't have this, the remedy. Probably never going to use it, to be fair. Cunning recipe. Oh. It's only 100 gold. I'll buy this. The general remedy. Right, let's go. Let's head for Caracas. I couldn't hope for more. Can't wait to see my family again. They're the light at the end of a really long, dark tunnel, you know? Anyway, follow me. Keen to put distance between ourselves and the fort. Watch this. Boom. Shakalaka, we're there, mate. Shit. Oh, fuck this up. Oh, shit. We can't just do that.
Ivan's there. Uh... Oh, don't tell me I have to escort. I have to escort this guy back. Really? Like, actually escort this guy back? Bro, please don't. Just hope we don't get stopped by the guards. Oh, maybe we just have to let out. Maybe, Why maybe just they stop us. Just the outside. Oh, no particular reason. You never know with these guys. That's all. Yeah, there's gonna be an altercation here. Then maybe we can teleport, or maybe we'll just say thanks for that. It's funny because I'm dressed like him. <laughs> I've just become a, a morcon. Well, that could have gone a lot worse. Still time for it all to go to shit, of course. Maybe the guards are just glad to see the back of me. Anyway, let's push on. We got a lot of ground to cover. At least we're going downhill, though, huh? This is going to be a long ass quest. Which route are we taking to Caracas? Hmm, I haven't quite decided. Going cross country would be risky, though. Why is that? Do you want to wind up in the middle of a battlefield? When my lot and the berserkers are going at it, getting caught in the crossfire isn't a great idea. Ah, we've left the fort behind us. Time for a quick breather, I think. You're not too worn out, are you? I'm tip top. Don't worry about me. If you're out of steam, I got something that might help. Here. Take it. Not the most nice. pleasant, but if you need a second wind, it does the job. Let's keep going while there's still daylight. If you want, we could chat as we go, pass the time. What do you think? Be my guest. Be my guest. Great. No point suffering in silence, is there? Oh, this way. Yeah, we actually have to follow him. Oh, my dears. It's not too far. I'm honest, I'd like to know about you. Wait, no, let me guess. You're going to guess about me? Seriously? <laughs> Why not? We got a long way to go. It'll kill some time. So let's start with where you came from. It's complicated. Nah, -uh, no clues. Let me think. Hmm. We've got enemies. Well, I'm pretty sure you weren't born an outlaw. You know, that's not exactly decisive. All right, very sure. You're not shifty enough to be an outlaw. So where are you from? No. What was I about to say? Get wrecked. Fascinating. Yeah, we're getting stronger now. Nope, don't tell me. No, that would be crazy. But but maybe... Um, give me a minute. This guy's running into every creature possible. Go on, get him. Time to fight. Get it. Damn, nice. Driving me nuts. Still, better than some of the things lurking around here. Mate, as long as you don't run face first into a troll, I'll be okay. Cleric. Wow, wrong. I was a, I was a cleric. Damn it! Okay, I give up. Does Zakor mean anything to you? Oh, okay. The Alb homeland? You're shitting me. I'm not. The Albs are just a, 
a big part of my past. Hi, Ravak. Well, I'd never have guessed that. Didn't think I'd ever journey with a former Alb. Interesting times we live in, right? Okay. Whoppa! That animal's mine! Oh my god, he's killed it in one hit. Okay. Need to keep my eyes open now. There's another one, though. Expecting trouble? No, no. I just want to pay a quick visit to Danilo. He should be around here somewhere. Friend of yours? You could say that. Oh, shit. Bro, this, this thing's hard. Bro, I can't fucking kill this. Ah, oh, fuck this. Fuck that. Just go, just go, 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 go. What was I about to say? This thing doesn't fucking disengage. Oh my god, it's chasing us like a fucking madman. What does he look like? Oh my god, he knocked us off the cliff. I'll find him. Bro, run. Run. Time to fight! But there's no time for running. We're gonna we're gonna die here. As long as he doesn't come back, he's definitely still under the ground any luck, they're still fighting it. It's gonna die though. Nice! Oh shit. Yeah, exactly. Stay there. I wanna loot this. I keep pressing that fucking map button, I swear down, it's annoying us. I need to remember to just like square to put your weapon away. Ta da! Save time if I helped. It's fine, honestly. Just let me concentrate, okay? Hmm. A little bit farther. I'm glad we took this path. You going up there, yeah? Where are you taking me? This guy better not be trying to rob me. I think I think I'm a bit suspicious actually. Right. Let's take a break. Weren't you looking for your friend? Yep, we found him. I don't see him. You're standing on him. Oh he's dead. <laughs> so what? I buried him here a few weeks ago. And you're planning to what? Dig him up? Hey, I may be a Morcon, but I'm not a grave robber. But his remains do serve a purpose. He's a sort of guidepost. Well, his grave is anyway. I had a few things nearby that could come in handy. It'll take me a while to find the spot, though. Maybe you could make yourself useful in the meantime? There are often biters close by to the southeast. We'll set up camp soon. Would be good if you dealt with those beasts beforehand, though. Okay. I'll take care of them. May Ravak's blessing guide you. Oh, and when they're dealt with, you could cut off a few chunks of meat for our dinner. No point letting good ingredients go to waste. When you're done, head for a ruin to the east. Just go along the cliff edge and you'll see it. I'll wait for you there. Happy hunting! Okay, then Excellent. eliminate the biters. Excellent. Okay, well fed biters. Oh, who's this? Scrappy. Scrappy? Oh, he's going to the mine. Oh, he's, oh, he's just digging there. That's fine. Right? At least we know where he is. That, that's, that's good. 
He's very good. At least, at least we can move at our own pace now, we don't have to follow him. He's good shit. I presume these guys are going to be pretty tough. Well fed biters. Yeah, they are. Oh, it's just the chickens. On, Falk. Is, has Falk hit anyone yet? No stamina. Got him. No stamina. Oh, knock it off the edge! <laughs> Falk, man, what are you doing? You can't be knocking these things off the edge, man. I fucking need the, I need the loot. Bruh. Get wrecked. Now to see whether Ivan made it to the ruins. I see him. He, he, he did. It's weird how like it's what? Oh, Ivan's went from there down there. Why would he do that? It's weird how like that that was classed as two separate quests instead of just one quest with multiple paths, you know what I mean? Ah, there you are. There he is. Successful you... hunting expedition? It was. Let me just loot this place first. Yeah, I dealt with the biters. And the meat? Got it. Good man. Knew I could rely on you. Right. Let's make camp. No point in going any farther tonight. My feet feel like they've been put through a grinder. Ugh. Are you gonna help? I'll keep an eye out. Probably better I keep an eye out for anything that takes a fancy to us. Oh, yeah. Good excuse. I'll do it on my <laughs> own then. Guess I'll get some firewood first. A campfire won't just stop us freezing. It'll put off some of the local critters. Let this guy do it because I couldn't be bothered. Won't be the coziest night I've ever had, but it'll do. Now we cook up some grub. Good idea. Luckily, the old cooking station's still in one piece. I can fix us a pretty mean sautéed potato. Can even teach you how to make it if you like. Yes. The first step is to make sure each potato chunk is well fried. Then let them cool a little before frying again. That's how you get them extra crispy. Extra crispy. After that, the meat goes in. Careful not to let it dry out, though. A quick seat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, what am I call. saying? You're probably not interested. Here's all. The campfire is all yours. Even if you didn't listen to a word I said, just try not to burn it, okay? Make yourself a double portion. Okay then. Uh, right, come on. I'm gonna cook now? this shit. What? What got I want to do? I must remember this place. What am I doing? I've already got it. 
I must have already had one. Here you go. Man, that smells good. Sure, it's tasty too. You can hit the hay. I'll take the first watch and make sure the fire doesn't go out. We'll get moving again at first light. Sleep well. Right, well, where's the bed? Ah. Fog. I like how Fog just keep watches over me while I sleep. He's I a true hero. Return someday. Well, let's keep going. Let's keep moving. Hey, I'm not gonna hold us back. Let's go. Listen, I I think it's about time. Uh, I need to come clean. On about what? You won't find many more cons like me. In fact, just being seen with. Oh my god, we destroyed that. I've done it again. I don't know why I pressed right on the D-pad to get put away the weapon. What game have I played where, where that's water. the button? Why is that? Because I'm not following Ravok's commands when I trade. I'd noticed. I've been trading with outsiders, which is strictly forbidden. My assignment was actually to raid any travelers we came across and take their stuff. That's what Danilo and I were doing to begin with, but it felt wrong. Did you kill them? Yes. Morcons don't see death as a sinful tragedy. It's a gift. Brings the peace of oblivion. What a shock. Where was I? Oh, yeah. But there's a difference between us and outsiders. We have to earn our deaths. Well, most of us do. A few lose patience and take their own lives. Honestly, you people sound insane. <laughs> You're not wrong, but we have our strengths. This is Logan Mighty Shady. Tell me something. Have you thought about joining us? I think we'd have plenty to offer you. I've considered it. As long as the option's still available, that is. The balance of power between our poachers and resistors might have become decidedly imbalanced. I don't... What was I about to say? Balance of power between our poachers and resistors. Are these Reavers? Become... Shit, we've got Reavers. Where's the other one gone? Execution! I've done it again, press the mark. Yeah, they, they were here. Yeah. If you could have like two companions, they just it's just game over for everyone you come across. Game over, man. Oh, we've got chest. Wasn't even locked. The balance of power between our poachers and resistors might have become decidedly imbalanced. Might already be too late. So, what do you say? Let's just focus on the journey. That's not really a yes, but also not a no. Good enough for me. This is a dangerous area. It is very dangerous. Now, we're getting close to the grotto. Attack! You say that like it's a bad thing. Well, we'll have to see. Got another one. Oh, two. Nice shooting, son. I 
I wonder if he can become a companion. I quite like to have Ivan as a companion. He's, he's pretty good. Oh, fuck. What is this? Prickleback. Is he fighting something? Oh, he's fighting a chicken. Crack on, I'm, I'm looting. He's like, that animal's mine! <laughs> that animal's mine! I will claim glory. I need to concentrate. If I don't get a handle on it, that thing is going to happen to me. I thought that was a, a fast travel point, but it's not. Mate, I'm just whopping things now. Where are we going? Ivan? Why'd you stop? Give me a moment. I want to take a quick look around. I'll be right back. Hmm. Huh. Are those tracks? They kind of look like... Nah, I'm just getting jittery. Crawl. Okay, we can keep going. You find something? No, false alarm. Really? Let's move on. We've got two enemies up ahead. Poachers. False alarm my ass. Keep your mouth shut and play along, okay? Or murder them horrifically? As I live and breathe. Ivan, is that you? Tengus has been looking everywhere for you. Where have you been? Where's Danilo? He, he's dead. It happened a few... a few weeks ago. Weeks? And instead of going back, you waste your time with this stranger? I... Uh... Look, here's what happened. We had a berserker caravan in our sights. It looked like a good target. Provisions for months, some resources, and... Uh, this guy. Uh, we were unlucky. They defended themselves with fireballs. Before you knew it, everything was in flames. Just chaos. I barely saved my own skin. I got out of the way. It was... Pure luck, but Danilo, well, Danilo wasn't lucky. I couldn't leave him. He wants to serve our cause in Danilo's name. Oh, really? Prove to me that your words are truthful. Kneel before me and swear it. Swear in Ravok's name, that's the truth. Almighty Ravok, God of blood, Lord of eternal balance, turn your all-seeing eye upon your humble servant. Bear witness that I swear that everything happened exactly as described. If I have spoken false, let me suffer eternal agony. Get up. Rotterball, this guy is called. Ravok will decide if you speak the truth or lies now. Now tell me, did you bring the provisions back with you? Of course. What do you take me for? Good. Well, I'm sure your friend will be happy to confirm your story. Step aside. You there. Get over. Oh shit. You wanted to speak to me? I did. So tell me. Is the story Ivan told me true? Every word. Yep. Every I got word. you, brother. Hmm. I see. Interesting. You really want to join us, huh? May Ravok have mercy on you if you don't mean what you say. Ivan, make sure those provisions get to the grotto. Go on, get lost. That was remarkable. Yeah, man, I, I got your back. Listen, loyalty goes a long way and I'm a loyal type of guy. Praise Ravok. That could have gone a lot worse. I had a feeling that staying away for so long would cause a stir, but this is ridiculous. It's like half of Caracas is looking for me. Oh, not good. No, not good at all. And you still want to go back there? I got a responsibility, I guess. Not sure even I can wriggle out of that. But most of all, I 
can't let my family suffer for my actions. True. Well, we need to keep up the pace. Day's not getting any younger. Thanks Come on, bro. Again. After I loot this. For what it's worth. Mate, I've got your back. I got your back. You better have mine though, otherwise it's gonna be trouble. Don't even want to imagine what would have happened if you had. Yeah, well, let's just hope we don't bump into any other old friends. <laughs> Follow me. Mad looting here. Someone's little you forest base. Is that this? Oh shit! Something's going wild. Oh, gun! Bring out of blessings. It's legendary. Watch out, bro. The bringer of blessings, Let's that's right. The blessing of death. Oh yeah, I don't want to fuck with these flying beasts, they're absolutely hideous. Stay away from them, bruh. Oh, he's going right through them. He's going right through them. That animal's mine! But not hard. Oh, they were nice and easy. I do need to get a ranged weapon. Like, one that actually does damage. I mean, I've got this crossbow thing, but it does no damage. I, um, I need to level up some stats, but we'll get there. It's just that... Uh, there's other things I want to do first, but I think if we can do range, it's going to make them flying things a lot easier. Hold on, what's this? Shotguns. Oh, they weren't small healing potions, they look like shotgun shells. Get that. I'm just looting, mate. I <laughs> hope you understand. I need to climb that tower. There's bound to be mad loot up there. And though I need to go over there. Wait there, so stop. Stop, stop. Here. This area. So to the southeast of Grotto, there's like skyscrapers and shit. I want to see what's up there. Yeah, he is really tough, Ivan. He's like two. Oh, teleporter. He's like two shotting these creatures. Oh my god, this guy is tough. 240 XP, Stone Claw. First time we've ever fought one of them. Right here we go, there's lots of beasts. Okay, we need to be extra careful now. What? Why? There's a bloodthirsty bastard of a creature that lives around here. What kind of creature? It's a, well, a mountain troll. Should we hunt it down? Hunt it down? We'll get torn apart if we try to fight that thing. Come on, do you want a bit of excitement? This is going to be a mistake, but I've saved it beforehand, so that's good. Oh, come on. Don't you want a bit of excitement in your journey? <laughs> no, I don't. Absolutely not. Go for a screamer or two, sure. Whatever floats your boat, but a troll, not while I'm in stopping range. Oh, that'd be funny. And I don't particularly fancy trying to track down your various limbs afterwards. Fine. Wait here, then. I'll take care of it. You're out of your damn mind! I'm not gonna go looking for your mangled corpse, you hear? But if you're determined to die, go east. The thing will be around there. 
If you decide you like living, I'll be waiting here. For a bit, anyway. That was impressive. That animal's mine! Attack! Yeah, I can't get hit by that. It'll destroy us. Right, okay, you stay here. A great danger to the east. The completely separate quest. There it is. Come on, baby. We're not going to be able to do this, but it's going to be funny. Which method of transportation do you prefer? I'm flexible. Yeah, there are days when I wish I had my good old Raider back. Is your flight instinct still so strong? Would I still be here if it were? Good point. I could lure the oh there it is. I could lure the troll back to that guy and get his help with it. I think that might be sensible actually. Right, how hard is this thing really? Falk is Falk dead? He's getting. S Come here! Come here. Run. We need to lure him back to the guy. Come on. Come on, bitch. Come on. Yeah, baby. Lads, we're gonna get we're gonna get everyone. We're gonna be a, a tag team gang bang we're gonna have on this troll. Where is he? There he is. This is good, this is good, this is good. Oh shit, he's throwing rocks. Come on, baby. If we survive this, I'll be very surprised. Uh, you didn't want to fight this, but you're going to be fucking fighting it, mate. Look, it's just there. Look, look at this. Look what I got you. I brought you a present. I brought you a present. Bro, I brought you a present. Let's go, baby. Let's go. I'll take aggro. I'll take aggro. Oh, shit. I, 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 I. I meant to press dodge, but I thought I was out of range, so... Got an autosave there. Lads, we can do this. He was doing a... Um, those were doing massive damage to him. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. <laughs> he just smashed Hulk in the back of the face with a rock. Come on, come on, come on. We got this, homie. Bro? Time to fight! Oh, fuck. It's not time to fight yet. It's not time to fight. A grotto bird. Don't be fucking around now. Right, let me save it here. Right, he's pretty close. We're gonna get we're gonna get the team. We're gonna get the boys on him. The boys are on him. Go on, mate. Go on, I need your help. Look, look, it's a massive troll. Let's fucking do it! I'll just keep aggro you, smash him in the arsehole.
he's not dead, is he? Stunned. Hulk. Ivan can't die either, which is perfect. Nice! 800 XP. What a fuck. Yeah, Ivan's a beast. He is actually Ivan the Terrible. Boom. This is how we do it. This is how we play the game. With a little help from my friends. He did a good job there, mate. He pretty much sold it. The mountain troll's dead. <laughs> what? Seriously? You killed it? Well, don't look so damn smug. Do you want a medal? What were you trying to prove? Didn't think Morcons were afraid of dying. Well, we're not. But throwing your life away is a different matter entirely. At least you're still in one piece, anyway. Even if you're completely god in the head. Ravak knows why I should give this to you, but take it. Make use of it before your dumb luck runs out. Take this. Should be pretty handy when you're in a tight spot. Where'd you Ooh. get this? From Danilo. Buried his stuff after he died so that I could dig it up later. Tunnel shield. I'd kept it on me. The berserkers might have turned me away from the fort. Sure, you'll find a use for it. Anyway, let's get going. Not much farther now. We'll have to go our separate ways when we're close to the grotto. Why's that? Better we don't advertise we're travel buddies. Wouldn't want you to get into trouble on my account. Quite good. The resistors aren't my greatest fans. Your call. By the way, I suggest paying a visit to Two? By the way, I suggest paying a visit to Ghosta. Yeah, I've already met him. He has just said we've met. What was I about to say? Whoa, the guy vanished into oblivion. Yeah, before you say you've been there, done that, let's keep moving, okay? We're nearly within spitting distance now. Doesn't time fly when you're traveling in good company? Pretty good. I Hopefully enjoyed this. Dimitri is the only one on guard duty. Dimitri? Yeah. I'm... Over there! Come on, lads. Yeah. Dimitri at the entrance, he was saying. Yeah, I've noticed. <laughs> Look at the distance on that. We're here. We're here. We made it. Great success. Oh, the skyscrapers are above. Above this place. We could have just teleported like mate. I've, I've already unlocked this ages ago. Well, last couple of episodes. Before we part, there's 
something I want to tell you. Listen carefully, okay? There's a third group of Morcons that exists alongside the Resisters and Poachers. This group stands for something that most of my people find abhorrent. Can't tell you anything else about them or what they're trying to achieve. But let's just say this. If you stand up for something right and just, you'll find them. Or they'll find you. Cool. Anyway, it's time to go our separate ways. I think this is... Here, my friend. This is going to be linked. If you ever happen to have more shards than you know what to do with, come pay me a visit. Hopefully see you around. This is going to be linked to the the charity mission. 1,500 experience for that. That was well worth doing right now anyways. Plus we got all the experience from, from killing things. So, with that being said, we can now do the next part of the Fight Club. Ah. Right, we can go and see Tengus. Get his charity. Boom. Yeah, this guy doesn't want to... Who, who is this? Ivan. Let's speak to Ivan. I'll not speak to him yet. He's downstairs. Him downstairs. Oh yeah, he's in there. I remember where he is. Now that we've got him back, this guy should be friendly. Well, he was friendly anyway. It's about Ivan. I'm listening. He's back. And how do you know that? We came here together. Hmm. Huh. I don't like this at all. Why? What's wrong? The poachers were supposed to tell me when he returned. I'll be sure to make my wishes clearer to them in the future. As for Ivan, I won't let him off so easily. He's a good lad. Why is that? I suspect he's working with the enemy. Instead of looting their bodies, he's trading with them. And that's a crime? It is. And I can prove his treason. There have been no signs of struggle on any of the supplies he's brought back recently. Not one drop of blood. Nothing. Which can only mean he can't have taken them by force. Bro, let it go. Is that all? You should know. You've spent enough time with him. So tell me. Has he been trading with the enemy? No. No. He's done nothing but follow your orders. If that's true, he is nothing to fear. But I wasn't born yesterday. I'll need more than the word of an outsider. We will establish his innocence in the Blood Cistern. These shards are for completing your task. And these are for answering my questions. Cool. There's nothing more you can do for me now. And take this. It'll clothe you better than those rags you're wearing. Oh, please be good, Armour. If Ivan owes you anything, you should go see him. Although he might not be in any state to settle his debts after his Fuck. treatment. Fuck. Yeah, we need to get him out of here. So don't take too long. Shit. Let's talk about those prisoners again. You're worrying about the wrong people. They're not important enough to lose sleep over. Give us the fucking money. Maybe they're not, but I am. <laughs> You're talking about the little service you performed for me. <laughs> Very well. I can't deny you've been of help to me. But the prisoners bring change. And change disrupts the balance. Motherfucker. All I ask is that they don't starve. It's not my job to feed them. What about your merchants? Their job is to sell their goods, not give them away. Isn't there some sort of compromise? The best I can do is give the poachers a discount. They'll still have to pay for their food, but we can arrange a lower price. Sounds fair enough. Fair enough. I don't like you helping the poachers, but you've been more than helpful. You never really cared about the supplies, did you? 
You just wanted Ivan back. Correct. I don't appreciate being used. Then you shouldn't have come here. Did you really think I'd trust a stranger with such a matter? Anyway, it's not like you're going away empty-handed. To show you just how grateful I am, I'll make sure Khan knows how useful you've been. Okay, so this guy's gonna vouch for us. If it goes against all I believe in, I will support you joining our ranks. Okay. Excellent. Yeah, that was excellent, although I feel a bit fucking bad for this guy. Where is he? Ivan. We need to go and see him. I need to warn him that they're about to fuck his day up. He needs to leave. Oh, Ivan's got his own place. Yeah. Tengus wants to put you in the blood cistern. Yeah, you're, you're not serious. Fuck! I knew I was gone too long, and I expected punishment for it. He knows you've been trading with outsiders. Oh, fuck, oh shit, oh fuck, 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 fuck! Ugh. How could I be so stupid? Thinking I could pull a fast one on the resistors? What are you gonna do? Get my family and get the fuck out of here. Good. The guard shouldn't ask any questions, just as long as word hasn't gotten around about my planned punishment. At this point, you need to think about how to save your own ass. True. If anyone finds out you told me what Tengus is planning, you'll be his next I'm target. I'm gonna fuck, I'll destroy him. Fine. What do you suggest? Tell him I've escaped. If I know him, he'll blame it on the poachers. You'll get away with it. Now go, please. There's no time to lose. Who's this? I don't think I've ever spoken to her. Thank you for helping my husband. Oh, it's his wife. It's good to see him again after such a long time. You need to get out. Here. It's not too much, but it's yours. I'm sure you can find some use for it. No problem. No, really. You didn't have to do it, but you did. But now you need to do what Ivan told you to. Or it's all for nothing. Oh shit, poor Ivan. Now is I like Ivan, I'm not letting this guy die. Okay, we'll go back and see this prick. You can just go back to the Berserkers. The Berserkers are pretty chill. Ivan's gone. He must have escaped. No one leaves the grotto if we do not will it. Looks like his will was stronger. Spare me your ridicule. I'll sort this out. Wait here. No, 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 no. Now do you believe me? There's no denying it. The poachers let him get away. They have been nothing but negligent ever since we tasked them with maintaining the balance. Good. What are you gonna do now? Nothing. I don't understand. Let Ivan enjoy his minor victory. Let him feel safe. His time will come. You can be sure of that. You, on the other hand, have truly proven yourself, and I appreciate your honesty. <laughs> I've been nothing but dishonest That's with this all guy. That matters. The rest is none of your concern. It's up to me to keep the poachers under better control. This is so funny. This is so good. May you find oblivion. Okay, he doesn't want to talk to me anymore. That's fine. Okay, there he lads. I think I think we've 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 done a we've done a solid day. Now, I don't know if. Gosta's contest. Oh shit. Where was where did I have to deliver that to? Oh, I need to return to him. Okay. Shards for the prisoners. This guy first. Alexi wants me to. So where's Alexi? Venger. Venger. Alexi. Who's Ve who's Venger again?
It was Venge the woman, was it? Where the hell is she? Venge, I don't know who that is. I need to speak to them. I've got no idea how to get to them. Unless they're downstairs. Oh, whoa, where the fuck is this? How have I not, how have I not seen this before? Human should pay attention. Hey there. Sorry, I have things to do. The cages won't inspect themselves. <laughs> Nothing worse than the beasts getting out as soon as we pen them in. <laughs> Alexei needs regular shard donations for the prisoners. Why is he bothering to poach outsiders? He'll have no luck as long as the resistors are out there. So you won't help? I didn't say that. Just saying how I see it. If I can help at all, I want to. Do it. Alexei can rely on my support. Good. Who is she? Tell me about yourself. Are you for real? I just told you, I don't have time. <laughs> what is it with people thinking they're entitled to a conversation? All right, all right. Keep Spencer. your niggas in a, get your niggas in a twist. Beasts here. Beasts? You're not the quickest, are you? If you want to know more, talk to Attila. Drown him in questions for all I care. He hasn't got anything better to do anyway. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me. Right, well, I think I've spoken to everyone that I can. We've just got to go and speak to Alexi. Alexi, Alexi, whatever it's called. What we'll do is, we won't speak to him this episode. I'll speak to him first thing... First thing next episode. He's downstairs, but we'll just, we'll get to him first, you know what I mean? Oh yes, he's down here in his little... Is it not down there? Got his own little bar place, hasn't he? Yeah, he's here. Right, lads, we'll make a hard save. Call an episode there. So, this should be his quest complete, which means I can give him all the charitable donations, and then I'll be able to fight him and then continue with the fight club. Awesome. Hope you enjoyed the episode, lads. See you in the next one. We did Ivan's quest line last episode, and... It, it was really good. Like, I don't normally like escort missions, but at least he could hold his own and I don't think he could die. But, like, I, I got attached to Ivan and when he come back here and they said they're going to put him in the, the blood pit or whatever they call it, um, I've, I've tried to rescue the guy. I don't actually know. Did he, Has he went back to the Berserkers? <gasps> he has! He's went back to the Berserkers. Excellent. Excellent. I hope he's there with his wife. Because that's who we, we rescued at the end of last episode. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay. Now, what we've got to do is we've got to talk to this guy and tell him that we've got all the charity donations. Hopefully, we've done it. And then we can fight this dude. About those prisoners. What about them? Here. I found enough Morcons willing to make donations. Excellent. Now we wait. Ravak will reveal himself to these prisoners. All he ever needs is time. And soon, the blood of our enemies will be spilled in his honor. On behalf of every poacher, I thank you. If only I had something to give you to express my gratitude. You'll just have to take comfort in the fact that you contributed to a good cause. I don't, what I want are some of those donations, I don't care. I'm happy to help, this guy's actually alright. Actually, you know what it is, like, like the Morgons, don't get me wrong, they're the brutal. But, the Porchers, and this, this, there's, there's a fact, there's an underground faction brewing in the Morgons that are more normal, you know what I mean? We haven't explicitly seen or spoke to them yet, but I'm thinking it's going to have to something to do with the Porchers, you know what I mean? I was happy to help. 
And help you did, which is more than can be said for many. I just wish they were more like you. Now, fight me. Ready to duel? Yeah, but not here. Let's find a better site. We can talk on the way. There's no hurry. Am I the first one you've challenged? Second. Nah, that was Dixon. Did you win? I suppose you could say that. And well done. You like the grotto? It must seem an unlikely existence, living so far underground, no? You should air this place out. <laughs> Good idea. But seriously, tell me, how is the outside world? Have those weird purple critters cleared out yet? Not much sign of that happening anytime soon. Damn. I was hoping things would calm down. Those resistors... If they keep it up, this whole place will fall apart. Oh, well. Almost there. Just so you know, I'm in this to win. I'm no pushover like Dixon. We'll see about that. Just make sure you give it your all. Is this where we fight? Oh, here we go. This is a good arena. This spot'll do. Anyone gets in our way, that's their bad luck. Ready. Let's do it. Took you long enough. Come on! Draw your weapon! Took me long enough. I've been fucking waiting for you for days. Oh this guy's got this guy's got an awesome mace. Don't make me beg. Stamina. This guy's he's, he's got massive health, but we can do it. Oh shit! Now nah, I have to press the wrong button. <laughs> I'm not dead. Oh yeah, because he didn't kill you. Now nah, I have to press the wrong button. I was actually meant to press dodge, and I pressed fucking attack. Hey, okay, yeah, yeah, we've got this guy. He's not hard. Stop, outsider. The Great Khan will speak with you. The fuck? Finally. Khan will inform you whether you'll be tolerated here. Go and talk to him. May Ravak accompany you on your path. Okay. Good. This is a perfect place to save. Bam. Right, let's get this done. Stop dawdling. Watch out, bro. All stamina. These guys want to get out the fucking way, like. Does the same thing if you're close to him, he kicks, but then you can just do that. Hit him in the face, lads. He's all fucking getting in my way. Somebody call the Undertaker. Knock him down. That's it, game over. Get wrecked. One more hit. One more hit. I'm a beast at this. Clever boy. Thought you had my back. What's he doing? <laughs> Who had your back? It was a Julie idiot. 
That showed me. You fight like that, you deserve to win. See Ghosta for your reward. Those shards are better off with you than him. Okay, we will. And then we'll fight the next person in the fight club. But while we're here, we'll go and see the Great Khan. So now we're apparently, we're, he wants to speak to us. Here he goes. I was told you wished to stay with us. I don't want to join them yet, but let's see if he gives any quests. I want to join you. You must prove yourself. Everyone here contributes to the balance. You must work like everybody else. We don't tolerate parasites. Show that you will act in our interest. Contribute. What do you want me to do? My overseers will instruct you. Enough talking. Duty calls. May Ravak watch over you. You heard the Great Khan. Report to Tengis and Zarina. They will give you work. Zarina. Oh yeah, I've already completed Tengis. I completed the work Tengis gave me. Good. Your reward has been set aside. The level of remuneration does not seem commensurate with the scope of the services rendered. True. Hmm. Well, you did indeed render us a very valuable service. All right. I will give you a bit more. This is why Falk's a legend. Thank you very much. In any case, Tenga seems to be satisfied with you. If you gain Zarina's trust too, Khan will speak with you again. Zarina? I don't even know who, who, who that is. I don't need to speak to Khan anymore. That was remarkable. That was remarkable. Zarina. Right now, wait there. What are we doing? We need to go and see the guy in the... In the cafeteria. Gosta. I like these fight clubs. They're really good. Uh, what? This way. Boost! Oh, I've went past. I've went past. I've lost my head. Look, I've got no head. I ain't got no motherfucking head, boy. What'd you say? Now what you say, I... Give me my money. Whatever you want to tell me is probably unconvincing. I defeated Alexei. Huh. I'm impressed. Sure you've had easier opponents. Here, take your wager and winnings. Minus 10%, of course. Let me know when you're ready for the next challenge. I'm ready now. I'll tell you who your opponent will be. I'm always ready. I'm ready to fight. That's what I'm talking about. How many shards are you gonna wager? I'm all in. Yagen will be your next opponent. Yagen. Crazy bastard, this one. Tough as old boots, too. But you can take him, I reckon. I'll give you a couple of tips. First, he likes wailing on people weaker than him, even when they're down. Killed his fair share of combatants. Second thing is, he... Uh, hang on, best not. This gem's worth something. A few shards and it's yours. I don't fucking care. Where can I find Yagen? If he ain't on guard duty giving people shit, He'll be leaning against a wall somewhere. Oh, I know this guy. Open. You can usually hear the moron from a mile away. <laughs> He's an arsehole, he won't speak to us. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, this guy's going down to Chinatown. Nobody cares. Apparently they have a plan to keep him working until they fall over. Yeah, we've, we've encountered this prick and he won't speak. Just give us a little lip. You the guy from Ghost's Tournament? Yeah. Yeah, so? You're gonna fight Yagen. Do us workers a favor and lose, would you? If you don't, it'll be us that suffers, and we'll suffer bad. Last loss he had, he killed two of us. So I'm supposed to take one for the team? Please, he'll hold back a little if it's you. He don't never hold back on us. I ain't expecting you to do it for free. I'll 
pass the cap around among the boys. Get something together. You'll do all right out of it. I'll leave everything we can collect with Sloppy. Go get it off him after the fight. You'll find him in one of the tunnels. I gotta get back to work. Don't leave us hanging, okay? Oh, shit. Oh, what do I do? I mean... This guy needs to be fucking destroyed. Can I make it any clearer? Put your backs into it, worms! Move! I need to beat him. Ghosta sent me. I'll pay my dues. He doesn't have to worry about that. I don't care about your debt. I'm here about the tournaments. That piece of shit allowed a stranger to join our fights? Disgusting. You done yapping. I want to fight now. Oh, it's gonna be fun feeding you your own teeth. He is, as the expression goes, keeping a straight face. <laughs> Do not underestimate him. <gasps> Clever boy. Now shut your mouth. Adults are talking. But not here. Follow me. Hey, you two. Follow me. The hell? You can forget all about the Alexit. But if you really want a demonstration, take a deep breath and enjoy the walk. Because soon you won't be able to anymore. Don't you dare move! Don't touch him until I'm through with him! Then drag him to the gates by his tongue! Vermin need crushing! That's I'm gonna, I wanna crush this guy. To learn. I don't give a fuck. Ready, scum? Let's go. All right, where's my liquor? Liquor? What the hell are you talking about? I always fight with a drink in me. Ghost did not tell you that? Don't say you ain't brought any. Got to have my liquor. It's a tradition. He's some kind of Hand bitch. It over. I'll even give you a few shards you can spend on getting your wounds stitched up after. This guy's going down to Pain Town. Watch this. Here, don't choke on it. <laughs> nice bit of liquor, that. I'm almost starting to like you. Here's your change. Now let's get back to me crushing you. Go ahead. Come here! Knock his head off his shoulders! Oh, fuck. Okay, that doesn't... That doesn't work on him. Are they I missed. Getting close and hit him hard. Oh my god, he's got a gun. Motherfucker got a gun. No, no, use fucking guns, you twat. He's actually super fucking hard, isn't he? You can't hit this guy twice, by the way. Fucking crowds a nightmare. Get in there. 
any time now. How much longer do you want to wait? Knock his lights out. Go down to half health. Yeah, if he does that, he, yeah, he yeah. automatically stuns you. Good job, I was moving backwards there, where it is. Yeah, somebody call the Undertaker. Bang, you fucking prick. Oh, he's going down to fucking China telling this guy. Gotta hit us. I knew he's gonna hit us there. Only fucking have so. Servants of Ravak may enter this place. Are you a true servant of Ravak? The fuck? Who the fuck's this guy? I am. And what proof do you have? You're a stranger to me. Probably one of the new poachers. If you want to come in, you will have to find a resistor who will vouch for you. Hmm. Drop well, well, clever well, boy. What happened there? That was impressive. Oh, and Jigen, you prick. Fucking got your shit pushed in there, didn't you? Fought. I won. You don't deserve victory. You fought without honor. And yet there you are, with all the blood and bruises on you. You'll pay for this. <laughs> Not with the winnings Ghost owes me, I won't. Just you wait. What are you looking at? This fight's over. Get out of here before I really show you what a proper fight is. Maggots! You're all worthless maggots. I hate outsiders. Because it was stronger than you. Fucking cave dweller. Right. Let's go and get my money. Yeah, as much as I wanted to lose that battle. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't lose battles. I win them. I beat Yagen. Ah, can't say I ain't pleased. I want some booze to help him forget his loss. Uh, speaking of which... Here, take your wager and winnings. Is there any more people? Minus 10%, of course. 
Let me know when you're ready for the next challenge. Oh, there's more. I'll tell you who your opponent will be. I'm ready to fight. That's what I'm talking about. How many shards you gonna wager? The maximum. I'm all in. I only got one fighter left on my roster. Excellent. Think you might recognize him. You. Goes by the name of Batulga. I've already fought him. Batulga wants to put that defeat behind him, it seems. Heard he's been training pretty damn hard. Oh, and one more thing. Batulga's not interested in shards, so I'm stumping up his wager out of my own pocket. So, he fights with no chance of winning anything? It's all about honor. Likes proving himself or some crap. I don't argue. Hey, I wouldn't try and hold out for too long in there. That way, we'll all get something out of this. Apart from you, of course. The chances of you beating him a second time are pretty slim anyway. Do you think? I really can care less. You reckon? This guy's gonna get destroyed. I got the secret, son. Ah, huh. so you're going to be fighting in Ghosta's challenges. Wrong. I'm here to show other fighters their limits. Haven't shown you yours yet. And I just can't let that slide. You know this dance. We fight until only one of us is standing. You pick the time you want to get your beat in. <laughs> right now, baby. You want to fight? Let's do it. Now I will show you true strength. Draw your weapon. It's easy fighting people with one hundred swords. He's nearly dead. He's got no health whatsoever. That's more like it. He's dead. I can't right now. He actually died. What the hell is this now? He fucking died. Oh, there's somebody on the floor. Not now. There's, there's somebody stuck on the floor. <laughs> Shit, he died. Bro, your man's dead. Batulga's history. Son of a bitch! He was the best bouncer this side of the crater. Now who's gonna take out the trash for me? Why the hell did I back him to win? You're a fool. Now I've got to shell out to you instead. Here, take your wager and winnings. Minus 10%, of course. Thanks. Uh, wait, before you go. What? Are the shards that important to you? Alexa just weighs down a man of the world like yourself, doesn't Bullshit. it? Bullshit. Make your point, Costa. Well, it's just that I've had this potion gathering dust on a shelf for a while. Not a clue what it does, but you're a gambling man. I could part with it for a special price. What do you say? Do we have a deal? How much? Cunning 40, I don't have 40 cunning. 300 shards for a portion. Let's see what it is and we can always reload. Can we reload? I don't fucking care. No thanks. I'll keep my winnings. Damn it. Hate being in the red. No more betting for now, I'm afraid. Still, you should stop by every so often. After all, I've got the best range in the grotto. Right now. I really don't care. 
Let's see where this quick save was. I can't remember if it was before or after the fight. I really couldn't care less. What did you say? There's my way, and there's the wrong way. What? Oh, it was before the fight. Yeah, I don't care. I don't really want to. I'm not losing 300 quid. Um, we'll reload the auto save. I'm not bothered, but now it's a portion. I wouldn't fucking use it anyway. It, it's probably dog shit. Right, there we go. When you find one. Taking my money. Right. Anyone who says so, damn idiot. that's all the of them done, which is excellent. I've got nearly six it's grand, which was amazing. I think you're full of shit. So, yeah, what do we actually here. have to do here? Whatever you want to tell me is probably unconvincing. What did you say? Dixon's mailman. Tell me, we'll go and see Dixon and get his package. Idiot. He's just, he's above us. And we'll see where he wants to deliver this. Because if it's somewhere we haven't been, it might be worthwhile doing just to like get a new place on the map. Yeah, this guy got destroyed. The man was a fool. That's why you should never challenge me to a duel. I'll kick you in your balls. He's above us. There's my way, and there's the wrong way. Scribbled note. Good luck opening the safe. Finally a successful raid for once, and now this shit. It was a massive pain in the ass to haul the safe out of the cultivator's warehouse without being seen. Now that fucking thing is just sitting there in our common room and I can't fucking get it open, goddamn technology. Maybe we should go back to the cultivator's warehouse and look for the code. Ah. Okay, so the code to this safe. I can hack it anyway, makes no difference. Something is greater than something. So four is greater than three, which is less than six, which is greater than five. Six is correct. Three, so it's possibly three is greater than two, which is less than six. Six is greater than one. One's incorrect. Zero. So it's going to be two is greater than zero, which is less than six, which is greater than three. Boom. I'm in. Damage mace. Uh, oh, it's not bad. It's not bad. Take it for free. You have to take a chance when you find one. Right. How do we get upstairs? I'll check this guy's living quarters as well. Looks like there's something on the shelf here. Now this is classed as stealing. Oh, this was his old shop. This was Ivan's old shop. Why can we not take this shit? He's, he's not, never coming back. Oh, we can get in here. Right, so it's one, two, three. One, two. No, 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 no. Yeah. It's one, two, three. One. Bang, bang. <gasps> no, it's one, two, three. Bang, 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 bang. Done. Hand drawn map. I found it in Ivan's chest. It seems to show a reasonably safe route to the Berserk as the path leads directly to the fort in Tavar. Oh shit, okay. Ivan's map. Why would I need that? Oh, I've just seen loads of Alexa underneath the bench.
You can stop skulking around. I can see you. You can't, because the eye is shut on the hood. <laughs> you can stop skulking around. I can see you. I'm not risking it. Right, there we go. We've done it. Okay. We've got to get up again. I keep forgetting how to get up. Is that... Here we go. We'll get a package off this guy and find out where he wants us to deliver it. About your package. Ah, you're just in time, my man. My man. Here you go. So, who are they for? Hey, hey, don't just stuff them away like that. Do you have any idea what I went through to make up that bunch? Called in all sorts of favors, even gave away some damn cigarettes. Caracas ain't a Don, after all. It was a minor miracle I even managed to pull together a bouquet. For a girl. Can you guess who the lucky recipient is? Joe Mama? A woman. A remarkable powers of deduction, detective dumbass. My wife, in fact. It's shit, but I can't go anywhere near the crater. Baxter's guys would be on me in a flash. So, I need a willing delivery man. I'll do it. Sure, I'll do it. A capable guy like you will find this easier than rolling a cigarette. What's your wife's name? Sophie. You'll find her to the north of the crater city. See, we've never been Thanks, here. man. This means a lot to me. I won't forget it. Crater City. Where well, the grass is green and the girls are pretty, baby. Give me more information on where I can find your wife. Okay, it's not difficult. The crater city has northern and southern entrances, right? I don't know. Take the northern one. The one that doesn't go to Ignadon. Ignadon. You'll find her there. Stay away outside of the uh, city walls. Excellent. Ignadon is now crater city. Or maybe it's close by. Shit. Oh, shit. Well, actually, we're pretty close. Because we've been to the old ironworks. That's not that bad. Edgenar. Yeah, because we looked at this here. I thought this might have been a town because it was traveling merchants last time we looked. This is where the clerics are. Because I told Edgenar to go to the clerics. I kind of want to go there. I kind of want to go and see them. Okay, right, we don't have any other quests we can do here, do we? Morkan's values. Um, Zarina. We'll have a word with Zarina. She's actually close by. Is this the woman that we told to fuck off? Lads, it's the woman we told to fuck off. She asked for a donation. I said, nah, you're not, you're not getting it. There's no way she's going to let, let us join. I was saying... Khan sent me. What does that mute want from me? You said I should work for you. He must see something in you then. It's highly unusual for him to attend to a newcomer personally. Yeah. Hmm. You could clean the shrine. Or... Or what? Or what? I need someone neutral. Someone who doesn't believe in Rabak. Who can attend to a matter with... Fresh eyes. So what is it? Certain elements here in the grotto are trying to disrupt the balance. These individuals are extremely cautious. They would never reveal themselves to a Morcon. Ah, uh, these are the these are the, the guys which I think are probably gonna be okay. What makes you think they'll trust me? Take this amulet. It will draw them out. Show it around, but without being too obvious about it. Hopefully, they will notice you. Okay. About the amulet. 
Who should I show it to? If I knew that, I wouldn't need you. <laughs> True. Try it with someone like Dimitri or Marat at the gate. Dimitri. You see everything that goes on. Ghosta and his bouncer are usually well informed too. Bouncer's dead. Or ask around at the cellar. Where did you get this amulet? One of the gate guards, Marat, found it under a table down in the cellar. You can ask him about it yourself if you want. What kind of people am I looking for? All you need to know is that they're a threat to the balance and are Yeah, these are life. these are the people I want to side with actually. The people that are a threat to the Humans balance. should pay attention to the lessons these ruins can teach. Okay, we can see lots of people here. Good shit. Not him. Oh shit, I just bang me half a pole. Two guys here. I'll have a word with Dimitri first. You've seen this before? An amulet? Sure. They're things you hang around your neck. Don't be coy with me. Oh shit. It's kind of nice. Would you sell it to me? Sorry, I'd rather keep it. What for? I'm trying to find out who it might belong to. You won't say that. Can't help you there, but if you can't find the owner, I'll take it off your hands. This guy likes shiny things. Hey, wait. That's the amulet I found in the cellar. How'd you get your hands on it? You better have a good explanation. Zarina gave it to me. What do you know about it? Zarina entrusted you with that? You're not even a Morcon. That's why she chose me. Ugh, not my place to question Zarina, so I'll tell you what I know. Was having a drink with Ghosta in the cellar. I went to my table, stood on something hard. Found this amulet stuffed in a crack in the ground. Of course, when I recognized what it was, I went straight to Zarina and gave it to her. Explain. Is that everything? What do you mean? That's it. Just drop it. An outsider shouldn't get involved in our matters. Leave me alone. Got work to do. Hmm. Okay. But who's the guy over... The voice of Khan. We'll speak to him last. Let's we'll see if we can get any information off these people. Right, so I've got to go down. Down, 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 down. Which is... Fuck it at all, lads. It's, it's so confusing this place. Yeah, I think we're going back to the bar, aren't we? Further down. No, don't do that. There we go. Anyone who says those are damn idiots. I don't believe everything you hear. What can you tell me about this? Hmm. Interesting. How does a stranger get an amulet like this? You recognize it? That depends. Give me a break. Oh, I'm getting old. Memory's hazy. Oh, a few shards should sharpen it. This up. guy is such a shrewd businessman. I don't think it's wise to say Zarina because if he's in on it, he won't tell us the truth. But I want to find the truth anyway. I'm not giving him 200 shards. Zarina sent me. Ah, so you're doing a bit of digging around, are you? Well, I know a little about it. Come closer. Marat found it here. It, uh, it bears the face of Crichton. Crichton? Who's Crichton? Shh! Keep your voice down. You don't know? Crichton's the Forbidden God. He once existed peacefully alongside Ravak. Now, we'll 
believing in him, even talking about him, can get you in a whole heap of shit. But it looks like there are still a few followers who haven't been murdered yet. Crichton, we need to we need to have him raised up from the dead. What's so bad about it? Well, let's just say whoever lost it won't be pleased. The amulet suggests there's a group of people who don't believe in the value of balance. I'd guess Zarina doesn't like that one bit. Did you see who lost it? No, it was a busy night. Could barely keep tabs on the bar, let alone lost property. I don't have any other questions. That's good. It's probably the only thing I haven't told you is the color of my underwear. What's the color of your underwear? <laughs> oh shit, we've got a thing on the map. I wonder why why that is. Vlad. Not interested. Can't be not interested. Listen, I I said I'm not interested. You fucking will be when I stick a sword up your fucking dick. Ah, oh, screw it. Clearly not getting rid of you that easily. What do you want? You ever seen something like this? How? How did you get your hands on this? Listen, you might want to avoid flashing it around. I'm looking for the amulet's owner. Huh. Interesting. This guy's part of it. Afraid I can't help you there. Yes, you can. I'm new around here. Hmm. Can't help but notice you look nothing like a Morcon. How about telling me who you are and what you're doing here? My name's Jax. Hmm. Rings a bell. Have we met? I don't think so. Hmm. Never mind then. So what are you after, Jax? I'm looking for work. Man, if only all the new recruits were so keen. Sorry to disappoint, though. Unless the Patriarch himself sent you, I don't have any work. Although, if you want to kill some time, might have something for you. Yeah. What does it involve? Nothing much. Just a quick hunting trip. Get some dinner. Can't stand the sight of damn rat meat anymore. A sensible decision. Rat meat contains several deadly pathogens. <laughs> it is not recommendable for consumption. Yes, well. Hey, rats can be really delicious. Just toss in a few mushrooms. But you get sick of all the food in this place eventually. My assessment was not a criticism of their flavor. I merely intended to indicate that they are not safe to consume. Got it. So what do you say? Should we go hunting? What do you want to, what do you want to hunt? So what do you want to hunt? Nothing too exotic. Maybe a screamer or two. Just something to wash the taste of rat out of my mouth. You coming? I'll ask to see what you can teach first, because you might die. You can teach me something, can't you? Maybe. But I won't have time until after the hunt. This guy's gonna get this. Wait, this wait. This guy's gonna. Um, this isn't gonna be a hunt. This is, he's gonna get me in. Beat us up. Let's go. Let's go hunting. Don't worry. It won't be a long and arduous trip. Yeah. Saw some big juicy screamers in the ruins above the grotto, but we need to be extra careful. The area is overrun with mutants. If we're really unlucky, some reavers might show up. Will that be a problem? Look at this person listening to us. Come on, let's get going. We haven't got all day, you know. Follow yeah, me. Yeah, this. This Never introduced is. Myself, did I? Hold on. Name's Vlad. You know, Jax, no, you got a pretty unusual name. Where are you from? Oh, my life's been a journey. You know, twists, turns. Hey, if you don't want to give me details, you could have just said so. Not a bad idea to keep things under wraps around here. You never know who's listening in. This guy's definitely part of the the group we're trying to find. And he's about to reveal all. I can smell it. It's got nothing to do with rat meat. Did he just fought the guy in front? Did you see that? Oh, it was just off the stairs. <laughs> I thought he dropped a whopper. Don't think I can taste it.
Come on, bro. Sprint. Ah, fresh air. Man, that recycled, purified crap in the grotto ain't the same. How does the air purification work? So Ravok knows. Do I look like a techie to you? Long as it works, right? Okay if we keep moving? Sure. Great. Off we go, then. If you don't mind, I'm planning on making a little detour. I bet you are. What kind of detour? Got some business to take care of with the merchant. She's in an outpost of ours. More or less on the way up to the ruins. We've met her. I thought Morcons needed a permit for that. What makes you think I don't have one, huh? Yeah, we have a lot of rules. But when you learn the system, you gotta love it. Anyway, let's take a quick breather. Maybe you'd finally like to tell me where you're from. Yeah, we've met that girl. Maybe that's the... You wanna know where I'm from? For most people, it's a pretty simple question. Trying to run away from something awful you did in a past life? Ever heard of Zakor? Uh, yeah. What about it? That's where I'm from. I was once a commander in the war. By Ravak, you were an Alb. A long time ago, but yeah, I was. Did you defect? Renounce them? Seems so, doesn't it? Man, takes a lot of courage to recognize your people's flaws in part ways, whatever yeah. the consequences. Respect that a lot. Is that exactly what you're doing. Anyway, enough jabbering. Let's get a move on. Not much further to the Morcon outpost. This guy's part what of Crichton. What business do you have there exactly? Just business. The details aren't any outsider's concern. Over there! Get him. Yeah, that little thing was pretty hard, wasn't it? Tell me something. How'd you end up in the grotto? Why you wanna know? Just curious. No need to get all defensive. Actually, I was um, helping Almost one of your guys. There. Helping two of your guys, in fact. Something big's chasing us, isn't it? Oh, it's only a dog. Hold on for a moment, okay? I'll be right back. Get him. I didn't get experience for that. I think it's because they helped. Do you have it? You know what? Yeah, yeah, I got it. You got the shit. Hand it over then. I don't have it here, dipshit. It's in the usual place. I already looked there. Wait, what? Oh, shit. Someone must have stolen it. Look, I'll deal with this when I have a second. You better. Anyway, I'm going. Got other things to be doing. Not if you say so. Well, I'm done here. Shall we carry on? About that merchant. Yeah, what about her? What did you trade with her? Uh, nothing interesting. I bring her a few odds and ends from the grotto. She gives me stuff in return. Nothing more to say, really. You're not telling me what's really going on. What do you... Look, just keep your nose out of it, okay? None of your damn business. 
Maybe I'll share a few details if we get to know each other better. Whatever you're up to, I want in. <laughs> Just like that, huh? Let's finish the hunt first, okay? I'll think it over. Oh shit, Vlad is mistrustful, that's not good. Let's go. Sure, follow me. It could go either way. You're an interesting guy, you know that? Really? In what way? The second you catch a whiff of profit, you dive in head first. Screw asking if what we're up to is above the board or not. Does that bother you? Me? Not one bit. You just might want to be more careful about who you make these kind of offers to. Bro. He's busy getting murder out here. I'm picking up scrap off the floor. Fuck, we're dead here, like. Oh, shit. This, these things, these frogs are ridiculously hard. What the fuck's it doing? I'm stuck! I'm just gonna let these guys deal with it. It's far too difficult. Where is it? Oh my god, what's it doing? Rock dragon. Eh, uh, bro? Do you, wanna, do, you wanna, do you wanna hit it? Oh my god. <laughs> it goes in the ground and jumps out like a fucking madman. What the f uh, yeah. fuck is it doing? What the f lads, look, it's floating. What is going on with it? What what is it doing? Let me help you. <laughs> fuck that. Let's go. I'm not even bothered. Let's go. Let's just get out of here. Oh, he's still targeting it. Come on, bro. Bro? Bro. Don't. Don't. What? It, what? Uh, it, yeah. He's fixed. He's fixed. Where exactly did you see the screamers? In the ruins. We should be there soon. Don't let your guard down. This place is a stomping ground for mutants, too. Don't want yeah, to get their see. attention. Those tasty screamers I saw should be around here somewhere. Look this. Keep your eyes peeled. Contaminated person. It's ridiculously hard. Get him. Dead. Dark Elex. So that's what that's what's contaminated them, the Elex. What was I saying? Oh yeah. 
Listen, don't engage without me. I know they're just screamers, but there are loads of them. It would have been much less dangerous to have lived here in the old world. Obviously. Right. The screamers should be around here somewhere. When I saw the pack last time, there were more than a few. Okay, how's this for a plan? I'll stay here and lay a trap. You go on ahead and lure them to me. Got it. Great. Should be the perfect pincer attack. Off you go then. I'll be here. Right. So wait there, hold on. I'll show that monster. <laughs> Fat scream out was. Oh good we just lure on this guy this guy. Oh, I'll show that monster. This guy's going ape shit. Oh shit. Got him. Give me all your shit so I can sell it. This collection of buildings must have been a capable think tank in its day. Hardly. But so many. Ah, a fight like that makes you feel alive, right? And look at this meat. Our bellies will be full for weeks. Leave the corpses where they are. When we get back to the grotto, I'll send some people to bring them back. So, you in a rush to go home? Not really. Are you not? Oh, there's a mutant over there. Uh, let's just say my blade can manage a few more hits before it needs sharpening. Hey, you ever seen a cyclops? Yeah, I have. Man, then you know how dangerous those big bastards are. So... Now that the screamers have warmed us up, how about it? Want to try to take down a cyclops? Let's fucking do this! About the cyclops. Want to head towards it? We can take it down together. That's the spirit, buddy. Follow me. I saw it over this way. Let's show it who's boss. Just, just, just so you know, you're probably going to be doing most of the work, but I mean, I, I'm happy to, I'm happy to supervise, <laughs> supervise the taking down of the cyclo. What a belter! Oh shit! This residential design is certainly a space-saving. What, mate? You take the first shot. Social interaction in such a compact space. Must <laughs> oh, fuck no! Um, I did not know that it was going to have laser beams out of its fucking eye. Whoops. This residential design is certainly a I'll just I'll just wait concept. here. Social interaction is such a Hulk, do you wanna go and give my mate a hand? A more rapid exchange of information. Teleporter. Look, I've seen the teleporter. When you get this quick. Brilliant. Is 
Does this guy do anything? I think I need to lure this thing into, into melee, melee range with this other guy because he's a fucking idiot. It takes ages to fire. There we go, that's better. Shit! Got him right in the arse crack. Come on, hit him, hit him! Is this guy even attempting to fight this one? There we go, finally. Big damage, big damage, big damage. Don't put your gun away, it's shit. Where's... fuck, where's... Where's he going? Yeah, I think we should let him aggro. Oh, folks, back in the action. Where's the other guy gone? Where the fuck's the other guy gone? Oh, he's been knocked into fucking oblivion, honey. Fuck's sake, man. not dead is he? No he's stunned, that's good. As long as he gets back up we'll be up. I get as far away as I can so my guys get back up. There we go. Where We're both it? back in action. How much health has this fucking thing got? No, 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 no. Concentrate on this guy so he gets a fucking axe out. That gun does no damage whatsoever. Oh, that's not good. That, we, we can't manage this last 40% of his health bar. Oh, it missed us, even though it clearly hit us.
Oh. It's a good job I saved it there. I might just go on the fucking roof, mate. Like. Watch out. Oh my god, it's got full health? How the fuck did it get full health? Oh my god, it's got full health. How the fuck? This is ridiculous. Maybe if you go too far over that direction. me lads this is ridiculous there's something I wanted to say Didn't connect. Bro, you need to do something better than this. Lads, this is this is not good. Oh, this fucking guy will get up. Nobody's coming to help here. I need Falk. I 
I knew that was coming. I knew it. I fucking knew it was coming. Oh my god, what have I done, lads? I'm actually stuck here. Here we go. Here we go. Fog's back. Over there. Fucking dead again. Oh, me other mate's back, me other mate's back. Come on, bitch. Come on, lure him over. I'll show that monster. Go on, smash him in the dick! Smash him in the dick! Got him! Motherfucker, save it before anything happens! <gasps> oh my god! That took too fucking There's long enough! I wanted to say and cause a ton of problems. Who said that? About the Cyclops. The Cyclops is history. Whoa, color me impressed. Good job. Honestly didn't think we'd get out of there alive. Right, we really should head back now. We're not home and dry just yet. Oh my god, there's more. Got it. There's more. Okay, follow me. I can't believe Jeez. it. What a rush. We actually took down a fucking Cyclops. You're one mean bastard, you know that? Next time Marat mocks me, I'll rub our little conquest in his smug face. I would have liked Gex. to see the old world as it was before the comet. You shall, my friend. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. Man, I'm beat. Wish someone would carry me home. That was a fight and a half, huh? A beast of a Be fight. Glad when we're back in the grotto. Not much further, thank Rabak. No need to make a detour to the outpost this time. Hang on, you see that guy? I'm sure I know him. Oh yeah, he definitely shouldn't be outside. Just gonna have a little talk. Don't even think about getting involved, okay? More con business. We'll see about hey, that. Hey, you! Who's he even talking to? Oh, this guy here. I know you. Ilgar, right? I... no. Well, yes, but... No one gave you permission to be out here, did they? In fact, have you even finished your training in the cages, let alone pass the arena test? Yes, uh, of course. I got uh, Khan's permission. <clears throat> uh, excuse me? I'm choking on your bullshit. I'm one of Khan's closest confidants. If he'd sent you out, I'd know. So, you see, we have a problem. Either get your ass back inside or... No, please. I can't go back in there. Please, just leave me alone. Hmm. Too bad for you I'm not a poacher. What do you mean? Why? Because I'm too lazy to take your worthless hide prisoner. Letting you go isn't an option. Which leaves me only one choice. You shouldn't have come here! 
thought that guy might have caused a bit of tension between us, you know? Difference of opinion kind of thing. But I'm glad you didn't get in the way of more con justice. Ravok demanded it. Anyway, it's all done now. Man, this has been a long expedition. Itching to get home. Pay the That's not what I wanted to do. Why do you... Wait there. Oh. I don't want to do this. Ah, but look, my jaws hurt. I, I, I was thinking this was some sort of test. I thought I was going to be able to interact with him like after the fact, but I didn't really want to pull up with shotgun and blow his face off. I'm actually going to stop him from doing this. I know you, Ilga, right? Not now. Stay out of this. No one gave you permission to be out here, did they? In fact, have you even finished your training in the cages, let alone passed the arena test? Yes, uh, of course. I got uh, Khan's permission. <clears throat> uh, excuse me? I'm choking on your bullshit. I'm one of Khan's closest confidants. If he'd sent you out, I'd know. So, you see, we have a problem. Either get your ass back inside, or... No, please. I can't go back in there. This is none of your bi- Hmm. Too bad for you I'm not a poacher. What not do you mean? now. Why? Because I'm too lazy to take your worthless hide prisoner. Letting you go isn't an option, which leaves me only one choice. You shouldn't have come here! <sighs> Thought that guy might have caused a bit of... Couldn't do anything. ...between us, you know? Difference of opinion kind of thing. But I'm glad you didn't get in the way of more con justice. Ravok demanded it. Anyway, it's all done now. Man, this has been a long expedition. Itching to get home, pay the seller a visit. Why do you have to die? Those are the rules. We must all abide by the law of balance. Ravok demands that if a man betrays his brothers, his punishment's a dishonorable death. Ravok will deal with him now. Besides, he'd seen too much of our society, knew our secrets. We can't have someone blabbering to other factions. Ah, but look, my jaw's hurting from all this jabber. Let's go. I'm ready. All right, follow me. I'm, uh, sorry you had to see that. Don't think badly of us just because of that one guy. Gotta say, you surprised me. How so? Well, you just stood aside, respected more con justice. That in itself is worthy of respect. Well, I, I tried you know. not to, to be fair. Hey, enough of this ass kissing. We're almost back now. That was remarkable. That was remarkable. Hey, would you when he shot? He shot that guy. He actually, the pellet hit me. Look, I've got low health. Motherfucker shot me. Shot me in the ass. Am I the only one that has a jetpack? I think I might be. You know. Watch this, my brother. You need one of these, bro. You get yourself a jetpack. Okay, here we are. Quite a ride, huh? Funny what a quick hunting trip can turn into. I'll give the word that those screamers need to be picked up. See you around. Maybe this was about screamers. This this was I thought 3200 XP for that quest. I suppose I deserved it. Okay, right, well we'll we'll call it an episode here. But the, I thought this guy was gonna be one of these um Crichtons, but they're not. Yeah, I've got a search in this. I can speak to the voice of Khan. Right? Okay, tell you what we'll do next episode. We'll go and speak to the voice of Khan, see if he can do do anything for us. Cause we've got sidetracked with that quest, but I'm glad we killed the sight loss with this mad experience. And then um, we'll see if we can find anything in this area. Hope you enjoyed the episode. See you in the next one, lads. It's funny because we are like we are doing quests for the Morcons as if we were just coming in here to like infiltrate and. And just get as much out of them as we can. <laughs>
I'm kind of starting to like them, but we'll see. We'll see. Now I've got to find this guy. Oh, I've got to find information on this underground culture called Kryton, which is the peaceful movement of the Morcons, which people don't like. I'm going to go and see the boss man. Well, the boss man's right hand man. See what they've got to say about it, and then we'll search that that area. What's that? Something to do with your task for Zarina? You're telling me you I'm don't know? I'm supposed to find out who the amulet belongs to. I see. Well, it's your task. I won't be helping you. Oh, well, fuck you too, buddy. Curiosity, is there a bed anywhere? Oh my god, there's a bed. But I can't use it. Curiosity killed. Fuck off. Right now. Alright, I just want to have a sleep. Jesus. Do you have a bed? Does anybody have a bed? Not now. You have no business here. Finally, Fuck just go away. Yeah. These guys are very protective over their beds. Boom, I'll have this one then. Need full health. I'll know immediately if anything is missing here, okay? Sorry, man. Something My wrong. Head. Right, I've got to find something in this this area. A voice inside my head. What does it say? Me what to do. Search for clues. It. I have things to do. Ah, you 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 scrummaging around in the rubble. I can see you've got loads of things to do. But right, let's look for things that are out of place. I think the cafeteria. This is this is directly on top of the cafeteria, isn't it? Or maybe not. Apparently, they're still in Bolia. Aren't you making this a little too easy? Yeah, it's like a needle in it. Wait, I heard you had a certain. Aha. Depends who's asking. My name's Evika. Don't try to deny you have it. You got the amulet from Zarina, and now you're trying to find out who it belongs to. Come here. It's better we talk in private. Evika. You got a nice body, baby. Let's get to the point, okay? Damn. The amulet doesn't belong to you. I want it, and I want you to tell Zarina that someone stole it. So, name your price. I've got quite, yeah, I definitely have questions first. I have a couple of questions first. Can I trust you? I have no reason to betray you in any manner, to any person or object. You're really specific, aren't you? <laughs> but good. I can be satisfied with that. And what about you then? Can I also trust you? You can. Can I trust you? My question is, can I trust you? The others advised me not to let you live. Don't make me regret not taking that advice. You couldn't anyway. I suppose we both need to establish some trust. You're no more con. I'll answer your questions. Okay. But if I find you trying to trick us, I'll have to kill you. My question is, who is your daddy and what does he do? What's the story behind the amulet? The Crichton amulet goes back centuries. The story goes that there were once two gods, Ravak and Crichton. When we created the grotto to save ourselves from the great comet, they fought for dominion over our people. Obviously, Ravak won in the end. He banished Crichton from the kingdom of the Morkons and set out the commandments, which the Morkons still follow to this day. The commandments of balance. Who are these others you're part of? We're followers of Crichton. We work in secret in the very depths of the underground. 
The Resistors found us. They torture and kill us. And the Poachers? They're the same as the Resistors. Well, at least most of them are. They hunt us because we threaten their way of life. When the grotto opened up, old, forgotten ideals came flooding in. And we're a threat to them. They're afraid we'll be able to bring them down one day. What a day that would be. You really believe in this Crichton god? Of course. But he's so much more than just a god. He is inspiration itself. The embodiment of freedom, peace, and self-determination. Good shit. Do you understand? We Morcons haven't always been so brutal. The old stories have been forbidden by Ravak's followers. But we remember them. We were once like everyone else outside the grotto. No prisoners, no torturing. We never inflicted any pain upon ourselves. And there were no blood rituals. We still remember those times, even if the others don't. Maybe now you see what's at stake here. Right here. Right now, the future of the Morcons is in your hands. Serena and her resistors can't be allowed to find out that Crichton's followers are growing in strength. Yeah, I've got no intentions of um, selling you out at all. About the amulet. What are you going to do with it? I trusted you. Now's the time for you to trust me. Give me the amulet, and I'll let you in on our plans. Deal. Here, it's yours. Falk you. doesn't like it. That's the I first thing he's never liked. I wasn't sure you weren't going to go to Zarina behind our backs. Now you're one of us, whether you like it or not. But don't worry. We won't let you down. We'll fight for a better future together. What do you need from me? We could really use some help from an outsider like you. Somehow we have to make sure that Serena stops looking for us. The story of the amulet must come to its rightful end. But I know from my own experience that Serena won't be satisfied until someone's been punished. So you need a patsy? Yes, it's the only way. The only way. Someone has to pay. If we can, we'll find a poacher to blame. Not a resistor? No. Serena would see right through that. But who are we going to do that to? So, what's the plan? Find someone to plant the amulet on. Someone who Serena thinks is stupid enough to keep hold of it, but not be a follower of Crichton. There's a trader in the living quarters who deals in stolen goods. We plant it on him and let Serena know he has it. She'll find it with him along with other illegal goods in his possession. That should be enough to convince her that there's no conspiracy against Ravok. You know what else I could do? I could sell it to the guy at the entrance. But I don't know if he's a resistor or not. So, I'm doing the planting? No, I'll do it. You... you stand out too much. I live here and I'm a minion technician. Minion? Everyone knows me and ignores me. I blend in with the crowd. But I need you to make sure Zarina knows where to look. Go see her and tell her this. Someone stole the amulet while you were making your way through the living quarters. You overheard a conversation in the cellar between two men who were talking about a trader who deals in stolen goods. You don't know what these men looked like. It was dark. Got it? So, I'll go to Zarina and tell her that someone stole the amulet. Then I'll say, when I was looking for the thief, I overheard a conversation in the cellar about a trader who deals in stolen goods. So yeah, I got it. Good. Serena has spies everywhere. It won't take her long to find the traitor. You need to go straight to her and do what we talked about. Meanwhile, I'll hide the amulet. We'll talk after you come back. Okay, that yeah, I'm doing this. Unusual choice. Yeah, mate, I've got... It's, it's, you got to... Falk, I know you're a robot, right? you got to look at the bigger picture. 
But look at the bigger picture. We're playing both sides. Not only are we going to be friends with these, we're also going to be friends with the, the, the crazy ones as well. Because they're going to all think I'm doing my job correctly. This fault, you've got to play both sides. Once you learn this, you will be truly human. Okay, so wait, am I going the right way here? The arena is upstairs. Boost. I love playing. I, love, I, I, I just love playing games with everyone. It's so good. About the amulet. Motherfucker got stolen. Someone took the amulet. What? You allowed it to be stolen? All you had to do was track down its owner. I have never encountered such incompetence. If that's all you have to say, I'll have you sent straight to the blood sister. <laughs> that won't be necessary. Explain yourself then before I change my mind. Shit, I forgot what to say. It was stolen in the residential district, wasn't it? I think someone took it while I was in the residential district. You better have more than that. What else do you have to report? I heard two men talking. They wanted to sell something to a trader who deals in stolen goods. I went looking for him when I realized the amulet was gone. And who is this trader? They say he does business in the residential district. Hmm. An illegal trader in the residential district. Not the first time I've heard such a rumor. Good. I'll deal with it personally. If we find the amulet on him, I'll spare you the blood sister. You'll need to come with us. I want you there when we search through his stock. Do it, baby. Wait while I send my guards on ahead. They'll make sure he doesn't go anywhere. All right, let's follow them. And may Ravok grant you eternal torments if we don't find that amulet on him. I hope she's lived up to her come side on. of the deal, otherwise I'm fucked here. Come on, baby. We shouldn't keep my men waiting. They should already be inspecting the trader's goods. Remember that we are observers only. You are not to interfere with their search, no matter what. Okay. I shall do nothing of the sorts. Quiet. I want to hear what the suspect has to say. That was inappropriate. <laughs> What's inappropriate? I didn't do anything. The only reason the Falk doesn't un doesn't like this is because he doesn't understand it. Once he sees the bigger picture, baby. I wonder which trader it is. Poor guy. What the hell is this? I haven't done anything. You are accused of dealing in illegal goods. You are further accused of being in the possession of illegal artifacts. Artifacts that seek to challenge the power of Ravak. What? No, I would never do that. Okay, it's true I've been trading without a permit. But I would never sin against Ravak. Have you found anything? Yes, sir. This amulet was among his things. What is that? I've never seen it before in my life. Tell that to Ravak. And we'll see if he believes you. I'll get you! Come back here! Don't let him get away. Oh, they're gonna kill him? Oh my god, he just got his head stoved in. I was sure you were lying to me. Perhaps I should place more faith in you in the future. You should. And in truth, I'm relieved an illegal traitor was the one behind it all. We'd feared far worse. You did your job well. You may tell the voice of Khan that you have proven yourself to me. Now please leave me to my prayers. Oh my god, we've done every quest. We've just sorted every quest out. We didn't even have to do anything properly. 
<laughs> right, wait there. Wait there. So hold on. Is that is that is that her? Where is the girl? I wonder how we're gonna find this. I'm just looking for anything to st oh, I've already been in there and stole the stuff. Yeah, he wasn't a proper trader anyway, so it didn't make a difference. Right. Why don't we go and see the boss? Because we've done both things now. Wait there, what's this? Evicca sacrificial lamb. Evicca. We'll go and see her first. Oh shit, there we go. There's the floor gone again. <laughs> there's the graphics gone. Oh yes, because she works on these things. They tell me you got Serena off our trail. I'm sorry about what happened with that traitor. There was just no other way. But what matters is that now the Morkons still have a chance. Thank you. So, what happens now? There must be something. I know it's a lot to ask, but you're the only one who can help us. You're not a Morkon, yet you've earned Serena's trust. We need a mole. Someone within the Morkon faction who shares our ideals. You've already proven that you can do it. That we would accept you into our own inner circle. So, are you willing to become our mole? Yes. Okay. What do I need to do? You're not a Morcon, so you'll need to stay on Khan's good side. Easy. You must do as he says. Otherwise, you'll never be able to become one of us. And because you're an outsider, we can't use you as a mole. Ah, uh, okay. I'll be your mole. But you're... All right, we're there. Until... Right, okay. Oh, so shit. Okay, if we want to... Con this is interesting, right? Because if we want to continue this quest line, we actually need to become a Morcon. I don't know if I want to do that though. That's a problem. That's a problem. That's a problem we've got. But. Let's go and see Khan. Maybe he'll. Maybe we're allowed to. Join them now. But I, I'm not going to. If, if, if this is a join request, I'm not going to do it. Well, I mean, I've done everything. I've gained Zarina's trust. Did you now? Huh. Oh, some achievement. Zarina is not easily impressed. Take this as a symbol of our appreciation. Excellent work. I want to talk to Khan. Is that so? Well, let's see. Tengis is satisfied with your work, as you said. I'm glad to hear it. It seems Zarina trusts you. That speaks in your favor. That should suffice. Go to Khan. He is a man of few words. Come on, baby. You gain the trust of Tengus and Zarina. In recognition, I will answer two questions. Choose wisely. Who is your daddy? And what does he do? There they are. About my two questions. I want to know what the balance is. And I want to ask him that. What is the balance? The balance is a system of equilibrium that ensures our survival. When we were trapped down here, it was a vital system. Take food, for example. There must always be enough food for the people who need to eat. One more person, and there would not be enough food. One less person, and we would not have enough workers. The balance is a delicate machine that must never be askew. 
It has become more difficult to maintain, however, since the gates were opened. That's your first question. Do you have another? The reason I want to, I want to know, I want to know what his opinion is of the people who don't believe in Ravak. Are there any more cons who don't believe in Ravak? There used to be, dark times. Only the old remember. There was another god besides Ravak, Crichton. But that name only represents conflict now, a struggle that almost destroyed the Morkons. Forget I mentioned it. You've asked your two questions, but I am not finished with you yet. I have a task for you. Complete it to my satisfaction, and I will grant you a great honor. In any case, you have earned a place in the Morcon ranks. Really? Enough talking. I must resume my duties. You heard the great Khan. I will explain everything else to you. Khan mentioned a task for me. What does it involve? It seems Khan sees great potential in you. He has been looking for a long, long time. Perhaps his search is finally over. But you must complete a test to prove your suitability before Khan will bestow upon you this great honor. What is it then? What kind of honor are we talking about here? Once Khan considers you worthy, all will be revealed. What kind of test? Khan wishes to test whether you truly embody Morkon values. You are expected to help Vlad with his work. He is waiting. Go to him when you are ready to leave. I've already visited Vlad. Is that so? Shit, I've already done this quest. Yeah, it is. Then why is he not here? He said... I do not care what he said. <laughs> Bring him here. The great Khan will hear what he has to say. Oh shit, is that the guy that we did the hunting it for last episode? It will soon become clear whether you truly represent our values or not. Oh shit. Oh shit, son. Wait, I can't see Vlad. Yeah, Vlad is the guy. He's the guy we helped do the hunt hunt for. And I think we've represented uh, Morcon values pretty well. Yeah, we've been pretty good at this game. We've done, we've generally get all the quests done before we're given them. Just by exploring. The voice of Khan sent me. Hmm, had a feeling he might. What does he want from me? You're meant to give Khan a report about me. Ah, okay. Got it. I'll go see him right away. It First makes off. you wonder how many people once lived here. Show me how to be a better hunter. Sure thing. I want to know what he can offer. Sixth Sense, Lone Wolf. Animal troll. Ah. I could, with an extra five points in intelligence, I could get animal trophies too. Which is, to be honest, I think I'm going to do that now. Uh, don't worry about it. Oh, it costs two points. I got nothing to prove. It costs two points. I'm going to do it. Still just as many of those cutthroats. You have to take a chance when you find one. Yeah, it's good for money, animal trophies. I mean, we've got lots of money now, but I, I, if we're going to be killing things. Sure. Boom, there we go. Nice. Yeah, so basically what it looks like is, after level 30 of any stat, it stops costing one point and starts costing two points to level up. So we, we might have a big pool of points to spare, but it's not really as big as it looks. <laughs> I hear that all the time. It's not as big as it looks. <laughs> you know why I summoned you? Yeah. You want to know if the outsider passed my test, right? If he's worthy of the job you have for him. Yes. Well, I made it look like I was trying to smuggle something out of the grotto. He didn't give two shits. Thought he threatened to turn me in, or at least ask what I was up to. 
He just stood there like a slab of meat. Shit. Wasn't impressed, to be honest. Oh, but that's not all. Outside, we ran into a deserter, Elgar. The stranger didn't interfere. He let me carry out more con justice, as Ravok demands. Gotta say, it surprised me. In a good way, of course. A sensible appraisal with useful responses. But what is your opinion of him? Tell me, do you think him ready to take on the responsibility? Well, all things considered... Oh, you motherfucker! No, I don't think so. I get why you see something in him, but I can't recommend him. If he wants to show how much he respects the Morcons, maybe you should offer up a little Alexit. Your advice is appreciated, Blah. You cocksucker! Robot's blessings be upon you. Bro, I helped you kill a fucking Cyclops. You, master. Well, I didn't really. You heard correctly. Vlad has spoken against you. The Great Khan is bitterly disappointed. If you wish to show that you truly respect our way of life, you will need to make amends. What? What? How much? How much? What do I need to do to prove myself? As Vlad already suggested to Khan, a gift to the Morkans would suffice. If you cannot show your respect another way, this is the only avenue open to you. I want to show my respect. Ah, what have you brought? Fuck that. Is there anything else I can do besides paying you? You may pay with blood, if you so desire. Prove yourself in our arena. A battle to the death yes. will show that you are willing to risk your life for our Yes! Battle. If this is what you choose, go to Attila and register for a fight. If you survive, the Great Khan will acknowledge your showing of respect. Oh shit, I've already spoke with him. Attila. Can I speak with Khan? I spoke to Attila. You must survive a battle to the death. All right, okay. Okay then. Okay, this has actually worked out pretty well because I'm all about battles to the death. Can you believe that cocksucker? Fucking wouldn't recommend us, bro. I thought we were buddies. I thought we were best mates. The, the only reason I acted like that in that quest because I thought he was the mole. Sorry, I thought he was the the underground people praising him, um, Crichton, but I was wrong. Come on then. This is a good turn of events actually. I will pay by blood. I really like I really like these guys, you know. They're a bit tough, they're a bit weird, but they're very, very similar to the clerics. Like everything this everything that's going on here is pretty much what went on with the clerics. Oh man, I went the wrong fucking way again. In Elex one. Like they had prisoners, they had people that didn't like having prisoners. Um, they had people that didn't believe in the the religious part of the the cult, and they were just there because they were a strong faction. You know what I mean? Sup, my brother. The voice of Khan told me to seek you out. He wants you to pay the blood price. I understand. I already told you. But it seems we have... Yeah, okay. About the arena. I could do that. That would be useful. I'm not as young as I used to be. First of all, someone needs to go speak to Venya about getting more creatures. I really don't want to do it. Okay, Why then not? I'll do that. Because every time we talk, we end up fighting. I guess we got different ideas about what the arena's for. If you want to go talk to her, that would be great. Consider it done. If you can get the arena running again, I'll give you something more valuable than any shard of Alexit. A weapon. I'll let you fight oh, in my arena. Is that it? Do you spar with your fighters too? It's not really an option. I would be a pathetic opponent, but I can still give the odd piece of advice here or there. 
That'll do. Great. Then we can get on with it. I want to learn. But he's also oh, he does this melee combat. I need forty-five strength for that. Reduces the requirements of melee weapons by 10%, that's not very good. So if you have a weapon that requires 100, it's only going to require 90. It's not really a big fucking deal, that. Crap, crap, crap. Stamina's alright, but you need constitution and I don't, I haven't put a single point in constitution. He also does animal trophies, does he? Funny enough, that's, that's strange. Oh, well, it's not strange because he's a beast master. Right then, we're we'll going to find him. Um... Well, we won't. Venya. She, oh, she's just here. Happy days. She said she was busy. She's been walking around in a circle for about three days. Attila's waiting for the delivery of new creatures. Good for him. Why can't he tell me himself? He's a bit of a bitch. <laughs> Always getting others to do his chores. Listen. Killing beasts is one thing. Capturing them is something else entirely. You can't just click your fingers and it's done. I should know. I've hauled more beasts through the gate than anyone else. How much longer until Attila gets his creatures? Unless you got a crystal ball stuck up your ass. <laughs> your guess is as good as mine. Look, I get grumpy, all right? Nothing you can do to help. I'll work my ass off all day, and all Attila does is wander around, making speeches. <laughs> what happened? Bodies. Lots of bodies. Damn. I've said too much. Yeah, nobody cares what I think anyway. You're wrong. Tell me. It's actually pretty easy to explain. The poachers captured new servants of Ravak. Humans. Beasts, I understand. They act on instinct. But humans? Mm. We lost three prisoners in the last month. Good people, too. And it's just one incident after another with the cages. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing I can do. The Resisters worship death. They love it. Yet they expect me to do my duty like a good girl. But how? Not one person has helped me retrieve my prisoners. About the beast trappers. I'll look for them. What? Really? Yeah. Look, I appreciate it, but you're not a Morcon. It's not your concern. I decide what concerns me and what doesn't. Well, if you put it like that, not like I have much choice. But listen, I can't let you do this on your own. We'll split the work, all right? Okay. You look for Ilka and her people. I'll take care of the others. Ilka. Yeah, what do you mean, the others? What do you mean, the others? New recruits. They're probably in trouble. I'll deal with them. You should be fine with Ilka's squad. Before you go, one more thing. I gave Ilka a tranquilizer for the beasts. She won't have used much, so please bring back the rest. Is that clear? Any questions? Let's do it. Find Ilka, bring back the tranquilizer. Right. I'll get going soon. Just need to finish some stuff here. Oh, and by the way, I'm grateful for your help. Thanks. Where did Ilka go? She's hunting rock dragonflies southeast of Caracas. Just make sure you don't want her in a mountain troll territory, all right? Oh shit, okay. It won't end well for you. Okay, this might not and this might not be so bad actually because I am um, I wanted to go southeast anyway. How far southeast? Okay, so she's there. That's not bad because we can fast travel to here. Boom, shakalaka. We're already above in the town. Are these buildings accessible? If I'm honest, it doesn't really look like there's much here though. Let's get an eagle eyes view of this. This place. Am 
Oh, this is cool. Avenia Wimba, what a way. here is a truly unique experience. It is, it is rare to be able to take in so much sensory input at once. Look, there's some sh. But do you think that's. Do you think I'm getting there? Oh, I'm not entirely sure. There's a tower. Fuck it, YOLO. Oh my god, we made it. We made it! There's got to be mad loot in here. Large Elex drink. Canned meat. Can't see shit, son. Actually cannot see a thing. Monies. I can't hear it in my ears tonight, baby. Remember Jamaraquai? He's a fucking great musician. We've got a safe, baby. No, oh, it's too... Yet. It's too tough. Bet there was something awesome in there, though. Right, now what the fuck do we do here? Not good. Take the shit on that roof. Oh wait, there we go. Ah, we can stand. Shit, shit, shit. I fucked it. I fucked it. Oh no, no, no. We can. Oh, what the fuck am I, lads? What the hell am I grabbed on? Oh shit, okay. We'll load that back up. Right, so it's weird because you, you... Right, we can't grab onto the side of the building. That's fine. Can we... Yeah, baby. Right. I think that's a bit far. I want to go up that though. Oh, there's a big creature on the floor. Actually, we're heading in the direction we want to be, and so that's fine. Are you sure this is a good place for us to be? Well, what's the problem, like? There's only a few monsters, mate. Right, I'm not sure we can make it up here. Yes. Oh, he didn't grab onto this. We got. Can I get an L? Double O, motherfucking T. A rocket launcher. Yes, please, and loads of. Oh, yes. I'm glad these are rockets and not damn butt plugs. I suppose we could use them as a butt plug, but on our enemies. Right, look, we've got a we've got a bridge that's isolated. Possible loot. Now wait, there. Where are we? Do you think there's anything on that building? Oh, we might, lads. We can get on top of there. Do you think? Oh, shit. Go on, stand, 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 stand. You can just... Stop. 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 
He grabbed it, he grabbed it, he grabbed it. This is where I want to be, maybe. I would like to stand, but you, you can't. Oh, boys. I don't think we can make this, actually. Fuck it. Give it a shot. I don't know if we can climb the, the tree stuff. Oh, fucking... Nah, not possible. Hmm. I think you might have to attack it from the other side because that's like the tallest part, but is that it's it's got like a hole in the roof. Oops. We, I think you definitely do get the, get more height by tapping it, just like Elex One. I fucked it there, like. Right, I give up. I, I can't do this. And um, we're gonna have to. I think we're just gonna have to upgrade, upgrade the jetpack if we want to get on the top of there. Maybe. Oh, grab it! That'll do. Okay then. We need to come back to that building later anyway because we've got a, a safe inside. When we get some more upgrades, we'll, we'll come back. Right. Happy days. So where are we headed? We're actually headed this way. Oh shit. Grab it. Yes! Man, I've got mad jetpack skills now. What the hell? Humans should pay attention to the lessons these ruins can teach. What lessons that? More rockets. Okay, where is she? who? Who am I supposed to be seeing out here? Il Il Ilja or something? Oh, fa fast travel. Good shit. Good shit. Wait, I think we should go up there. No, 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 no. Yeah, it should be safe up here. I can't imagine there's any creatures managed to find their way on top of this. Unless they've got wings, of course. Can you fly, Bobby? Nothing. Are you kidding me? There's nothing up here. This reminds me of Fallout. I really love Fallout. I, I, I need to play it again sometime because it's been a long time since... I'd probably play Fallout 3. I really enjoyed Fallout 3. I love New Vegas as well. I love the them all, to be of fair. This road is in a remarkable state. Fuck. Remarkably bad. But remarkable nonetheless. Watch out! <laughs> Who is, look at this, there's a guy over there, where the fuck's this dude? Sup my brother, are you a reaver? He looks friendly. Hey, you there, hold up. Who, me? Shh, be quiet. Huh, guess it was nothing. That's right pal, nobody here. You look clever, got a spark in your eyes. Woo, 
That's a statement that's only ever gotten me into trouble. What? Ah, oh, come on. I just want to play a game. Want to play a game? A game? Out here? Damn right. I've got an opportunity for you. An opportunity too good to wait. Oh, come on. Corny lines are just gonna make me more suspicious. Don't be, my friend, don't be. It's a very simple game. I call it double or nothing. All right, I see what's happening here. Conjure. Out for my Alexit. Hmm. You really think little old me could hoodwink a man like you? But you do look like someone who likes a bit of a risk. Am I right? Let me explain the game. You bet you're Alexit, and I ask you a question. Answer correctly, and you'll get double. Okay. Answer wrong. I take it. Okay, off. then. Okay. So, what you think? Who the fuck's this guy? Oh, and before I forget, my associates here will be uh, keeping us company. <laughs> they get so curious sometimes. They just have to watch. I hope that won't be uh, an issue. Hmm. Looks like quite the crowd. You said it. So, are you ready? This is awesome, right? By the way, I don't know if this is just a coincidence. Can you remember how I just mentioned Fallout there? And then this guy sounds like one of the ghouls. I'll drown you in your own blood destruction level 2 low. That's a shame. Ask the question. I'm in. Ask your question. This will be fun. Wonderful. But all I need from you is your bet. I'm betting it all. How much you going for? Everything. What's your bet? Everything. Here. A thousand Alexit. Might as well make it worth it. That's the spirit? Great. Then let's get started. Here's your first question. I promise. It's an easy one. I thought you said there was only one question. During the war with the Albs, who was the highest ranking warlord in Edan, known as the Pilgrim? I know this. It was... Ragnar. Ragnar, I remember. Warlord Ragnar. Nice try. It is? But that's not the right answer. It fucking was. I was looking for Thorol. Oh, okay. Let's move... Fucking, was it not Ragnar? Oh no! Here we go! It wasn't Ragnar. Rag I've just it, it's coming back because it's been a while since I played it. Ragnar was the first leader you met of the Berserkers. But it was Thorold that was actually at the world heart. Okay, okay, right, okay, okay, I get it, I get it. Hey. Right, come on then, baby. I remember now. Warlord Thorald. Oh, ho, ho. you're a smart one, aren't you? Here's your winnings. I'm an honest man after Two all. Two grand. Oh, I was damn. for Thorald. Let's move right on to the next round. Fuck, we're going to get loads of money for doing this. Fine, go on. What's your bet? Here, a thousand Alexit. Time for the next question. Let me ramp up the difficulty a bit. Which community was in power in the domed city of Abessa just before the end of the war with the Alps? The clerics. The clerics. Damn, you're good. A real expert, huh? Here, your winnings. All right, time for the next round. The easiest money I've ever made. Okay. What's your bet? Here. All right, next question. This is a tricky one. Come on and hit me with it. What is the name of the first Alexander that occupied the throne of the Ice Palace during the war with the Albs? Oh, fuck. I don't know. The 
first Alexa that occupied the throne of the Ice Palace during the war with the Albs. Zardom. Zardom rings a bell. Zardom. Uh, Who was it? The correct. Tarek. People like. Fuck that, I'm getting all this money. Fuck that, I'm saves coming the fuck out. This is the easiest mo Easiest money I've ever made. So who was it? I've already forgot. Lads, I've already forgot the fucking answer. And he told us what it was. Fuck this, I'm gonna make easy three grand here. I'm gonna go and buy some armor because I, I wanna find hey. some new armor. Yeah, okay, come on, give me this shit. Hit me with your rhythm stick. Tarek. Tarek. Ah, oh, shit. You knew that? I thought you'd be dumber. Well, here's your goddamn money. On we go. More. How long do you plan on continuing in this game? I don't want any trouble, pal. How long do you plan on continuing this game? Hmm, good point. This is getting a little boring. So, let's cut to the chase and see if your fists are as fast as your brain. Hang on, if you just wanted to fight, why the whole song and dance? Hey, you could have stopped at any time. <laughs> right, sure. Do you treat your associates the same way too? I have no idea what you're talking about. What if I asked your friends here how they've done in the games you've played with them? Watch out, my friend. People like you con everyone they see. Especially those they see often. You need to stop talking. Right now. I guess your monkeys are too stupid to understand what I'm saying. Otherwise they wouldn't be standing here anymore. But I guess I could try explaining it in simpler terms. What you think? You better get out of here before I forget myself. No problem. I'm already going. See that you do. And just to be clear, you might want to avoid me in the future. That was impressive. Nice. Yeah, we fucking smashed their fucking fannies in there, mate, didn't we? Three grand? How much money have I got? Oh my god, I've got eight... Nine grand. Got nine grand? Fuck, that was a bit of a distraction. Something trying to eat me. Oh, it's a... Damaged great axe. How far away is this? It's gotta be close. Here we go. Oh, they're all dead, look. This is infested. Oh shit, they're not that hard, they're not that hard. Where's me, mate? Fucking hell.
Come on, baby. Got him. Mate, you need to fucking never get that crossbow out in your life because it's, it's the worst weapon I've ever seen. The ranged combat when enemies use it seems to be complete dog shit unless they're like enemies against you. That's it, yeah, everyone's dead, aren't they? Bloodhounds. Oh, Elgash is dead. This thing on? Testing. One, two, one, two. Fucking cleric technology. Absolute trash. We added tranquilizer to the meat, but the beasts aren't losing consciousness. Quite the opposite, actually. They seem anxious, fired up. I'll take a... It doesn't look like Venya's tranquilizer worked. So that's it. Oh, easy lock. Yeah, baby. Okay, then I think that's that quest done, isn't it? Yep, tranquilizer 303. Right, we'll take this back. The grotto. It's funny how they haven't got a teleporter inside of the grotto. Venya, she's... Down? I actually can't remember. Oh no no, she's she's here. Got your shit, son. About the beast trappers. I found Ilka. Great. How is she? Well, she's dead. Like her followers. I... I don't believe it. Oh, all because of that fucking arena. We're like cattle to the slaughter, blinded by our thirst for blood. What now? I have no idea. Did you at least manage to save some of the tranquilizer? Yeah, but not a lot. What happened? How'd they die? Maybe your drug's no good. No. No, can't be. I made it myself. Could you have made a mistake when making it? Guess we can't rule it out. It's not my recipe, though. Got it from an outlaw. Well, that's why it's shit. We need someone to take a look at it. But I don't know any alchemists. I do. They don't get out much, and I'm not the sociable type. I've got contacts, mate. Do you know anyone? Yep. What about Tylus? Berserker alchemist. Sure, he'd do, but... I don't know about asking the enemy for help. I'd prefer an outlaw. After all, it's an outlaw recipe. I know it's a lot to ask on top of everything else, but, uh... Could you make the journey yourself? That's not too bad. I'm not sure they'd be happy to see me. Because I don't know where but the outlaws this are. This means a lot to me. If it could save just one life, then my efforts wouldn't be in vain. Up to now, the opposite's been true. Yeah, well, all the more reason why it needs to fulfill its purpose. Look for an expert on tranquilizers. They should be able to tell us why it didn't work. About the beast... Are the others back already? They came through the gate right when I was about to leave. Was sure I'd given you the easy part, but <laughs> didn't work out that way, huh? Okay, right, so, I've got an idea, I've got a plan. I'm going to continue with this quest. It's going to take us where? It's going to take us to where the, the outlaws are. Oh, shit. So the outlaws are in the crater. So now we've got two quests for the crater. That's interesting. But I can just go back and see um, T-Lass. And that's what I'm planning on doing. Because I, I trust T Tilas. And then we're going to go here anyway. I could get both people's opinions right. So. Next episode. What I'm going to do is. I'm going to continue with this quest. Because it's taking us all over the map. I want to go and see Tilas. I want to visit here. 
because this is the clerics because Ejnar's there and we want to go here and see the outlaws and then we're going to see that's going to see all the factions this this is so good this is so good right lads we've got a massive journey to go on next episode see you in the next one lads we are going on an adventure so we're still doing this quest for whatever our name is venger we've got to get this tranquilizer looked at so the first person we're going to go and see is we're going to go and see tilas in the berserker compound even though she doesn't want us to speak to him i'm going there anyway because he's my mate well he's not really my mate i've done a few quests for him but uh, he's a little bit of a cock that, that's a great start off to a great start i've just face planted Better leave. Ah, bro, I just want to use your bed. I'm serious. Good to see. All right, I think, I think. Oh, we can see this guy. This this guy should have a mission hey. for. We get we paid him some money. Hey, come over here. Let's see if he's. He's made true on his word. Got anything to trade? Sure. I'm sure you've got something special to show me. That's how these deals work, right? Oh, I'm excited to see what you've come here with. What? So, let's talk Elix. Is that what you've got? I don't want to give him Elex. Is this any good to you? Not to me, but yeah, my clients will be very happy. I do have something for you, though. It's pretty special. It's a little heavy, but oh. you're going to like it. Yeah, but you can't give this to me. Of course I can. Finding a buyer would have been tricky anyway. But I heard gold is used for electronics. That's got to be useful to you, right? It's more of a kind of thing for the clerics. Oh, yeah. Speaking of which, there's this cleric woman, Vivian. She'll give you a good price, guaranteed. This sounds like a Don't fucking go scam. Don't making any stupid deals, though. Sell it properly. Thousand shards, minimum. Why didn't you sell the ingot to the clerics yourself? Simple logistics. These long journeys don't make great business sense. The return doesn't justify the risk, especially the risk to my life. Besides, I'm needed here. That's worth more than any deal. Can we do business again soon? Not just yet. I need some time. Relax, though. We're good. You'll see me again. We'll be doing business again in no time. Hmm. I wonder what he would have give us. That, uh, that, well, okay, okay. I didn't realize this is what we'd be doing. I want to find out what 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 the difference is. Right, okay then, let's, let's figure this out. If that's what you want, then... That's what I want to hear. There are very... F I'm impressed. I... It, it's a little heavy, but... You're gonna Hank's gold bar. Gives you the same fucking thing. Not strange. Hey, hey, come over here. I'm just gonna give him the iron ore. What happens if I give him beer? How about some beer? Eh, not really. But you know what? I. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Weird. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do what I. I'm gonna do what I did originally. I'm just gonna give him the iron ore. I'm not giving him the elex because hey. I like. I like elex. Hey, come over here. Is this any? Okay. Right. Okay. That's interesting. I don't know how this ends. This is, this is a weird quest. Right. Okay. Happy days. Who's this? Oh, is this the Marwin? I've never spoke to this guy since we got him as an apprentice. Oh, he's good. He can he can he can figure this out. Can you do something with this? What is it? A sedative, maybe? That's what I was told. I'm not sure I can help you with that. It would take more skill than I have to determine what it is. Tylus is the only one who can help you. Okay then, that was there. Uh, you're fucking useless. <laughs> you're fucking no good. Can you examine this for me? My time is limited, but your potion looks interesting. Well, it was supposed to be a tranquilizer, but it doesn't work. Supposed to be? Pah! Only facts matter here. I estimate I'll need half a day for a proper analysis. What do I owe you? Nothing. It's essential you know the constituents. I don't want you killing someone by mistake. Come back in a few hours. I'll have the initial results then. Happy days. Boom. Few hours done. <laughs> I'm just sleeping in this guy's bed. What do you think hmm. of all that? Where? Uh, about the tranquilizer. Okay, so my analysis is complete. Your concoction is anything but a tranquilizer. Then what is it? Well, your drug has little effect on humans. Apart from a numb tongue and potency issues. I found clear evidence of mushroom spores. To be more precise, cave mushroom spores. They're very rare in this region. So I'm wondering where you got this tincture from. Caracas. Aha, from the Morcons then. Those simpletons shouldn't be playing around with alchemy. But back to my findings. In relation to non-human subjects, this drug is fascinating. Especially when combined with the spores I mentioned. It causes a significant rise in blood pressure and an attack on the central nervous system. The result? Greatly increased aggression. Of course, that's just a rough summary, but I hope sufficient for you to understand. Yeah, thanks for the information. All in the name of science. Only, uh, please don't tell anyone I didn't charge you. Otherwise, every chancer around here will think he can get treatment at my expense. Here, uh, take your concoction. If anyone discovers this dishwater amongst my vials, my reputation will be in jeopardy. Whoever created this mixture had no idea that they were very close to achieving what they intended. They just shouldn't have added the spores. Now, I must get back to my work. That's the problem. So I've already, I've already figured it out. I've done the quest. I've done the quest. That means I don't have to go. Oh shit, I leveled up. Tell Venya what you found out. So that means for this quest, I don't even need to go here. That's good. But I still need to go there to deliver a package, which I am going to do. But we might as well go and tell her about this Venya. See, it's good to have friends. I got contact, son. Gone the wrong way for a start. Rocket man.
Oh, you're back. So, did you manage to find out what's wrong with the tranquilizer? It's fucked, mate. Yeah, had it examined. Well, don't keep me waiting. The cave mushrooms were the dud ingredient. I, I don't get it. The recipe said they were a key component. They were trying to kill you. It seems the outlaw was full of shit. The spores trigger an aggressive behavior. Rather than quieting the beast, it makes them crazy. Son of a bitch. Then the drug's unusable. Not necessarily. If I understood it right, if you take out the cave mushrooms, the recipe should work. Hmm. I'll think about it. Well, now that's done, you should find Attila. The cages are full again. I'll want the arena open so the guild can okay. continue. Okay, it okay would we'll have do been this. Much less dangerous to have lived here in the old world. Right. We'll do this right so we get on good terms with the the Morcons. Then we're gonna go to the base where I think the clerics are. Cause I do I, I need to go and see the clerics. That was the day with my faction last game. I'm ready to fight. You're here? Glenya's done herself proud this time. Some real vicious, hungry, mean beasts. Let me know when you're feeling brave enough to face them. Right now. I'm ready to fight in the arena. Good. It'll make a real man out of you. Put some hair on my balls. There are rules. I get to pick the creature you fight against. Once the fight starts, I'll close the gate behind you. You can only get out by pulling the lever next to the gate. Lever? Yeah. As soon as you pull it, we will stop the fight. We'll open the gate as fast as we can. We'll get you out. Unless the creatures get you first. Just concentrate on the fight, and don't pull the lever until they're all dead. Oh, we're fighting more than one thing. Leave before they're all dead, and all you get is the shame of defeat. This could be hard, actually. Any questions? Yeah, can you can you just send some puppies in or something? I got it. Good. Then you're ready for the first challenge. Ready? Give the signal, and I'll let the creatures loose. I want to fight. Good. Every time you win, I make it harder for you. Right. How many times do I have to win just to get the quest complete? On the creatures, because they won't go easy on you. What am I fighting? You'll see soon enough. Get yourself ready. Taking you to the arena. Oh good, we, we're allowed Falk, that's good. Easy. I imagine we're gonna to have to do the whole thing, aren't we? Because this is too that was too easy. What do you think about that, mate? You did well. Like I promised. The possessions of someone who wasn't as good as you in there. Thanks. Well, I enjoyed watching that. Reminded me of how things used to be. Well, I couldn't have done it. Well, not these days, anyway. I bet you could have. Not anymore. Too old now. These days, all I can do is watch others take the risks. Come back when you're ready for the next challenge. I'll be here, getting everything ready for you. Right. Okay, now, question. Is that enough? That should guarantee Khan's respect. Let's go and see him because this will give us experience. And then we can come back here if we want to do this. Now, I think fighting creatures is a lot harder than fighting humans. So I'm not entirely sure if we'll be able to complete that. And I don't really know if I want to just yet. I want, I want to go and see the clerics. They're my brothers.
Mission complete. I won't. Huh? Can I speak with Khan? I've heard about your victory in the arena. Most impressive. Between you and I, I do not believe the Great Khan expected you to risk your life. Engaging in Mortal Kombat at our behest proves your respect. Khan wants to speak with you. Go to him. Oh, shit. Your voice sent me. I've proven my respect for your culture. I accept my voice's decision. Perhaps I have finally found someone worthy of my task. Before we go, do you have any more questions? You mentioned a task. What does it involve? Patience, child. It's almost time. If you have no further questions, I'll take you to Ravox Cathedral. All will be explained. Me. I don't have any more questions. Then I have one last task for you. You'll see what it is soon enough. Follow me to Ravox Cathedral. Oh shit, what could this be? I think it might be a Ravax Cathedral. It's probably going to be electrify myself with one of them electric sticks. That'll be funny if it is. Yeah, baby. Oh. Wait here. What is it? I must speak with Asmir. We will continue afterwards. Asmir. Yes, my lord. I am going to Ravox Cathedral. Ah, so it is time. It is. My instinct tells me I have found the one. Then I won't keep you any longer. May Ravok welcome you into his perfect oblivion. May Ravok watch over you too, my friend. Let's continue. I No questions. Shit, this is this is getting a bit shady, lads. I don't know if I don't know if I like this. Silence. Why? No talking. I must prepare for what is to come. Patience. A few more levels and we will be there. Oh, we've never seen this part of the, the place. Oh, that's what I remember when we fought the bouncer and then as soon as we ended the fight, there's a guy up there who was like, where the fuck do you think you're going? I think it's because I was past the threshold and I wasn't allowed down here. But now I am. Kind of like the upper levels of the Berserker area. You had to like get so far in their, their quest to be trusted. I think we've just achieved that here. Oh, my head. Not the time, Jax. Damn infection. If I don't get a handle on it, that thing is going to happen to me. Oh, is this their leader, leader? This is Bahadur. Speak with him. He will explain. My words are coming to an end. I will await your decision. I trust it will be a wise one. Bahadur. I see you're here with Khan. Strange as it is, he must have a good reason for getting an outsider to do the job. But before we begin, tell me, do you wish to join us? To walk the path of the Morkons, worship Ravak, and be a protector of Oblivion? Not yet. I need to think about it. Khan obviously thinks you a worthy successor. I understand your hesitation. For now, let's focus on why you came to Ravox Cathedral. Has Khan told you why you're here? No. He kept that to himself. Ah, he's a man of few words. Then I suppose it's my privilege to give you the good news. Khan has chosen you to take his life. What the fuck? <laughs> no problem. 
Okay, no problem. When? Your willingness is pleasing. I can see why Khan chose you. When you are ready, find me, and the fight will begin. I've still got questions for Khan. Why does he want to die? There may be many reasons. There is no greater honor than sacrificing yourself in the name of balance. To cast aside this fragile shell and be reborn in Ravok's arms is every Morkon's ultimate goal. It Khan seems foolish. Has chosen his time. It is unusual, but honorable without compare. Why did he choose me? I can only assume he sees something in you that he doesn't in others. I cannot speculate further. Only he knows his reasons. If he hasn't confided in you, then he will likely take this knowledge into Ravok's arms. Is this the only way to join the Morkons? There must be balance. We can only welcome a new member oh, into our that's faction right. when a current one has returned to Ravok. That's right. Although, that doesn't seem to apply to the dregs the poachers keep bringing to the grotto. If you wish to become a true Morkon, this is the only way. This is the only way. So I'll take Khan's place. In a manner, if that is what you want. As his executioner, you are blessed with that option. Of course, you won't have his rank or command the respect we show him. You'll have to earn those for yourself. But you will have the honor of adopting his duties. Excellent. Hey, hold on. Make a save. I think this fight's probably going to be hard, but no harder than anything else we do. He's, he's a human after all. I'm going to kill him. All right. I've made my decision. Yes. I'll take Khan's life. I'm glad to hear it. I'll make the arrangements. I trust that you'll grant Khan an honorable death. I won't make it easy for you. Good. Hang on a minute. You're going to fight back? <laughs> of course. Only death in battle is honorable. That was remarkable. Yeah, Falk's a bit of a uh, a bit of a freak. He loves I Falk loves it when I like be a bit of a dick, even though I'm not being a bit of a dick. I'm just like giving them what they want. But uh, let's go, baby. Are you prepared? I still have a few questions. The time for questions is past. Let's do it. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's fight. <laughs> you have my thanks. May Ravok receive you. May Ravak be with you. And with you. Fucking dickhead, I didn't even fucking know we were fighting there. Oh my god. He's not even hard. He's not even hard. Execution! I need stamina. He's going down to Chinatown like. Domino issues, domino issues. He's nearly dead. Wapa! He blocked it. Get wrecked. Praise be to Ravok. Khan is reborn in Ravok's arms. I admit I had my doubts, but you proved a capable fighter. I'm the best.
Perhaps Khan was right to choose you as his executioner. It was my honor. I'm pleased to hear it. In recognition, I will grant you a request. What do you want? If it's in my power, I'll grant it. Oh. About that favor. That was impressive. You, he was using a damaged weapon. Why would he? Why would he use a damaged weapon? He's a fucking leader. Wait, right, hold on. What do you think we can get from this guy? About that favor. How many shards are you gonna give us? I wouldn't mind some shards. I see. If this is what you desire. I trust a that thousand. will be sufficient. That's interesting. I had hoped you'd take Khan's place in our ranks, but I see I was mistaken. I want to join the Morkans. Of course. It is your right. For you to take Khan's place restores balance, as it should be. But be warned. If you choose to join us, you must ah, okay. dedicate your life to Ravak. So this is the point of no return. You cannot join another faction. Be absolutely sure this is what you want. Nice. Hmm. I need to give it more thought. So what was the other option? Oh, the other option was just like loyalty, wasn't it? That's, I'm interested to find out what what happens if we say that. I just want to see what the dialogue options are. What are you doing? I, I'm still I'm still taking the grand. I'm taking the grand. About... It was a privilege to send Khan to Ravak. I don't need a reward. I see. Destruction. You're truly an honorable warrior. Yeah, there's I no hope... point. But, oh, we got a thousand experience. Ex so, you can either take a thousand money or a thousand doing? experience. Do we get a thousand experience for finishing this here? I trust. I. You don't. Okay, lads. We're going to take the experience. Experience is always worthwhile. A thousand experience is quite a good okay? Is it? What are you doing? A thousand experience. We could just kill a couple of creatures for that, couldn't we? I think I'd vote, I'd, 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 lads, it's hard. Do, do I want the money? I've got nine grand. With ten grand, I could kit myself up with some good armor. You know what I mean? Look, at the end of the day, we need 60,000 experience to level up. 58,000. 1,000 experience. Yeah, I don't think we need experience, do we? I think I'd rather take the money. Right, well, I'm going to take the money. Fuck it. About that... I'm not going to do this yet. We'll leave this there, right? So we, if we want to, we can join the Morcons, right? That's exactly where I want to leave it. Now, we're going to go out on an adventure. So, where can we go? I want to go here. This has got to be where the clerics are. Fastest way there is probably here. And we need to head... Oh, look at them pretty lights. This way. Come on, then. And then after we go here, we're going to go and see the outlaws at the crater. Because we've got a quest there as well. And I think I'd, I'd like to investigate everybody. Whoa. We've been in there, haven't we? I'm not entirely sure if we've been in here. Oh, we have. This is the... Bloody hell, this is the factory that we met Falk at.
Yeah, it is. Okay, here we go. This looks like a base. Oh shit, overshot the mark. Oh, that could have ended in death. I nearly fell off the edge. Nothing. This is this reminds me of the dome city just without the dome. I know it's not though. It's in a completely different place. Fast travel. A berserker. Excuse me. Yes, you. Look, cleric Haven't seen robots. You around here before. Well, whatever your reasons for coming here, we clerics aren't in the business of turning people away. That said. It's my duty to make sure every traveler who arrives here knows how we run things. No stealing and no fighting. Understood? They're two of my favorite things. It's going to be pretty hard to promise not to do any of them. Yeah, that's a good point. You don't even look like a cleric. You don't look like a cleric. Not like any I've ever seen. Ha! Huh. I'd much rather be wearing the official uniform. But we have limited resources. So where did that armor come from? A while ago, our scouts came across some Berserkers and Morkons fighting. The Berserkers were completely outnumbered, didn't have a chance. The Morkons wiped them out and just left their corpses where they fell. It was the scouts' duty to give them a half-decent burial. But it wasn't possible to bury them with such bulky <laughs> armor? Yeah, though as you can see, it's been put to good use. We clerics do not tolerate wastefulness. Now, I know you're not here to talk about armor. Well, actually. So, how about I give you a guided tour? It's quiet right now. I can leave my post for a while. Unless you have any more questions. Tell me, are you the only guard at this gate? Yes, if you don't count the combat mechs. Completely unreliable, those things. Too glitchy. Anyway, I can't complain. It's a solitary job, but my work allows everyone to sleep soundly. I'm proud of that. A cleric dedicates their life to saving others. How are things here? These are troubled times. We've been attacked, displaced, scattered. There's a risk that our community, our identity, will be lost forever. People are losing hope. They don't believe this situation will ever change. Hmm. What situation? What situation? What situation? Have you been living in a cave? Kind of. The Albs drove us out of Ignadon. Then those disgusting creatures rained down from the sky and caused havoc. We've lost nearly everything. Our very existence is under threat. Should I go on? Shit, we've never seen the Albs yet either. Sorry, I asked. Well, they must be in Ignadon. Don't get me wrong. We're not all in despair. Some of us still believe we have a future. If we can regroup, focus on things we can achieve, not what we can't, play to our strengths. If we can do that, I'm certain our ranks will start to increase again. But I don't want a tour of the base. If you still want a tour, you know where to find me. Okay, well, that's interesting. Yeah, the cleric robots. Oh, wait there. I want to actually have a speak to this, have a, have a speak, have a word with this merchant. What are you selling? Come here, come here. I've got money hey now. Hey there, stranger. Tell me what you need. I've got it all. Okay, show me what you've got. It'll be a pleasure, friend. He sounds a bit shady. Right. Longsword. Six grand! Okay, I don't think we'll buy anything off this guy. He's a bit expensive. Oh, he sells armor. But I don't need any head. He sells alb stuff. 
These glasses that I've got on, I've already got these glasses of 2,500. Right, outlaw shirt. Alb clothing. The cleric shirt. I like, I like the way this looks. 30 armor. For 1,200. 1,300 for the, the outlaw. The outlaw shirt, shirt does look pretty good. Very good rebel pants, four and a half grand. We're not we're not spending that much money. Alp pants. Okay, what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna buy this armor. Cause I I I need to get some fashion souls on the go. This is three less armor than what I'm wearing, but I'm not really bothered. I mean this black t-shirt looks alright, but I'd rather have. And I don't actually have any leg armor, so that's plus 18 armor, it's amazing. Plus, I'll, I'll be net, plus 15 armor when I do this. Buy that. Cleric pants? Buy it. We are getting back to our roots. Okay. Accept. Cheers, bruh. It was a ple pleasure doing business with you. Just let me do it. Get attacked. What the fuck was that? Did he just blow himself up? Oh, baby, it looks good. Simple more con. Oh, that's the worst version. I've already got the standard Morcon shirt. They give me the simple one. Same as the Berserkers. Yeah, now we look like a beast. Oh, we look like... We actually look like we're competent now. Yeah, baby, look at my guy. Look at the drip. Right, now, okay. Now, this, this, this is what I'm talking about. Save this. Now, let's go and speak to the Corex. Want to get some missions. Look, I even look like one of them. Yeah, baby. Oh, look, this is our friend. We sent here, we saved him. Oh, he didn't have any additional dialogue. What can you teach? What do you want? He does combat. He does a lot of things, actually. That's a bit disappointing he didn't say, like, cheers for saving my enemy family's life. This cleric's camp has its advantages. Short communication paths, small population. The Hort was very different. Yeah, it was. The Hort was massive. Arms dealer. Oh shit, I probably should have came here first. Armorer. Hiya, kid. If you're looking for everyday clothes, I might have something for you. The range is pretty limited, but I'm sure we can find something to suit you. Can I buy cleric armor from you? Standard stuff won't do, huh? I'm sorry to disappoint you, but our armor is in short supply. Mm. We lost most of it when we fled from the Hort. I guess that means I leave here empty-handed. Well, I do have one absolute gem left, but it's under lock and key. What do you mean? We still have a set of regent armor. Really? If you want it, you'll have to make a big impression on Judicator Hagen. I can't release anything until he gives me clearance. Oh my god, I need that. You busy? Well, little, but I'm fine with that. You know, we used to go out at all hours of the day and night and get into some kind of fight. Now, we just don't have the soldiers. On the plus side, it means we're not constantly mourning the fallen. But as long as we're chatting, maybe you can tell me what things look like out there. I hear that the Dark Horde are putting up those towers everywhere. Is that true? It is. I can confirm that. My place got hit pretty hard. Oh, and you're still alive? If that happened to me, I'd crap my pants. How'd you make it out? Dumb luck. In my experience, there's no such thing. The Creator has plans for you, no doubt about it. In any case, thanks for the chat. It's good to talk to someone else. Here, for my personal reserve. It helps against every horror. 
Moonshine. You up for a trade? Sure. He sells the same stuff. It was for the same price as I bought it, so that's not that bad. Max stamina. Um, he does have jetpack fuel. What's this? Symbol of Kalan. Or oh, we can sell the symbols for money. Okay. Right, I wonder what the the weapons dealer sells. Hello. What goods have you got? Sure. Right, two seconds. Right, let's have. It's all right, yeah. Right? <laughs> this is just all right. <laughs> go on, Lil. Go and see your mom. Go and see your mom. <laughs> Dogs come to show us some loving. Right, anyway. So, what was I doing here? Looking for weapons. Oh, the damaged region sword. 69 strength, 51 dex. A sweater. Bladed mace. Alkalite sword's not bad. We need to start pumping our strength up. Yeah. Legged sword. We've got laser rifles. I've already got good stuff. Nah, we don't need that. I've already got laser rifles, I just haven't got the stats to wield them. Hey there. What? Frost resistance and health. Materials. Jetpack fuel. Oh. Spare parts. Just damaged stuff. Yeah, the the yeah. The clerics seem to have been a bit wiped out, haven't they? Vivian. If you want to buy something, go see Is this my Vivian? Merchants. Is this the They'll sell you what we can spare. Is this the mechanic? This is the mechanic? Oh, this is the one we have to speak to about Hank's gold bars. What do you make of this? Let me see it. Give it to me. <laughs> Who gave you this piece of crap? Mm. I was told you'd take it off my hands. What am I supposed to do with some worthless scrap? Knew it was a scum. Worthless? It's gold. Oh yeah? Take a closer look. It's iron with gold coloring. And I'm not even sure it's real iron. Someone ripped you off. I wonder if he would have ripped me off if I gave him the good stuff. I better go back to the fort. Sort this all out. Who was it? I mean, they seem to know me, right? Said his name was Hank. <sighs> Doesn't ring any bells. But who'd use their real name in this line of work, huh? Whoever it was, they thought I'd be fooled by this. Didn't realize I'm not a simple merchant. I have experience in dealing in stuff like this. Hey, maybe if you hurry, you can catch them before they get away. What are you doing here? It's my job to catalog and ration the supplies in the castle, which means I'm busy. So if you don't want anything, I'd appreciate it if you wouldn't bother me anymore. Okay, chill out. You need help with your work? Ah, so that's what you're after. You want a job. Well, if you want to help out, I always need supplies. So if you have any long life food you want to get rid of, give it to me. Our trade convoy has gone missing and there are no supplies coming in, which is a big problem. What happened to your trade convoy? If only I knew. They should have been here long ago. But if you're looking for work, I'd pay you to find them if you can and help them if they're still alive. I'll do it. Proper nutrition is extremely important for the maintenance of a society. We should take the time to assist her. Your friend may have a complicated way of expressing himself, but he's not wrong. I could use your help. About the trade convoy. 
Where should I start looking for them? They can't be that far away, actually. I know they were on their way back from the Berserkers. They're probably somewhere between the fort and our castle. I'll get the buck. I'll find them for you. I got this. I'll make it worth your time. If you can help them re-establish their trade routes, I will reward you handsomely. And if they're dead, well, at least then I'll know I don't have to keep on waiting. I have some supplies for you. You know, I'll only take large quantities off your hands. I can't do much with individual cans. Show me what you got. Ten times can meat? I brought you some canned meat. Thank you. Here's your payment. Fifty shards, is that it? I have some water for you. Thanks. I have some bread to give. Thanks a lot. Okay, I'm not going to give her any more. I'll give her ten of each. I'll be fucking happy with that. Right, so wait there, hold on. What's going on in here? Nothing exciting, but there isn't upstairs to this building. Looking for something? Oh, I'm in a loud appeal, like. Oh, there's a chest. What do you want? Go, go and do your job downstairs. I'm, I'm watching I'm, you. I've got this chest to pick. We could just go through the roof. Look, there's ladders. Ah. Climbing then. Will you get lost? What? Good decision. Right, so we're definitely not allowed. Good decision. We're definitely not allowed in there. But I want to be in there. Duck. What do I hate you this want? worker. We need, to, we need to wait for this worker to come downstairs and then we can go upstairs. What are you doing sneaking around here? Who's talking to us? Range weapons bench. Now I want this chest. Medium lock. Right, let's get in here. Boom, I'm in. Oh, grenade launcher. Ten decks. That's a good, good haul. I don't know what that was, but I stole it because I had to be quick. Rule number one of the cleric base, do not steal. Already broken. The only thing we haven't done yet is have a fight. <laughs> I suppose it's gonna be, we're gonna, that's going to be on the card soon. There you go. Okay then, let's have a look about. What we'll do is we'll search this base this episode, and then we'll go and do the missions first thing next episode. It's actually quite... actually quite big. It's a lot bigger than what I thought it was. It looked only like a small little town. Which, I mean, it still kind of is. Oh, this is where they make the mechs. What the hell is wrong with you, you piece of shit machine? I'll be right with you. Give me one sec. What's 
Let's go through it again. Servo motor, check. Hydraulics, check. Helix intake, check. Central processing unit. Ugh. How the fuck am I supposed to know? Okay, I have some time now. How can I be of service? Or maybe you can be of service to me. Give me your jobs. Let me think about combat mechs or drones. I'm struggling with the instruction cycle. They're like normal instructions, only more, uh, technological. Intelligence 30, I can do it. What's the error? Is it the number of clock cycles? Or the assignment of addresses in memory? Uh, what? I, uh, look, just forget I ever asked. I'll figure it out, eventually. So, what did you want again? Do you train technicians too? I don't have, uh, time, right. This guy's bluffing his that. job. But I've seen Vivian juggle a wrench now and again. Not that she comes close to my level of skill, but she can show you how to do that. Can, that sort of thing. Go and ask her. You can find her in the merchant storehouse. What do you do here? I solve problems. In theory, anyway. These shiny little buddies here, the ones we are endlessly tinkering with, the sooner or later they're supposed to fill the gaps in our ranks of soldiers. Looks like it might be a while. That's not quite true. I already have a prototype. All it needs is a little testing. You try getting results with a roll of wire and a few rubber bands. I'm not the problem here. I was trained by Master Goddard. May the creator bless his soul. Unfortunately, my work here also makes me irreplaceable. I can never find the time to go out and give my prototype a proper field test. I'll test it. I'll test it for you if you like. Oh, well, sure, I mean, why not? I would prefer to test it myself, but I won't turn down the offer. Right, so, I'll set the prototype to run a routine outside the castle. I want you to follow and observe. It's programmed to protect us from enemies, so you should pay attention to how well it identifies and fights threats. Keep a record of how long it takes to deal with the enemies. I need to know if it's running efficiently or not. It should be approximately 37.5% faster at threat recognition compared to previous combat max. Got it. Great. Just hold on a second then. I'll send it on its guard routine. Get ready to give chase. Oh shit, okay, we're doing this right now then. Come on then. Unit ZX-01. Initialize new routine. Execute routine Alpha-1 with subroutine B. Huh. Well, these readings are a little odd. What the... Let's get that. I have the sinking feeling that I might need to work on the prototype a little bit longer. You don't fucked up, Holmes. Don't say. Sorry, I... Must have made a mistake when calibrating the enemy detection. Good thing we managed to destroy it, huh? <laughs> yeah, kind of a shame, though. Now I have to start from scratch again. This guy's useless. Still, thanks for wanting to help out. I appreciate it. I'll let you know when I have a new prototype ready for testing. Provided you still want to help, I mean. Yeah, I'm not so sure of that. Here, take this. We'll call it hazard pay. 200 shards. That was an all right quest. Thanks for your help. I okay, so that's his quest done. Weapons workbench. Oh, what's this? Right, take it. Blacksmith. What the hell? Bro, I'm, I'm stealing all your you scrap. Doing? I'm having your scrap. <laughs> it's not technically stealing, so I'm taking it. I think we'll head up. Oh, there's a building here. Looks like a church. This looks like where the leader's gonna be. It's Hagen. He's the year. Uh, the warrior master. Will he remember me? Oh, he won't remember me because going with the clerics isn't the canon of the first game. It doesn't remember your choices. Huh. You and I have met before. We have. 
Where have I seen that face? We met in the Hort. Right, in the Hort. I trained a lot of recruits there. You know, back when it was still in one piece. Finding a single half-decent recruit is a near-impossible task. So I'll get to the point. Are you going to help us out or not? Yes. It depends. What do you want from me? To be honest, quite a lot. But I'll take that as a yes. Look, anyone who works for me gets food, shelter, and fair pay for a day's work. Think it over. My door is always open. You'll find me a fair boss. I always speak my mind. Even if I do seem a little blunt at times. Take this. Use it to pick up your rations in the canteen. A personalized rationing system is logical. It would allow the elimination of weak points within the supply chain. <laughs> nice speech, but a simple thanks would do. Any other questions? Fire away. Anytime. What can I do to help? Simple. Go where help is needed. Then help. As far as I'm concerned, that's all it takes for me to treat you as a cleric. That's it? I'm a soldier. I don't like to overcomplicate things. I can't provide you with a uniform, though. We are all out of those. You're kidding me. No. Our armorer offers the standard protective gear, but no uniforms. The only one left is a regent's uniform, and I'm not giving that to you. Why not? Well, more accurately, I'm not giving it to you yet. Good answer. You'll have to earn it, and that won't be easy. If the armor's really what you want, you need to gain access to the Alves. Infiltrate them. Right. I told you it wouldn't be easy. Oh, shit. I'll also tell you why this is so important to us. Ever since they began occupying Ignodon, the Alves have left us in peace. Unfortunately, there's no guarantee they'll keep that up. The Alves are a threat we can't ignore, so I'd like to be as informed as possible. It's not enough to be one of their scouts. Gain the rank of trooper, and then we'll talk. Cool. Excellent. Got... Yeah, there's loads, lad. This game is all about infiltration. We've got to infiltrate the Alves and then talk to this guy. Oh, it's Rainhold. This is actually the leader of the clerics. Jax, a most unexpected visitor to our holy halls. Is it fate that in these troubled times you have found your way back to us? It is. Again we meet with dark clouds hanging over us. Little has changed since we took up arms against our common enemy. At that time, you spoke of mankind's impending doom, and of those who would cause it. It shames me to think of how little heed I gave your wise words. Forget it. I've had moments of doubt myself. And out there, the invaders build their towers of destruction. Exactly what you tried to warn us of. Actions are what count. We must think about our future. How to destroy this enemy. That's exactly what we're doing. Now the wounds inflicted upon us have healed. We have rallied ourselves and are planning our resurgence. I was hoping you could help me. I need some better gear and some good instructors in the art of armed combat. I see. You've lost a great deal of the strength you once had. The war against the Alps took a great deal from all of us, and the situation seems liable to get worse in the future, not better. That war was six years ago. It's not a problem anymore. I was bitten by one of the invaders' dark creatures, infected with their plague. It crippled many of my combat skills. I need to work on them again, from scratch. I wish I could help you, but in these dark days, I have to think about my own faction. Bro, I am your own faction. We have faction. neither the resources nor the time to train you, or to share our weapons. That is unfortunate. To us, you are an outsider. We must focus on our own survival, and that means holding on to every last scrap we have. Hmm. I want to join the clerics. I believe you're trying to talk me into joining the clerics. 
That would be one way to solve this dilemma. Though, from the look of you, you'd have to start your training with the basics. And that isn't something the clerics can afford to offer you. We simply can't spare the manpower or the relevant supplies. That's my final word, I'm afraid. We won't be able to give you basic training mm. in our weapons technology. You know, I like your attitude. I'd like to join you. I'm glad to hear that. Our approach to combat closely resembles that of the Alves to the north. If you want to join us, I suggest you go to them first. Okay. They can teach you the basics. You want me to train with your enemies? They're not the only ones who would rather see us dead. These last few months, many evils have come to torment us. The Alps are the least of our worries. When you've completed your basic training, we can talk again about your initiation into the cleric community. As an Alp commander, my specialty was Elix abilities. My repertoire didn't include other weapons until much later. Then it's those abilities you should start improving. They will make you a valuable asset to the clerics. I'll be returning to you as an Alb. You're okay with that? That is what you were in the first place. Once you've learned the fundamentals of high-tech weaponry, speak to Judicator Hagen. He'll be able to answer your questions. Interesting. We all have burdens to bear. I wish you okay. every success so I've got to, on the I've rest got to join the, of the journey. I've got to join the Alves that was first remarkable. to get my basic training. What's this? It, 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 I like how they've done it, actually. Because they've just said, like, yeah, we, 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 we've got, we don't have the manpower. Get your training elsewhere and come back to us and we'll teach you the, the best stuff. Oh, okay, nice, nice. Okay, let's see what else is going on here. This does look very similar to the Dome City. Like, even, like, the layout and the walls. It's like a castle. Random warehouse. Oh no, it's up to the tower. I can see we've got the launcher. I can see everything. Damage rocket launcher. Grenades. This must be the armory. They've got like four things. They they are they are really dilapidated. A piece. Yeah, they like. The clerics have the best looking armor hands down, there's no doubt about that. But they're not much of a faction, are they? If this is what they've become. They've got a few malfunctioning robots and that's it. Hard times. See if we can find any more NPCs for quests. Oh, the, oh, they've got the library. They've even managed to get their library. War stories. Take it. There's somebody typing over there. Eva. Jax, is that you? Damn. What a wonderful surprise. It's been what, six, seven I can't years? actually remember who she is. You look well. How are things? Need help with anything? I'll, be, I'll, be, I'll remember who you are. Just, I'll, 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 I don't really know, I forgot. Glad to see you again too, Ava. I have so much to tell you. I'm guessing Alex showed you where you can bunk down for the night. I expect you've got a lot on your mind right now. If you need a little time to yourself, I completely understand. We can catch up later. Oh, let's catch up now. Maybe you share a bottle of wine? 
if that's your thing. Yeah. What exactly do you do here? I'm in charge of the Archives of Knowledge. I don't know if you remember, but once upon a time, I wasn't even allowed to step foot inside the Archives. I remember her. Now look at me. I'm responsible for preserving all the knowledge we have. I remember who she is. <laughs> How times change. It was so long ago, it feels like a different world. Remember our old home? All that was left was a smoldering ruin. If you're interested, I can also share some of my newfound knowledge with you. What do you say? Yes, yeah, she was the one that wanted to know the true history of the clerics. Everything about the um, infinite skies in Kalan. And we helped her do it by infiltrating the library. And now she's the, the library master. What can you teach me? Mainly things that will improve your cognitive abilities. And looking at those muscles of yours, yeah, I can see that baby. it's about time you started training your mind. She's too. checking out the guns. Attribute points. Five percent experience. I don't really think that's very good. Nah, we don't need any of this shit. Mind if I take a look around the archives? I'd be insulted if you didn't. If you're looking for anything in particular, just let me know. Okay, so she's just a trainer. She doesn't really do anything. Fair enough. Oh, I don't want to steal that. I'm looking for chests and loot, but they have got... Oh, here we go, here we go. That was easy. All the way at the end, all the way back to the start. You know what, while we're here, we might as well sleep. Shit. Anyway. That didn't work. This is quite hard, this. That's it. You've done it. No, we haven't. There it is. Done. Eva's notes. I'm drowning in books, piles of papers, and a cascade of poems. My greatest wish has always been to dedicate my entire attention to the written word. Now I find myself wanting. Diving into literature is no longer enough. I desire a fresh breeze, sunlight, and most of all red roses. Their scent lets me dream, lets me forget the world around me. Sadly, I was only able to scrounge together a few plants, and now that the archive is growing, piling up around me, and all I can think about is greenery. Where is my mind, and where are the arms that will hold me when the nights grow cold? Oh my god, lads, I think we should get stuck into here. Look into Eva. Let's see if we can confront her about this. Yeah, baby. Because we're no longer with Kai, are we? So we might as well get some stuck in face first. Where's she gone? Oh, we, ah, we can't. We can't do that. That's fair enough. Right, where to next? There's this part. Where the hell am I going? Yeah, I've got some mad technology in here. I don't know what the fuck it is. There's a doctor. Can I get a doctor? Oh, he's just called a cleric. He's not even named. Nope.
Okay, that's a shame. We've got to get on this roof. We've got to. Oh, we've been in here? Yeah, we've already been in here. Shit, lads, I don't even know where I'm. I don't, I've got, I don't even know where I am. I'm just trying to find... Here we go. Who's this dude? Forgive us, O Creator. Johannes. Grant me the power to bring sight to the blind. Ah, a new seeker. I look at you and see that, like all wayward souls, you were led here by an inner emptiness. But your search is at an end. You have reached your destination. The Creator welcomes you. Tell me more about the Creator. He is the bread that fills your stomach. He is the light that brings you. Is he gonna fill us some bullshit day. about Kalan? I bet he is. The signpost for the lost. If you wish, I will gladly strike up a hymn so that we can pay homage <laughs> to him together. No thanks. No need. I think I get the picture. I'm actually looking for work. Oh no, my son. No, 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 no. That is not what you seek at all. But your mistaken seeking brings us to a vitally important question. Why do we dedicate ourselves every day to drudgery? Do you know what our creator has taught us about this? This is quite simple. Humans enjoy the release of certain neurotransmitters. Depending on the biological makeup of the individual, physical labor may also trigger that release, resulting in feelings of happiness chemistry neurotransmitters these are just words they don't do justice to oh, the this guy's brain dead our nature but back to my question are you aware of the creator's teachings i know exactly Not what the teachings so are words but i have a sinking feeling you're about to tell me my son a man afraid to talk about his beliefs and those of another is no man at all the Creator says, Come to me, all of you who are weary and burdened. But how does he conclude his offer to us? Do you know? Because I am the path upon which you walk. Because I am the path upon which you walk? My son, would you trample the Creator underfoot? Walk on his ever-loving face? <laughs> yes. Ah, but you still oh, have much to learn. It's cancelled. It is my honor and blessed purpose to lead lost spirits like yours out of the darkness. So let us direct our attention to an opportunity that might be exactly what you need. I ask that you journey to the lands of the savages to spread the word of the Creator. Oh, I'm not doing that. Take on this pilgrimage and his eternal gratitude will be your reward. Ah, oh, fuck this. Yeah. Well, let's just give him the right answer. Fuck it, I'm not doing that. I'm not going to pilgr here. pilgrimage for this prick. Because I will shoulder your burdens. Because I will shoulder your burdens. I see you are a man who heard the words of the Creator, my son. I knew from the moment I it's saw just like Jesus. that he had called you to me. And because your beliefs stand upon such strong foundations, I bestow on you the honor of helping It's exactly the same quest. Fruitful and multiply. Oh. I already have one son. That's enough for now. <laughs> I speak not of the miracle of birth. I speak of the miracle of persuasive words. I ask that you journey. Okay, spread the word. Okay. About that. What kind of payment can I expect for this? Is your own salvation not recompense enough? I was hoping for something more tangible. True. Cross my palm with gold. Mm. 
I must take some time to ponder this matter. In any case, you will certainly not be disappointed, my son. What do I have to do? Fear not. I don't expect you to stand on street corners and preach the word. The Creator's words are written down. They need only be placed in reach of lost souls. Take these flyers. Make them somewhere, somewhere visible. Somewhere the helpless are sure to set eyes upon them. When your work is done, return and we can open okay. our arms to the new arrivals together. Where exactly should I go? Do your ears not hear? Lands of savages. Do you mean the berserkers? Fort? That's what I think, the berserkers. That is one such place. The crater. The crater too. For the outlaws. Is home to many godless creatures whose ears are closed. They are savages indeed. I agree the outlaws the are savages. Morcons. What about them? They are wretched worshippers of a false idol. Their path leads only to darkness. Nothing. Not even the light of the Creator can save them from damnation. Do not concern yourselves with those who live in the ice either. Their hearts are frozen solid, and no words will thaw them. The Albs. So, the fort and Got it. Do you really think you can win people over like that? Of course. The pen is mightier than It's the sword. not. It's and not. So it has been since time immemorial. I caution you, do not follow the ways of our trainers. They see martial finesse as our greatest weapon, but true protection only springs forth from inner contemplation. Our ranks will fill up, believe me. Right, okay. That was right, what we'll do is... Yeah, that was impressive. What we'll do is, we'll call an episode here, because I need to eat. Right, when we come back... When we come back, I will check out that build and see that there's nobody else in there for a quest. I'll check out that building on the left, and that's going to take us back to the start. And we'll possibly check out this thing in the middle. Uh, oh, oh, I, I'm I was, I was, I just saw some weapons over there, and I was about to go over there. That's going to be a quest. Look, there's a guy there. Right, we'll we'll continue next episode. We'll get the quest from all these, these clerics, and then we'll start doing the cleric missions. That's going to be awesome. See you in the next one, lads. We've got some good news now. I've just had a new update for the game. Um, I've read the patch notes. Apparently there's some bug fixes to quests and things. Now, I've never actually experienced any bugs on, on the quests so far, which which is good. But apparently some have been fixed. And also, they've... It says they've fixed some graphical issues. Now, I'm hoping that's the flashing of the, the buildings and things in, in big towns and cities. So we'll see if that's that's been fixed, which is nice. I hope it is, because it, it is a little bit, of an, a little bit annoying. But also, it's... It says that there's a new camera mode. Now, I haven't actually had a problem with the main camera since I changed the field of view in the settings folder. But... I mean, that's pretty nice. This is the alternative camera. Let's have a look. By the looks of things, the alternative camera gives you... It's the same zoom that you've got while running. Lads, I think I prefer that. I think that's a lot better. That's so much better, especially for combat. Because you, you, you won't get snuck up upon as much. Right, okay, okay, brilliant. So what we're doing is we're still investigating the cleric's hideout. We want to try and speak to everyone. I've seen a guy over Great. here at the end of last episode. We we're all here because you do not seem to understand the gravity of the situation. While this war rages on, our enemy is growing stronger and stronger. Those things outside do not give a single thin shit about anything. Not what's fair or right or good. So if you've got any notion about laying down arms, forget about it. Now, get in formation. Before we get started on the drill, hear this. It has not escaped my notice that some of you have been slacking when it comes to maintaining your weapons. 
That is unacceptable. It is unacceptable. I will not tolerate rust. I will not tolerate carelessness. We do not have replacements. <laughs> now, get to it. You don't have replacements because I'm stealing everything? Oh, yes. I want to see continuous movements. No gaps in the sequence. Routine is... Training sequence. Everything. In a combat situation, you will not have time to think. Slack off for one second and the enemy will punish you. Okay. Hey, you! You're interrupting my training. Get information! <laughs> I'm looking for work, mate. I'm looking for work. Well, I'm sure there's a mop and bucket in the corner somewhere. That's not what I had in mind. Why am I not surprised? Look, I'm sure your intentions are good, but right now, I'm busy whipping these morons into shape. It's a miracle that most of these numbskulls even showed up today. There's twice as many who didn't even bother. Hmm. Yeah, who didn't turn up? Why would that be? You're asking for reasons? These idiots don't have reasons. They're like cattle. Lazy cattle. It is my duty to make sure that everyone who leaves this yard knows how to do their job. In order to achieve that, I need a little discipline. Unless I beat some sense of the real world into their thick skulls, they'll be off with the others preaching blue skies and sunshine. No amount of belief in the creator will save you if you're faced with a barrel of a gun or some deadly creature's jaws. Preach, my brother. In I that agree. Case, it would indeed be wise to strengthen defensive measures. True. But clever remarks have nothing to do with it. Guys like your friend there make terrible soldiers, always tripping over their own feet. If you're not one of these runts, come back tomorrow and I may have a use for you. Uh -huh. You there, maggot? Said how your grand- Okay. Can we do this now or do we have to wait a day? You said you had a use for me? Soldier, are you hard of- uh. Correct. So, unless you have a damn good- I work for more than just half the day. Wait until tomorrow. Then I'll tell you the plan. Okay. Okay, that's you fine. There, right, Maggie. so we're going to get a quest off him. How your grandpa fights. Before we do, we've got a couple of... Effort into it. We've got a couple of buildings to explore. There's this one here, which we've never been in. There's one on the left-hand side, I think. Never oh. let your guard down. We're allowed Situational this. Situational awareness. Keep your comrades safe by keeping the inn with the hole in something it. Something is greater than something. Enemy. Five is greater than What's four, going on which in is the back? smaller than formation? six, which is smaller than no, seven. Sir. <sighs> Five, four, and six are correct, but mouth. in the wrong place. I so you need some extra training. A lap around the yard. Move it. Cry yourselves to sleep later if you like. But while you're standing here in front of me, you six will is greater than maintain formation. Five, which is smaller Top than mama's boys four. Are of no use to me. Loud mouth. Six is greater than five. No use to five me. is smaller than. I need you to find your limits, because, make no mistake, you will need to push them oh. in combat! So hold on. Four is greater than... Three, which is smaller than... Six, which is smaller than five. <sighs> Close. So six and five is the other way around. Fair enough. Huh? Six and five. Can't be the other way around. Which is smaller than six. Oh shit, I got them the wrong way around because I'm an idiot. Five and six. Boom. I'm in. Some bread and some rockets. Fair enough. Not bad. It's not good. It's not good either. It's pretty dog shit. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm feeling the love for this new camera. What an update. Chest. Hard lock. Let's do it. We're just looking for two that stay up in a row. One, two, three. That didn't work. Hmm. Okay. Right, so one, two, three, four. One, two, three. One. One, two, three, four. 
Back one. Bang. 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 Oh. Okay. It's one, two, three, four. Back. That. Back that all. didn't work. Oh, I fucked it. This is, in fact, a really hard lock. One, two, three, four. Back. One, two. All the way back. All the way at the end. Boom, done. Boom, shakalaka. There's got to be something good in here. Damage, saviour. Elex drink. Not a bad haul. Not a bad haul indeed. Okay, right, so... This building here. Rocket man! Oh, is this the cafeteria? Cleric. Isaac. Hey, you! Got an ID card? I do, in fact, have an ID card. Fine. When you're ready, come get it. Your daily ration. One standard portion, same as everyone. It's not exactly fine dining, but it does the job. You hungry? Yes. My rations, please. Here you go, get it while it's hot. How long have you been the cook here? Ever since we evacuated from the Hort to the castle. I got the job by chance. The clerics lost so many people, they didn't have anyone to spare. I thought you were a cleric too. I am now, but not back then. I was sitting pretty in one of their jail cells. They set me free when they abandoned the Hort. Here was the only place I had to go. I mean, I didn't want to make friends with the Albs, so I just went with the clerics. Fair enough. It was definitely the right choice for me. I just wish everybody saw it that way. The funny thing is, right, the clerics are hands down the best faction. Like, obviously they've, they've been smashed in Elex too, like they're, they're a shadow of the four myself. But they were actually a decent faction. There was the, the they all had a, a set goal. They all pretty much worked towards it. There was hardly any infighting. If if I could say there was one faction that was going to actually save Magellan, it was going to be the clerics. You're not popular around here. Well, I get along great with half the people around here. The other half, I just stay out of their way. I, I can't blame them. I used to be an outlaw. It's no use trying to hide that fact. I just wish they'd look me in the eye and speak their mind instead of creating all kinds of trouble behind my back. Yeah, I can help. Maybe I can help. What are their names? When you say help... I'll have a little chat with them. Make them see sense. And if they don't... No, I don't want any violence. Brother Johannes teaches that the Creator only permits violence in emergencies. Outlaw turned true believer. I'm surprised. I am actually surprised what as well. What I've seen and done in my life, I should be a sobbing wreck by now. My faith is what gives me strength. Of course, I can't prove the Creator actually exists, but the mystery is truth enough for me. No mortal has ever been able to answer all the big questions. It stands to reason that there's forces out there greater than all of us. Okay, then. So, we didn't... He didn't give us a quest. What? Oh, maybe he didn't want us to do anything. So what is this under? Caracas. Yeah, we've done, we 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 got that last episode. We need to speak to him. Yeah, this guy hasn't actually got a quest. It's just like a weird one. So he won't tell us who's who's got issues with him. What are you doing? Oh, sorry, bro. I didn't realize this was this was this was off limits. It doesn't look as if there's an upstairs. Come on then. Who are you, Larrick? Yeah, I don't think we've been in this building. Maybe we have. Oh no, we haven't. Oh, there's another chest. No, oh, it, it, just it's too high level. Head. I think I am going to have to buy... I'm going to buy the second level of, of hacking. 
when I can. If, it, if there's a trader here that can do it, I'm going to take it. Mana potion, goblet. Okay. Nobody watching, so I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it all. Oh, there's another safe. No, nope. just can't do that. These are high level safes. This is the one we've all is this the one we've already been in? No. I want the money box. Got him. Got him. Right, so we've been in there, been in there, been in there. Haven't been in this one. A hearth, goblet, ah, uh, not much. Is that a fuel cell? That's not. Right, so we came in there. It looks like we're going. Oh, actually no. No, 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 no. We came down here. Yo, I'm lads. I'm lost. So I haven't been in this one. Oh, that's the one with the goblet. That's fair enough. I'm not taking that. Right, come on then, straight through. Lads, this area, this area is, is, is like... It looks small, but it's big. I think I said that last episode as well. <laughs> I, t I tell all the girls that. It looks small, but it's big, baby. Scrap. Nah, I'll not bother stealing that. This must be like the living quarters. Ooh, storage room. I'll take that, baby. What else? Oh, look, there's people's rooms. We're allowed in this one as well. Well, we're not allowed technically, but I mean I can get in it, which means I'm allowed. So something is bigger than something, which is bigger than something. So six is greater than five, which is greater than four, which is smaller than seven. Worried you'll be caught. Oh shit. Worried you'll be caught. Who the fuck? Who the fuck? Oh, there's a guy over. Caught? there. All right, chill, chill, chill. There's a guy over here, which is... Oh, he's a god. Right, let's try this again. Six is greater than five, greater than four, greater than... We'll try that. Six, five, four, seven. So... Nine is greater than eight, which is greater than six. No, I can't have that. Can't have that. Eight is greater than... Six, which is greater than two, smaller than nine. <sighs> Fuck. Two is greater than one. One's greater than zero, which is smaller than six. Got it, baby. I'm in. That was terrible loot. Did that say I could? Bed. Right, come on then. There's another floor to this area. Chest. Let's go, baby. Right. Easy as that. All the way to the end, all the way back to the start. Done. Cleric simple cap. Not gonna use it, but I'll take it. Good stuff. Right now that's leading us back out because we wanna go upstairs.
Yeah, this camera is so much better. I don't know why they wouldn't have that on release. Personal letter. Someone's looking at us. Worried you'll be caught. Who's look? Yeah, this guy has got eagle eye, hawk eye vision. Our beloved creator, this wonderful creator that. I can't take it anymore. We can pray all we want, but you can't eat prayers. We go to the paladins and help them. At least there, we'll learn something and won't have to listen to this preacher drone on and on. Rather put in a bit of elbow grease, bolt some mechs together. It would be awesome if we got to test the repaired guns too. Either way, it will make more sense than the bullshit Brother Johannes is always spewing. Well, I, I do agree. But Brother Johannes is a bit... He, he's gone. But still... Overall... I like these guys. Thick rubber soup. Okay, right, I think that's... I think that's everything done, really. Come on, then. So I came in over there. Right. Come on then, what's a cracker lacking? Nothing in here? Nah, these are just the ramparts. Did I I went on top of that. Right, come on then, so let's pick a quest. We've got a few to do for these these people. I wanna get them done. Oh wait, 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 wait. We need a oh man, we need a bed. Remember I need to rest the day and that and we'll get that, that guy's quest. Remember what Elix can do. Remember. Let's sleep. I don't think this guy minds using the beds, does he? Can't use them beds. Oh shit, wait there, I missed that. Toilet roll. Oh, there's another safe. Okay, I'm glad, glad, I, I'm glad I came back in there. Something is greater than something. Eight's greater than seven, which is smaller than nine, which is greater than six. <sighs> Eight and six are correct. Sure. In the wrong place, though. Five is greater than four, which is smaller than eight, which is greater than six. Oh, shit. Okay. So it's going to have to be... Six is greater than five, which is smaller than eight, which is greater than eight, greater than three. Two. Oh, got there in the last minute. Terrible, terrible loot. I just need a bed. Now we'll go and see that guy. What was he called? Henrik. Henrik. Boom. Right, we'll wait a day, get that quest, and then we're going out. We're leaving this place. Man. What a mess. Fall in! You said you had a use for me? That's correct, soldier. Although your inability to track time makes me wonder whether you're really the right man for this job. What? Listen up. I'm going to lay it all out. I've asked around about you. Seems you've already had military training. I have. They also say you're a specialist in foreign terrain. Personally, I'd have put you on latrine duty, but there's more to you than I thought. I'm offering you a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to put your skills to real use. Interested? I am. Where do you need me? Where do you need me? I like your determination. Keep it up. Let me be clear. We have very few supporters, even fewer soldiers. And an army that can't fight is no army at all. These walls are a prison. I want us to escape. And to do that, we need soldiers. People who know what they're doing. 
not a bunch of religious nut jobs who think prayer's the answer. I don't care if we're working with thieves or thugs or any kind of criminal. Beggars can't be choosers. And you think I'm a little bit of all those things, right? No. We're talking right now because you spend time with these sorts of people. And don't try to tell me otherwise. <laughs> I want to use your connections to win these people over to our cause. Can I count on you? You can. You can. What do you need me to do? You can. What do you need me to do? You've got backbone. Good. I'll keep it short. I'm sure you're familiar with the outlaw's crater. Well, I know of it. I haven't been savages. there. Toss their trash straight out onto the street. They treat their people the same way, but we can use the people they throw out like trash. Head to the crater, find out who's on their hit list, and bring them here. Interesting. That's good. About the outlaws. What does this guy do? I learn from it's going to be combat, isn't it? I wasn't planning. If I had to teach up. Oh, he can't. I... Special treatment in exchange. I'll make you a deal. I will charge you a small fee for each unit of training. Well, that's normal. In exchange, I will help you improve. Oh, okay. Well, there's no point. This guy's a combat trainer. He wants to charge me extra elixir. I'll just go to somebody else. Right. So, the, may have made you the quest that I want to do first the is... The one who owns you makes you useful. The... Think it'll be easier somewhere else than get out of my sight. Missing cleric trader. You can't handle the trading. Then go home and cry to your mothers. If you believe it's tough in here, then try making friends Until with the monsters test of the outside there. world. I hope you understand me. Now, back to the barracks. Vivian, the cleric warehouse manager, is worried about the trade convoy. This is what I want to do. And it's just there. Boom. Right, let's go. We'll sort these guys out. They're probably going to be dead. But I mean... Most people are. Most people are in this world. And what I want to try and do is... I want to see if I can get... get because I've got quite a few points now. I want to see if I can like upgrade my weapon. Not necessarily upgrade it, but use a new one. Like do more damage, if that makes sense. Because I can I can get by, but it would be nice to do a little bit of extra damage. I've run myself into a dead end here. What the fuck do I get out of here? There's only one. That's only one door in. Actually, never went behind here, did I? Ritual night. Okay, we're going down here, are we? Oh, yes. Let's go, baby. Rocket man. Right where we need to be. Oh, we dropped right into the fray battle. Oh, this is so much better, this camera view for combat. Oh, we caught us in midair. Oh shit, I thought he was, he was attacking the Falk. Got him. Got him. Is this the convoy? God? Traveler merchant. Damn creatures everywhere. You're screwed without a weapon. I'm so glad you found us. You wouldn't happen to be the trade convoy that Vivian wants me to find. Ah, uh, thank Callahan. Vivian sent you. I was afraid we'd be written off as dead already. We could really use your help. Is this guy even really a cleric? He was like, thank Callahan. It's Callahan, not Callahan. <laughs> First, tell me what happened. Uh, I don't even know where to start. Beasts came out I of wanted nowhere. To try a new shorter route. We knew it was dangerous, but we tried anyway. We were halfway back from the fort heading towards the castle when we were attacked. We ran away up the hill. Me and one of my guards lost our weapons on the way. Oh shit, okay. 
I want to tell him this. You should have strapped your guns on properly. Huh. You ever try strapping your gun down while Reavers shoot holes in the ground behind you? Reavers. That wasn't all. We somehow escaped the Reavers and saw a hut. We thought we'd hide out in there for a while. As we slowly worked our way up, these damn spine hounds came and attacked us. So we ran again. We ran up here. Seems like my other guard lost his weapon on the way. And that's how you found us now, with no guns and those beasts on our tails. As you can see, we could really use your help. I'll sort it out. You want me to help you look for your weapons? Oh, we would appreciate that, yeah. We can't show our faces in the castle again without them. We might as well throw ourselves to the spine hounds. Where'd you lose them? We lost two weapon packs somewhere on the way up here. Just look along the side of the road. The last weapon pack must be somewhere up here. We just can't seem to find the damn thing. There's three. Once you have them, please bring them back here quickly. I don't feel safe at all walking around unarmed. Okay. Right, three weapon packs. They are in this area. I'll find your shit. Yeah, that must be one there. I'll get this loot off the, the body first. See, these glasses are top tier. How the hell would I have found this without this? Lost weapon pack? One. He said two down here, by the road. Where's the, where the fuck's the road? Oh, here it is. There it is. Got him. I still, lads, lads, we've heard that noise so many times. I still haven't seen what, what it is. It is really quite amazing how creative nature can be. These cliffs are clear proof of that. Yeah, it is. It's, uh, it's wonderful. There it is. Boom shakalaka. Level up to what I like to see. I got you, shit boys. It's a shame it wasn't real weapons because I would have just kept them myself. I found your weapon packs. Fantastic! At last. Now we can hit the road again and get back to our trade route. I'm sorry I don't have anything to give you in return. It's okay. I'm on assignment for Vivian. She'll pay me. Oh yeah, right. You told me that already. In that case, I won't keep you any longer. I'm just glad we can finally get back to our trade route. Thanks again. I guess we'll see each other sometime. Kalaan's blessings be upon you. Kalaan be with you, friend. Okay, right, so let's go back and see her. Vivian. She was in here, wasn't she? I'm pretty sure she was. She was in that first building on the left. Oh, he, is this her? Yeah, it is. About the trade convoy. I helped them, and they're back on the road. So you did it! Ah, thank you. Hopefully I'll be getting my regular deliveries again soon. I promised you payment, so here it is. Cheers, I'll, that'll do. Thanks. Okay then. See you around. And don't forget, if you ever have any supplies, I'll gladly take them off your hands. Is this Excellent. the only quest? Oh, Kino says you're good with technology. Kino says you're good with technology. Oh yeah? Somehow I doubt he put it quite so nicely. The only ass he kisses is his own. If he talks about me, it's only to make me look bad. You're not a fan of his then? 
Ah, it's mutual. But you must have noticed that he doesn't deserve that position. He thinks he does just because he got here before me. He forgets that I was already in charge of this stuff back in the domed city. Why well, that's where she came from. About it. Ah, why bother? The way he behaves, he'll be dead in the dirt within a year. Besides, I'm needed here. If he and I traded places, our supply chain would dry up in two days tops. But I'd be happy to teach you if you'd like. For a small fee, of course. Okay, what can you teach me? Could you teach me? She teaches build weapons. Gemstone socket. She teaches hack. So wait there, lads. I need 30 cunning to get level 2 hack. I might just get it. 30 cunning. Right, we'll not Excellent. do that now. Because I want to I wanna do some of these quests, right? But I'm thinking... I've got 80 attribute points. So if I put... I'm going to get 30 cunning. Let's just do it now. Because these are only costing me one, aren't they? They're only costing me one. Right? So if I did that... That means that we, we don't have to worry about... We can just do everything once we come across it. I've done it. I've done it. Too bad it's done. Right, let's learn this. Because I, um, I don't want to remember where anything is anymore. I just want to unlock everything. Teach me. Teach me this. Bang. Right, we've got level 2 hack. Happy days. We've got level 3 lockpicking. Nothing is safe from us. Right, so we've done that. I'll concentrate on damage at the end of this episode. Sure. Caracas. We've got Dixon's mailman. I told Dixon I'd deliver something for him. Oh, that that's that that was for one of the the people in the Morcons. That's the same. Recruiting for Henry. The cleric Henry badly needs men. He's willing to take unusual steps to recruit more people. Convince some outlaws. Right, where's that? Eric Jan has asked me to post a notice promoting the clerics in both the fort and the crater. But we can do this. Well, that's taking us to the crater. This is taking us to the crater. Okay, looks like we're going to the crater. And that's taking us to the crater as well. It is. Right, okay. What we'll do is we'll do this. We'll quickly go back to the Berserkers. We'll get that posted on the notice board. Also, while we're here, while we're here, what we'll do is we'll report back to Rast. Because I think we can get some experience here. Because we've, we've done this quest ages ago, we just never reported back. We sorted the... Well, well, we didn't. We, The guy that ran away, we didn't kill him. We just let him go and sent him to the clerics. Barrett and Ejnar. So these two, Barrett and Ejnar. I spoke to Barrett the traitor. Ah, what did she tell you? He sees I'm not the first person you sent to spy on her. Tell the truth. Oh, I didn't find anything out. Protect Barrett. Hmm. But there's no difference, was there? She's, I'm not the first person you sent to spy on her. I'm going to protect Barrett because Rat's a fucking prick. What happens if I tell the truth? She says I'm not the first person you sent to spy on her. Oh, so she figured you out, huh? I'm gonna take a wild guess. You didn't get anything useful from her. No results, no payment. You understand. What a dickhead. I found Ejnar. What did you do to him? Was it painful? He won't cause you trouble anymore. I'm sure he won't. Mm. But that wasn't my question. Yeah, we let him go. What did you do with him? Tell me. I killed him. I killed him. Ah, my very own executioner. Now I can finally sleep easy again. 2,000 XP. Is that it? You know what I want to do? Let's just skip this for a second, right? Because... That fuck that. Uh, since this guy... This guy is such a... Uh, nah, I hate Rat. Like, didn't get me wrong. Rat was an unsavory character in the last game. 
But here, he's just an arsehole. How the hell did this guy become, like, top of the Berserkers? I hate reporting this guy. There's no way I'm joining the Berserkers with this prick here. Right, I want to protect Barret. Bang, fuck you. Find I'm not sure I trust you. She barely even looked at me. I suppose that was inevitable. I feel you've let me down. Oh, well, boo fucking No who. results mean no payment. Right. I found it. What did you do to him? Nah, nah. I, I killed him. I killed him. Ah, my very own executioner. Now I can finally sleep easy again. This has been a pleasure. I'll let you know if I ever need anything again. Is that it? What did you expect? I thought we understood each other. You do something for me, I pay. End of story. Does he have another you quest? You said if I got results, there'd be more money. Really? That doesn't sound like me. <sighs> Why the hell not? That's it? 50 shards. I've given you money already. The seed money, remember? We had a deal. You should be delighted with how it all turned out. You make a good team, you and me. You that was fucking remarkable. waste of space. Fuck this guy, lads. I've got something else up my sleeve which I've just remembered. Remember, I've got a steal for this girl. The claws, don't I? Now we can. We've got level 3 of everything. I'm going down in the basement. This guy, nah. This guy, this guy's pissed me off one too many... You have no business here. Okay, well I didn't, I didn't know that. Right, get upstairs. Well, we have to sneak into this basement. Rat chased me down there. Who the fuck do you think you are? What are you doing sneaking around here? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Falk, Falk, Falk. You fuck my shit up. Falk is 100% fucking my shit up. Watch out, bro, man. We need to be quiet. For rat made a... I managed. Do that how the again. fuck, lads? I managed to get. I've been down there without being caught before. What? What's changed? Oh, she said come back at night, didn't she? Right. Okay. Tell you what, we'll, why am I here? Notice board. We'll do the notice board. We'll rest. We'll make it night time. Then we'll go back and do that. Because she said the gods disappear for a for a smoke break at night. Here we go. Everyone should be able to get a good look at it here. Yeah. We're going to make everybody defect the the clerics here. Well, that's all settled. Boom shakalaka. Stop right there. What's the issue? I know you. You're that guy who pours liquor for the kids. What? What? You handing out some kind of pamphlets here? Have you even got a permit for this? Go we'll bother somebody else. Go bother someone else. Oh, I bet you'd like that. Now let's add that up, huh? See what it comes to. No permit, 100 shards. Lack of <laughs> cooperation, up. 50. Guy. Distribution of critical writings, 25 shards. All that, plus a flat fee of... Are we almost done? Do you what's funny? Plus, a fee for complaining. Just tell me what this is going to cost. There you go, tough guy. Not so bad. Let's say... 200 shards payable right now okay no the chance permit for your notice is included in the total i'll turn a blind eye to the content we don't want to complicate things unnecessarily no chance listen right tell you this right the berserkers aren't even berserkers anymore lads the berserkers are just the outlaws it, it, it's the most pathetic faction i've ever seen in my life like i i, I thought they were okay in number one they had massive issues that's why i didn't join them in number two, I thought I was I was thinking this, I was like, ah, the faction's actually alright at the start. But then we met Rat, it's a joke. This guy's a joke. The whole faction's a joke. You won't see a crumb from me. You won't see a crumb from me. There's a solution for that too. This slip of paper goes in the trash. So what'll it be? I'll cut your fucking hands off. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to pay this prick. There's no option to punch him in the mouth. Here, just to shut you up. Very reasonable. In that case, it's settled. I have to get back to work now. You stay out of trouble. Even the trouble you cause. 
water. This guy. They, they, I, I hate this place. Too many ears listening. Right, there's no bed in there. Oh, we can do the other lad. I've just remembered all the different things we can steal. We can do another quest. We might as well oh, get this tied up now. Angry. Oh, I meant to sleep until night. Right. Now watch this. We should be able to get in here undetected now. Shit. Look, everybody's Actually, kinda gone. These stories about the hybrids. I can't get them out of my head. How could Dawkins mind become a slave to this machine? Dawkins has shown the full strength of his willpower time and again. But whatever. We'll finally see whether he's right or not. It can't be that easy all the way. Sneaking around here. That didn't work. Right, I think it's going to be bang, 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 possibly, that didn't no, work. fuck, one, two, douche, one more, should I go one more, should I go one more again, oh, I broke it. All the way to the second one from the end. All the way. Hmm. Lads, we've got it here. Douche, douche, douche. Second from the end. All the way back one. All the way to the end. And then all the way back. Done. Huh? Not done. There we go. Too easy. Practitioner. I don't know what that is. Blood packed. That that's the item we need for the quest. Now, question. See, look, we could be sore there. I don't know who's actually looking at me. Oh, rats looking square at us. Okay, so he, hold on. He wasn't bothered about me. He wasn't bothered about me picking the chest. You have some nerve. Oh shit, how the fuck am I gonna do this? Wait, hold on. That was fast, I did it. I did it. Now. We're in there. We're in, baby. Master Thief. I'm pretty sure it was over here, wasn't it? Yeah, it is, baby. Right. So, something is greater than something. Which is greater than something, so... Smaller. Four is, small, four is smaller than five, smaller than six. Greater than three. Four is correct, okay. Four is smaller than two. Oh, what? Oh no, sorry, I'm going the wrong way. Four is smaller than seven, which is smaller than eight, which is greater than two. <sighs> greater than one. That is in, baby. In. See? Done. Well, the, mo the money rat didn't pay me. I've just recuperated it. Fuck them. Let's go. Right, we've got these for the, the, the claws, so we'll turn this quest in. But before we do, there's another quest we need to steal outside of here. And it's a, I'm pretty sure it's a safe for the, the trader guy. Is 
Who saw me? Oh shit! The gods are there. Anything stupid here? Shh. The gods asleep, and I'm about to hack the save. Not now. It's not possible yet. Not now. What? What? A thief of Halvor. Yeah, I've stole everything. Why am I not allowed to hack that? That must be part of a quest, like a different quest. You out the way, Falk? Empty, 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 empty. What the fuck? No skulking around. Oh, unless it's upstairs. Lads, I didn't even realise this building had an upstairs. It's got an upstairs. Okay. So the safe must be for something completely different. Who's he? Fuck. Easy chest. Formula's in. Oh, that was the hardest chest I'd ever have to do. Pouch of valuables, got it. Right, okay, so it's them three. Bang, bang, bang. Bang. Hmm. Okay. Bang, bang, bang. 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 Done. Light it up. Ooh. Dexterity and pickpocket. Ah, we can get pickpocket now. Interesting. Pickpocket for free. I like that. We could try it on these guards, actually. Damaged sword. Take it. Exactly the same as the last lock. Look, it was the same pattern. That ought to do it. Got it. That's everything. It wasn't that one? It wasn't even locked. Right, come on. So we've done. We've done both these quests. Let's turn them in. Ooh, call me the thief, baby. I am actually a thief. Property leaf. Right, this guy. So, about the thefts in the upper district. Here's the loot you wanted. Oh, you are talented, aren't you? I'm glad you're one of the good guys. It won't be long now till the guards want more security themselves. As soon as they make a stink with Rat, I'll visit him about the whole security business. Then, <laughs> I'll get my way. <laughs> But I still owe you something. Here's your collateral. And I'll take these items out of the inventory for you. Thanks. Is that it? For not betraying me. Is that it? Ah, I think we should rob this guy because uh, that was a bit of a one. What are you doing sneaking around here? 
Get out of here! <laughs> Get out of here! Get over here! Right, that's fine. That's fine. Right, what are we doing? We need to go to the claws hideout, which I marked here. We'll turn this in. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yes, we do. Normally, we'd have to drop them off in a, in a drop box. But... Oh, 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 oh. That was uh, unfortunate. Normally, we have to drop them off. But she wants us to take them to her directly. A trace of Hank. Since they're Maybe one of the stuff. healers knows something. Hank. No trace of Hank. What? Well, I don't know what. We're there. Okay, right. We're there. We're gonna have to do this because I don't know who the who the hell is Hank. One of the healers will know something. This is obviously for a quest we've got, but I don't know which one. Yeah, so we could have completed this quest. Sorry, the quest for the, the other guy that we've just done ages ago. But I didn't realise there was an upstairs that we had a thief. I thought it was that, that locked safe in the back that I couldn't do. Right, this is it. Let's turn it in. Wait a sec. Is that what I think it is? Well, looks like it. Holy shit, you really are amazing. I I can't believe it. Rats a cocksucker. I need to sit down for this. Needs to go down to Chinatown. You really are that good. I know. <laughs> I know. You've earned that ego. I hope this is enough to pay you for your help. I have to look all this over now. I think, yeah, that's everything we needed from you. You've done everything we told you to do. Excellent. You've expanded our network, given us some leverage, and put money in the coffers. You even helped stymie the Berserker's expansion plans. If we ever need anything else, I'll find you. Otherwise, thanks for everything. Well, that's it. 4,000 experience. That was well worth doing. Thanks again for everything. You're a true... Okay, so that's it. Any rewards in here? Nope, she didn't put any new rewards. That, that's fine. It's fine. I'm happy with the 4,000 experience. Okay, now. That's that done. But... What was the... Who... Hank? Oh, I know who Hank is. Hank's the guy that robbed us, isn't it? I've just, I've just clicked who Hank was. Hank's the guy that we gave the the iron ore to and he gave us that fake gold bar and we now found out it's fake and he's not here. See if these guys know where he is. Marwan? Alchemy is its own art form. Oh, Mar Mar okay, he's a... Uh, he's a bit fucking strange. This guy's asleep. Yeah, yeah, um... You know where Hank is? Your pet? It had better not be anywhere around here. <laughs> if that beast contaminates any of my vials or tinctures, you'll be responsible. The beast? I mean, Hank the traitor. Hank the traitor? I'm certain I have no idea what you're talking about. You have to know him. Laddie, if I told you I found the Philosopher's Stone and now had the ability to create gold, would you believe me? If such a fellow exists, then he's nowhere around here. Anyway, someone like that, you're more likely to find him with Baxter's people than with us. The outlaws make sense because he's in fact an outlaw. Right, let's save it here. And I want to look at my... Oh my god, lads. Lads, watch this. You can put the torch on by pressing up. I thought it was an automatic thing. But it doesn't matter because watch this, watch this, watch this. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, I tried. I tried to steal his bed. Didn't work. I want to sleep till morning anyway. Yeah, we only had to have it night time so we'd steal them chests. Because rats, gods, change place. Unbelievable. Right, I want to look at the weapons. I want. I need. I want to do more damage. So what have we got? Inventory. I'll tell you what. We're, we're probably not going to be putting points into constitution. I don't think. So that's out of the question. And I like swords. 71 strength. I don't, I don't, I'm not going to be 
able to put that much. I've got 75 points. That's not very good. Simple blade, that's what I'm using. I'm doing 40 damage at the minute. 61 strength. Damage sword. Okay. If I get 41, I can do an extra 10 damage. 41 strength, 31 dex. Or we could go to... Okay. If we go to 48 strength... Now another question. Remember 48 strength? Okay, if I, if I do this... If I get 48 strength, that means I can equip a new sword, which is going to give me, I think, an extra 20 damage. And I'll also be able to get another 10 damage from this. If I spend a point in that, I think that's going to be worthwhile. That's the damage broadsword, 48, 34. 57, yeah, that's too high. I won't be able to put enough points in to get that. Because, remember, points are costing us two per level up. I think we'll do this. Wait, I want to... 48, 34. See, look. Everything is costing us two, but... 48. Oh, nice. 48, 34. Boom. Done. Now, we can equip this. Damage broadsword. Bang. How much extra damage did we get? We got an additional 22 damage. Now we can get another 10 damage if we go and find a... Fighter. I know where the fighter is. He's, he's the doorman there. Right, let's do that. Random iron ore. Think so? I think you're full of shit. Teach me how to fight. What do you want to know? This. We're going to get this. Shit, that cost me two grand. It's okay, we've got plenty of money. And it, it, it's, it's nice. So that's an extra 10 points of damage. So let me just check my... Look, 74 damage we're doing. We went from doing 40 damage to 74. We've nearly doubled our damage output, which is which is really fucking helpful. Now, ranged combat options. What's the lower levels? Okay, I could use that, which is a massive damage increase. Is it? See, that does 32... Di oh, no, this is... Ah, oh, that's weird. Oh, it, this, for some reason, it compares my damage with the melee damage because that's what I'm currently using it just it, it just classes the primary weapon it doesn't count what range weapon you've got equipped so I'm only doing 32 damage with the fang if I get 48 dexterity I can use the seeker bow yeah these are things I don't really want to spend points in I mean, I like range. We will eventually be able to equip range as we level up because we, we have to level up intelligence. Sorry, I mean dexterity for, for the for these things. So once we do get to a high enough dexterity, we'll, we'll be able to passively use a, a range weapon. But I, I'm not too bothered about that for now. Now we got this. Where was the one we picked up? Or was it a specialization? Dexterity and pickpocket, which is cool. So if we want to pickpocket someone, if we need to for a quest, we can. We'll just equip this, but I don't really need to use that. And I still like using... What am I using at the minute? Lockpicking and bookworm. That's good. Strength and maximum stamina. That's a top tier power modifier. I like that. Okay, lads. What we'll do is... We'll call an episode here. Next episode, we're going to... I was going to say Tavar there. That's because that's where it was in the last game. The, the out, Outlaws. We're going to Caracas. Is that what it's called? No. 
sorry, the the creator. That's where we're headed. So, words of faith. That's where we're headed. Boom, I'll put everything on the map. We'll go here. Old ironworks. Let's test out this weapon. I want to see how much damage this does. Oh. Oh, the creatures are getting harder. Because I've reached a certain level. Oh, shit. I didn't realise that was going to happen. Oh, fuck. Wait there. Before we end the episode. Before we end the episode. Can we fast travel to... Fuck's sake, man. Sake, man. I, don't, I, I just I, I want to go and upgrade my backpack, my jetpack. Sorry. There we go. Three out of five combat inventory. I've got that. This is where we need to be. Let me save it there. Now, we need to go quickly. I want to get this done this episode before we start next episode. I want to go back to the back. Pack bench in Bastion. Backpack bench is inside of here, I think. I'm calling it the backpack bench, it's the jetpack bench. Boom. Can we do any more of these? We can do two more. Nice. Right, now a question I've got. This here. No, no, not that there. Floating. Let's you float on the spot and use your weapon at the same time. Because I can't use my weapon in the air. I think I need to. Let's test it out. If it's shit, we'll just we'll not use it. Sorry about that, I've got my time out. It's actually coming at a good time because it's we're about to end the episode, but oh. now we've got aerial combat. So that's how you had to okay, so you actually had to unlock that. Oh, it's good because we haven't had to fight many flying things, but it looks like now we do. Okay, right, we're gonna I wanna make a hard save here. We'll keep that. Lads, we're we're we'll leveling up our character massively here. More damage, aerial combat phenomenal okay next episode i'm pretty confident we're going to the crater and that's going to be where the outlaws are and we'll see what's a crack like with them i don't i don't like them because of what i know of them but it might actually change because a lot of the factions have changed in this so it's going to be interesting to see what they're like i still pretty much think they're going to be living in a shithole but hey ho see you there lads right then lads we are headed to the crater but first off there's a couple of things i want i want to get i want to get done right because i've just I've, I've been meaning to do this for ages but i keep forgetting about them I've got a companion quest here for for Falk. We need to share these rations with some of the members of the Sixth Power. So Balder and Rolf is there. Since we're near here, we might as well do this. And then we can get this quest complete. And I also want to see if we can do Kaya's quest. Simply because I would like to try out a new follower. You know what I mean? Like we've had Falk for a long time. The infection. Here's Rolf. Hey. Hello. What the hell do you want? You're a hunter, correct? That's none of your business. That is quite true. However, I have. Let me stop you right there. I got shit to do, and I can't get on with it if you keep pestering me. So beat it. Stop scaring away all the game, okay? I apologize. I had no intention of disturbing you. I merely wanted to... But you are disturbing me, so get lost. Oh, fuck this guy then. Yes, of course. I merely... Fuck off. As you wish. I shall, to use the <laughs> vernacular, fuck off. 
Okay. That was so that guy was a yeah, he's a cop. Struggling to describe my feelings. Some people I can't be helped. Could happen to a cyborg. As you would say, the less said, the better. Let us move on. We must find a better candidate. Yeah, what about this guy? Hello? Oh, hello. You are a hunter, is that right? And you, you're a cleric? Correct. I have a piece of meat for you. Yeah, he does. Raw meat, huh? Bring it on. How much you got? Enough. And what do you want for it? It is a gift. I only want to help you. All right, hand it over then. I can take care of it later. But, uh, wait a minute. You're not gonna show up later wanting some sort of payment, are you? Last thing I need is to be owing favors to higher-ups. Uh, no. No, I, uh... Okay, then. Thanks. Of course. Uh, happy to help. Noted. I'd like to do another right away, if you don't mind. Please try to ensure it's a suitable candidate. All right, if it's what you mm. need. Okay, so we can't actually finish this quest. It looks like this quest is tied to the the, the main base, and we we have we have not really been doing these quests to be fair. Okay, right. So since well, we've done one part of that, let's try this. This is Kaya's quest, and it's just here. Let's do it. Want to be some combat here, which I'm happy about. Here we go. Now I don't know if we, we'll be able to talk to these since we, we we haven't joined the Morcons but we've done quite a few quests for them. Only after these guys... Oh no but wait there, we even spoke to the Morcons about these guys and the Morcons said these guys are useless, they're not real Morcons. They're just a bunch of fucking idiots. That's close enough, shithead. What do you want? A Morcon patrol? And it looks like you made a good score. That's our fucking business. Hey! Those berserkers from the world heart in the west didn't send you, did they? Because if so, you better understand that those assholes attacked first. We was just defending ourselves. In the name of Ravak. Yeah. I don't believe you. So they lost some people. What can I say? They shouldn't have fucked with us. Well, shit happens, right? You're a disgrace to the Morcons. You should all be sent to the Blood Cistern. Yeah. How about you climb down out of my ass and stop lecturing me, scumbag? What do you know about us Morcons, you fucking clown? I've executed your you leader. Turn around and get the fuck out of here right now. Otherwise, we're going to teach you about pain. A long, hard lesson. That was impressive. That was impressive. Watch this. Right, how are we going to kill these guys? Oh my god, lads. There's so many explosives sitting around. This is hilarious. You really talking to me like that? Who the fuck do you think you are? Give me whatever you've looted from the berserkers, and I'll let you go. <laughs> nice joke. Hear me laughing? <laughs> well then, I'll give you what you want. Good. Excellent. I'll get you. Oh, they're fighting us. Right, wait there, wait there. Stop, stop, stop. Watch this. Watch, go on, go on, light it up. Boom! This is so good. There's more, there's more. This is the bet here, lads. Explosive barrels are the this absolute best. This place is unsettling. Is that the quest done? I think we did it. We did it. <laughs> yeah, this is it, it's pretty funny. You don't ranged combat with these 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 things on oh, I've done that thing again. Isn't that good? But the fact that you can blow up things is incredible. That was top tier. Damaged shotgun.
Nobody else dropped any weapons. That's a bit strange. Those guys got lit up like a Christmas tree. It's exactly what they get. The Morgans didn't like them. Neither did anybody else. Their only place is death. Oh, a chest. It seems the easy chest has only two combinations, either the first three or the last three. War crossbow, vigor. Ah, that's not very good. Take it though. Right, come on then, we'll go back and see Kaya. Now, where was she? Yeah. Probably six and two threes just to go this way. Oh, there's a dead guy over here. Blood axe. Because I would like to get her to follow me. Considering she's uh, my ex-wife, current wife. I don't know how that works. Oi! Oh yes, we're doing massive damage now. We can one-shot these guys. It's definitely worth that we... Well, we upgraded our weapon and our damage at the end of last episode. I pretty much like went from 40 damage to nearly 80. Yep, we can actually we can actually kill things now. Do you know what it is? I'm thinking we might not even get the outlaw base at the minute. Because I might try and take on that ogre. Now that our combo proficiency is increased, we can get a few quests. Tied up, I think. This will have consequences. I think I'm doing more damage than him. Whether it's a shotgun or a laser weapon, anything is better than the See all the way up the top. Yeah, she is. You don't have to worry about that Morcon patrol reaching the grotto. You're sure they're all dead? Yes, I am. Good. I have no idea what the Morcons are planning. But if they're so desperate for money, murdering anyone they can find... That sounds more like outlaw behavior. Morcons don't really care about money. True. Their faith is based on pure destruction. Those particular Morcons must have been working on their own. In any case... Thank you for your help. Will you help me now? I don't know. What did you have in mind exactly? Well, I think the old man was right. I've been infected with something alien. But what matters right now is how we're going to deal with the invaders. And I've seen you in action. I know what you can do. Yeah, because she is such a powerful mage. That was her whole thing in the first game. They actually needed her to do this ritual. That was a different time. And a different place. If your disease did come from the invaders, it's unlikely I'll be able to cure you. I'm not a scientist. I deal with magic. This is something you'll have to deal with yourself, I'm afraid. What? Yes, maybe things are already bad between us. I'll just say I understand. Hmm. I understand. Ah, oh, come on. Don't look at me like that. All I'm saying is, maybe you're better off asking Dawkins. If anyone knows about this kind of stuff, it would be him. Besides, the people of Tavar are counting on me. I can't abandon them now. What do you know about these invaders? I saw their flying fortresses arrive. And those disgusting creatures. Those fortresses have already started transforming the planet's plants and animals. That's why the old man calls them formers. Do you know how many of them there are? It's hard to say. 
I know of at least three. Two in Caracas and one in the far west of Tavar. There's probably more in the north. Yeah, I think we've seen one of them it's before. Clear we need more information. Transformers. I would like you by my side. I'd like you by my side. I was worried you'd say that. So, how exactly is this going to work? You know the kind of threat Magalon is facing. And we were always a good team. The best team. Just like it was. I see. You have it all figured out. We'll need somewhere we can meet up if we ever get separated. And I can't think of a better place than the Bastion. All right. With the invaders gathering strength, I suppose I have no choice. And we should look into the Bastion. Noted. But like I told you, <laughs> I have a lot to do, and I may need to deal with matters in Tavar from time to time. We'll work something out. Thanks. Just don't make me regret this. You won't. Hello, Falk. Good day, Kaya. <laughs> hmm. We have known each other for many years. These, these two are the best companions. Oh, here it comes. Yet I have never thanked you for your help and dedication. Sorry, what? And so I would like to express my gratitude for our partnership with this piece of meat. Oh, he's given meat to oh, her. Uh, okay, <laughs> I, I was merely. You I can't was just, just be going giving women your meat. Uh, I appreciate it. My pleasure, and I hope you have a wonderful. Day. That is hilarious. Yes, uh, and the same to you. Have you heard okay. anything about your father? Wardek? That traitor? Nothing since the war with the Alps. Why do you ask? The rumor is that he's dead. An experienced Alp commander like him? I don't know. Someone that poisonous is hard to kill. Hmm. That was a less than perfect interaction. I believe that it could have It was a good it was good mate if, if you offer your meat to all really women it always works out right now I'll, I'll speak to her and then I want to get her to follow me So just what is it you do in Tavar I'm a berserker warlord now and something of an oracle and leader to the people there My word carries great weight with the other warlords and they've entrusted me with the safety of Tavar So if it comes under any threat I'll have to take action. In that case, these alien invaders should be right at the top of your list. Yes, but they're not the only problem, unfortunately. The other factions are trying to take over our land, and it's up to me to stop them. Securing the land. You need any help with your affairs in Tavar? You offering to help me? I can it's help been a you. Long time Come on. Since you did that. It's me. It's There's me, I'm no a legend. pressing matters in Tavar for the moment. Right now, the threat posed by these alien invaders is my main priority. But that can always change. Don't worry. I'll let you know if I ever have to return there. Okay, the thing is though, right? Like, you do realize that the Berserkers are a bunch of fucking idiots, so... Like, you'd be much better served, like, joining whoever I join. Are you okay? I'm alright. She accepts me. All the hopes me. of humanity rest in your hands. Fortunately, I believe they're safe hands. Good. You're a good person, Jax, and you're on the right path. Follow me. Come with me. There's enough of you already. Oh, okay. Where was I? Falk, bro, I I'm gonna... You won't take some rest. Oh, wait, they'll ask him this. Have you finished your experiment? Are you feeling more human yet? I believe nice. I have gathered enough data for the time being. I am grateful for your assistance. Thank you. Well, was it a good learning experience for you? There were positives and there were <laughs> negatives. I was unable to observe any pattern that could be used to predict the candidate's reaction to my act of charity. When it comes to understanding human behavior, I still have a great deal to learn and many obstacles to overcome. In that case, I look forward to your next obstacle. Thank you. Until that time, I will continue analyzing the data I have collected so far. Good stuff. I'll tell you what, you can do that at Bastion. We're done for now. Stand by at the Bastion. Sure thing. Right, where's she gone? Fuck. 
Oh, she's, she's miles away. Just fast. Oh, yeah. Oh, hello. Found some loot. Bumper. Aya, Aya, Aya. Join me on my quest. Follow me. All right. Okay, this is cool. Now we'll get to get some quests off her. Nice. Lads, we're going to... We're going to go to the, the, the creator. And we've got some quests here. So... Securing the land with it. Kaya wants to make sure the northwest of the borders of Tavar. Oh, okay. So this is going to be like her quest, and she's going to give me that when she's with us, just like Falk did. Yeah, we still got Nasty's quest to do, but sheesh. Where did she go? Maybe she went to... Did, she, did Nasty go to Bastion? Look, Falk's walking past me. I don't know where Nasty is. That's a bit weird, out of curiosity. Oh, she's there. It was she, for some reason she wasn't on the map. That's okay, it doesn't matter. Right. We're going to go to... Oh, eliminate the troll. Let's do that now, because I think I can do it. I'm strong enough. This is something the project needs. Oh, I might do it. Tell you what, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna do these. I'm gonna get these these tidied up because we're in Tavar, right? We'll eliminate the troll, which is just there. Yeah, we'll get this done. I should be able to beat this now. Oh, she's given the speech. Recently. Try never. <clears throat> well, I'm going to try to do things differently from now on. I'll support you to the best of my abilities. Excellent. And if you have any questions, just ask. Does that mean we don't have to work nights anymore? No. Yes. Get some rest. Oh, shit. Okay. You'll need it. Together? We're going to raise these seedlings to true greatness. World hearts to bring real change to this world. Yes, ma'am. Never forget how important what we're doing is. To a successful harvest. Hoorah! I'm still not sure we shouldn't have just taken the outlaws out of here. Why's that? That's fucking teamwork. Them armor, dress them like berserkers and let them take care of our world heart seedlings. But that doesn't make them real berserkers. I agree 100%. I just don't know if we should let those fools near our most sacred plants. That's Yeah, all. I wouldn't. I agree. That's exactly what I've said that with the problem with the berserkers. Oh, the berserkers aren't even berserkers anymore. They're just outlaws. And it, it's pathetic. That's why the faction's weak. Right, the, the thing's down here. It's going to get destroyed. Maybe not. Oh, she's using that fire magic. Oh my god, she's amazing! Oh, it can, it can still one-shot me. Wow! We need to lure this thing out. Because you can't run in the water. Yeah, you can't run in the water, so... She's doing quite a bit of damage.
Come here. He's going down like. Oh my god, she's being what man. She's back in action. It's definitely going down. Or anymore, which is weird. Come on, Kaya, I need your help. Ah, yeah. I need your help, girlfriend. Come on, we've got it to half health. Fucking bitch just in the back of the head. Here we go. Light him up. He's going down to Chinatown. That near he nearly ended my life there. One, one more hit, one more hit. Got him. Awesome. Awesome. Right, so that's that quest done. We'll go and tell him. Um, is it Godar? It definitely is Godar, I think. Is it? It is. Good. I'm, I'm happy we're getting these quests tidied up. Troll's dead, bruh. About that troll. Any news? What's up? You can rest easy again. The beast is dead. Let me take a look at you. Whoa! Your arms and legs are still attached. Unbelievable. As unbelievable as the amount of money you promised me. You get straight to the point. Good man. I never thought I'd see the day when someone would earn these shards. Thanks. And if there's anything else you need me to take care of, let me know. Nothing springs to mind at the moment, but I've got a tip for you. Make sure you only use your blade in the service of just causes. Guys like you would do better to stay on the straight and narrow, if you catch my meaning. Gotcha. Good. See you around. I walk every path. That was, lads, 2,500 for that quest. Insane. A silent hermit. I found it. Yeah, we found it. What's that got to do with anything? Oh, we must find her name there. 
Um, I'll do that later. Bartram with Hank. That's also in... Oh, that's see. The weapon of an artist. Oh, this is for the blacksmith. He's going to craft us something awesome. Old wet lurker. I'm interested to do this, actually. Where am I? Where am, where, where am I stood? I'm right here. We'll do this. We'll see if we can get these crafting materials and we might get a new weapon. Could you ever imagine that this former bumblefuck outlaw desert town would look like this one day? The outlaws should thank us for what we did to their wasteland. I don't know. I mean, it is nice and green. And I do quite like what the, the berserkers have done. But at the same time, I really like this when it was a desert. I, th I thought it looked awesome as a desert. Oh shit. Got my motherfucking legs, boy. Now, how hard are these creatures really going to be? Oh, it's a wet lurker. This thing is insanely hard. What the fuck is it doing? Kaya? Oh my god, there's two. Are we doing enough damage? There's, there's so many of them. It's gonna get us, it's gonna get us, it's gonna get us, it's gonna get us. These are the most junk ass creatures. Have you ever seen anything as bad as any life? It's so fucking. Yeah, we can't do this quest. Yeah lads, we're not strong enough for this quest, we're going to have to leave this quest till later. Which is fine. Okay. Fuck it then. Yeah, flyers. Recruits for Henrik. Attila's tests. Do with Attila again. Right. We are headed to the crater. Let's go, baby. Yeah, we're still not strong enough to do them first. Now, let's try this aerial combat out. Uh, wow, it, uh, that went fucking well. Come here. Oh my god, you automatically... I'm gonna die, like. Okay, the, 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 it's pretty cool. It's 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 extremely junk. It's the most junk thing I've ever seen, but it, it worked. Oh, there's another wet lurker. What's even happening, lad? What's even happening? No, wait. Oh, I jumped no, something. Go on, kill it! Jeez! Wet lurkers are 250 experience, no wonder they're hard. Watch out! It's nice how you just like automatically target them. Yeah. 
aerial combat, lads. <laughs> it's it, it's different. <laughs> it, it's different. That's, what, that's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to say. It's, it's, it's very different. Are these things infinitely respawning? Reporters, maybe? Or aircraft? What do you think? Probably underwear. Underwear. You always have to bring the conversation down. Yeah, we do. I'm looking for a bed. I don't know if there's going to be one in here. I think we should be alright. There's all sorts of shit around here. Why are these things dead? There it is. Look at that. The crater, apparently. The crater is pretty impressive. Hard to believe all this was open country before the comet hit. With everything that's been happening, it's easy to forget how beautiful it is here. Is it? Looks like it's a smog infested shithole, but I mean, maybe that's just me. Get outlaws. Okay. Do we just put the dead on the outskirts of town these days? Maybe the, maybe the outlaws do. Help! Someone help me cast off these demons. I can't escape from hell. I'm imprisoned. I can't control myself. All those noises in my head, it has to stop. My thoughts are dissolving. My body, body ceases to exist. There's nothing but darkness wherever I look. The chems are supposed to help me calm down, but they did the opposite. Help me. Help me. Perfect. Just what we needed. Damn it. I need to hurry. All good, bruh. Well, how do we get into the town? Oh, well, the quest is there. Thing is, are we allowed in here? Or are we going to get kicked out? I have no idea why anyone would want to live in this dump. Just look at this place. Nothing but thieves, murderers, and cutthroats. You turn down the wrong alley and you're dead. And mothers try to raise children here? Unbelievable. It is a shithole. I assume you know why you're here. Hero, give me a chance to explain. You let yourself be caught. I just wanted to help Yasma, the Berserkers. You should know that the Berserkers are none of your concern. I was just trying to get info about the fort. About Rat. And you had no orders from Baxter to do so. Huh. Well, that was very considerate of you. Go home. Get a good night's sleep. Wait, uh, I'm free to go? Of course you are. My friend here will escort you. We wouldn't want anything bad to happen to you on the way there, would we? <laughs> There's no need for that. I, I I can manage on my own. All right, then off you go. This guy's going to kill him, isn't he? Thank you. Oh, oh, thank you. Interesting. Come here, bro, 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 bro. Speak to me. This guy's so fast. You really have to scare me like that. What do you want from me? I've got nothing. Why so nervous? N nervous? No, it, it's just that I've misplaced something. That's all. What are you looking for? Look, not now, okay? Come back tomorrow, yeah? Just tell me what's going on. Hey, you're a smart guy, yeah? You want to make some shards, right? Right. 
I didn't ask for work. I asked you what's going on. You haven't even heard my offer. I'll pay you a hundred shards if you run a few errands for me. Okay then. And believe me, you'll have them done in no time. There's really no faster way to earn shards. Hmm. That's very generous of you. But couldn't you just do it yourself? Uh, look, I'm buying myself some time. That explanation will have to do. But I'm raising my offer to 200 shards. Come on. It's a deal of a lifetime. A fistful of purchases and you'll be swimming in Alexit. This guy a no dealer. Way. 500 if we had 140, which we don't. Okay. Under the circumstances, I agree. Oh, I knew you were a guy I could do business with. I need this stuff fast. Have you got any time right now? Yeah, what do you want? What do you want me to get for you? Vitamins, stims, proteins. Do you want me to bring you a bit of everything, or do you want something in particular? Actually, I've got knots in my stomach, so I'd rather have something gentle on the guts. Here's my shopping list. It's got what I need on it. Hopefully I've already got Emergence it. Here should be able to help. If not, you'll have to improvise. Use your imagination. Aren't you forgetting something? The shards? Hey, look. You'll get your reward when... I don't mean my fee. I mean money for the merchants. They won't give me something for nothing. Uh, of course. <laughs> what was I thinking? Exactly, there, you fool. That should do it. Hurry up now. And try not to get distracted. Wait, wait there. Hopefully I've already got this stuff. You never know. This guy's so fast. About the supplies. Did you get everything? Not yet. No, oh, I haven't got it. Okay. Well, please hurry. So he lives there. Good stuff. Right, so the supplies. What do we actually need for this? A tiris. That was, must be this region. Food for Korean, right. I need 50 coffee beans. 50 coffee beans. Okay, right, well, we'll... Look who it fucking is! Big dick here. Hey, there you are. I've been looking for you. Do I know you? Bruh. Don't act dumb. Oh, uh, yeah. You're the sucker from the fort. Not so friendly now, huh? Oh, fuck you. I don't owe you anything. Give us the shards now. Give me my shards back now. Here, take this and go cry about it to a hooker. We're done. One shard. If I see you back here, I'll rip off your arms and face and enjoy it. Oh, we're gonna fucking see about that. <sighs> Fuck you. I'm going to make it the last scam you pull. <laughs> How are you gonna do that? Watch. Yo, you think scamming is the worst I can do to someone like you? Well, you fucked up there. Come here. Go on, hit him. Hit him in the Come on, face. baby. Hit him in the dick. Get wrecked. Come on, baby. Want some of this, dickhead? I'm not sure how to feel about this. Get wrecked. Damaged legged sword. He had a cleric sword on him. 81 Alexis. Gold ore. That's good shit. Exactly what he gets. He shouldn't be a punk bitch. Trying to scam my motherfucking ass. Was that sword any good? It is good, but it requires quite high stats. Okay. 
Right. So let's go back to this guy that was chasing that other guy. Hold on, lads. I'm going to have to just pause it here. I'll be back in a second. Just, um... I might have to let the dog out. Two seconds. Right, we're back. So, so just to let you know, the dog doesn't want to be out. It's, uh, I've, al it's I've already taken Lily on a, on a massive walk today. She's had a, such a good time. And um, she's she's been out for the toilet and everything. She's no bother, right? So I just just at the end there, I heard her like whimpering. Like, not whimpering, but you know when dogs like, <coughs> makes a noise. Um, it's because we're, we're, we've got a little place around the house where she can like sit up high and like look out the window. And she's seen... She's seen what she thought was her her my lass her mom and she, she, she i'm like there's nobody there man but you can't tell the dog that there's nobody there like she's like she, she like, thinks her mom is coming home she's not and it's it, it's just not even time for your mom to be in yet man what are you talking about right so come on we'll uh, we'll go back to where we were it was here wasn't it we'll speak to this guy ah another volunteer You'll get the same speech as everyone else. Go to the board over there. That's where you'll find my assignments. Okay. If anything's not clear, just ask. Equipment and weaponry are not provided. But by looking at you, I can see you came prepared. When the job is done, you come to me to collect the bounty. Bounty hunter. About the bounties. Can you explain why you do this work? With pleasure, but you have to forgive a little verbosity. It's the only way to truly do it justice. Imagine you were painting a picture. A picture of, uh, let's say, a rainbow. You'll need paint, of course. All different colors. Red, yellow, green, blue. You need all those just to make your little masterpiece look as it's supposed to. While you're setting up your tools, someone comes along and steals your red paint. And you have no way of getting more. What the hell is this fucking thing? So you give up on using red and go on painting with the other colors. And when you finish, you realize your rainbow isn't a rainbow. <laughs> it's a big, steaming pile of shit. So instead of a bright, sunny world, yours is dark and gloomy. So you come to me and tell me what happened. All the while, the thief is sound asleep in his bed, thinking it's safe. He doesn't know or care that his hands are dirty. He goes on with life, leaving smudges of red paint on everything he touches. His beer, his friends, even his wife. He leaves a trail of red paint wherever he goes. Everyone sees it. Everyone sees red. Everyone but me. I see the rainbow in all its glory. That's because once our friend, the thief, is out of the picture, he can't sully anything else with his dirty, stained hands. Then everything is clean and perfect, as it should be. Understand? Well, that was a fucking phenomenal story. What a lot of shit you just spoke. Just saying I hate criminals would have been easier. It's not at all that simple. It's not about killing criminals for me. That's far too banal. I see what I do as a profession, as an art. And the picture I work from is clear and has Hello. structure. Not there. The clearer the lines, the more people stay within them. Understand? Slowly but surely, chaos becomes order. Even here in the crater. Okay, so this guy, so if this guy is such a freaking professional at his job, I don't think he can do them. Right, so check the board. Hey you, got a light? I'm trying to light up, but my matches have gone AWOL. Nah, can't help you. Smoking's bad for your health. Can't help you, I'm afraid. It's probably for the best. Just gives me a scratchy throat. So, did you want to get a mission from the board? Well, I was trying to. <laughs> yeah, so move over. What this this girl? She she she's the hooker, isn't she? Yeah, 
so move over. Really? You're braver than most people around here. I respect that. How about something different? You haven't heard anything about Baxter's cave, have you? No. What's that? Keep it down. The walls here have ears. Listen up. I didn't talk to you for no reason. I had to make sure you weren't one of the jumped up idiots who usually hang around here. So, did I pass your test? I mean, you can form a sentence and you look okay, so you're a long way ahead. So what is it exactly? It's a place behind enemy lines. I don't stand a chance on my own. But with you and a few others, we could do it. And if we do, it will make us all very rich. Yeah, really? It must be a huge amount. I can tell you don't believe me, but I guarantee that if we can pull it off, neither you nor I will have to take the fall for anyone. Yeah, what is the catch? This, this sounds like some trumped up bullshit, this. What's the catch? You're a sharp one. Nothing's that easy, right? Capable people are one thing, relying on them is another. I've got a lot to lose if I tell you what I know, so I'm going to need a little insurance before we start. With the risk I'm taking, <laughs> I think a thousand shards is reasonable. No are you chance. in or not? There are plenty of others who want in. There's not. You seem reliable. I won't force you. After all, the amount I'm asking isn't exactly peanuts. Listen, listen. If there's plenty of others that want in, why aren't they already in? And the fact that you want a thousand of me and you're saying I'm the most capable person. Nah, that, that's not stacking up, mate. It's not stacking up. If you want my skills, you fucking pay for them. Give me a grand. Fuck that. Oh no, I'll say scratching that much Alexa takes time. Scratching up that much Alexa takes time. I'm giving you 24 hours. I won't last much longer in this hellhole. Mm. I'll wait here for you. Don't let me down. Not bad. 24 hours. I wonder if she actually does give us that. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll hang up the notice. Oh wait there, what's this? Bounty assignment. Dixon. Wanted Dixon, former bounty hunter. Location Caracas. Possibly the grotto. Morcon City. Do we... We've met Dixon, haven't we? Medium priority. The target is a potential defector. Warning. Skilled with a weapon. May have backing from the Morcons. Okay. This board is a perfect place for a notice. Nice. So that's that guy's quest. Don't we play both and notices? That's that. I'm done here now. I hope all this running around was worth it. We'll see what Johannes decides to fork over as payment. Yeah, we'll see him later on. Come on then, what's this girl gonna Did do? You find the money. Yeah. Let me in on your plan. Good. We'll go over the rest in my office. Full pockets have a way of attracting vermin. And we could do without an audience. This way. This is the biggest fucking scam I've ever seen. You're not from around here, are you? That obvious? I am. This dump is the worst. Your shards are my way out. Well, we're almost there. I'll my shards are her way out. We'll see about that. I would like to find out if there's a bunker or whatever she was saying. So, here we are. Do you like it? Oh, it's beautiful, eh? You call this an office? Hmm, you don't. Well, I have even more bad news for you then. Come out, boys. He has the money on him. Fucking bitch. Oh, no shit. Being here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right, come on then, bitch. Oh. Ah. Whoa! My god, the guy one shot us. I hope all this running around was worth it. We'll see what Johannes decides to fork over his pain. Did I hope all this running around Shit. was worth it. We'll see what Johannes decides to fork over I don't even know if we can do this. Bloody hell, her bodyguards are fucking Arnold Schwarzenegger again. Around here, are you? Dolph Lundgren? That obvious? I am. This dump is the worst. 
Your shards are my way out. Well, we're almost there. I'll introduce you to the rest of the group. The rest of the group. Well, right, save it there. Come on then. We need to break them up. I need to. I need to get because one of them had a crossbow. You've got no business being here. Right. If we can. Good. Oh, he's got a. He hasn't got a crossbow. He's got a shotgun. But this guy's got a grenade. Oh, they killed themselves. Go on, light them up, light them up. Oh shit, she's come. Oh my god. They've killed Kaya. I wish they weren't so fast. Jeez. Okay. Right, I noticed that the quest thing is kill Scarlet. Let's see if we can just kill her and then other guys can stop fucking attacking us. This is so hard. You've got no business being <laughs> Fuck me. Right, I've got a better idea. You've got no business being here. Right. I can do it. Oh, look, I can do. I can do aerial attacks. Nice. Scholars defeated. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Save. Get ready for a right, Scholar's dead. Scholar's dead. Kaya did all the work there. Now we're just going to split these two punks up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Go on, get him, get him, get him, get him. Good, he's dead. I can solo the guys. No. Oh, Misty's in the fucking box. That's not fair. Come here. Oh my god. Guy, the, the combat is so junk. It's unreal. Got him. Fuck you. Damn, that was hard. Imagine if you came here, one of the first places, and how to fight them. There's something in there. I think we got some good loot out of that. We got another region sword. Whew, okay, let's have a quick look in here because I think I saw something.
Yeah. Damage Chain Sword. Yeah, this place is a shithole. It's full of just murderers and thieves. <laughs> I would I fit right at home. I actually fit right at home here. Does this place not have a bed? Smart move. It does. Oh, it's got safe. What we'll do is we'll hack this here. We'll rest so we get our health Something back, and then wrong. we'll call it an episode. Uh, no. Everything's a. Uh, I'll know okay? immediately if anything is missing here. Okay. Uh, will you? Sorry. Sorry. Something wrong with your legs? She's got like spidey sense. What on earth is she doing? Something is bigger than something. Eight is bigger than four. Four is smaller than six, which is smaller than nine. Close. Nine is greater than four, which is smaller than three, which is smaller. Huh? Four is smaller than three. You can't put three. Zero. What? Six is greater than four. Four is smaller than. Th this 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 code's fucked up. It didn't work. Nine is greater than. Six. Six is smaller than four. Pardon me? Lads, it didn't make any sense. The thing's busted. Something wrong with your legs? Lads, this this thing's busted. It doesn't work. It's actually it's actually glitched. Jax, I'll be leaving for Tavar soon, for a huh? reconnaissance mission. And since you offered to help... What are we talking about? My men and I are going to investigate the region around the fort in Tavar. There's talk of the cleric sending mechanical spies to monitor our troops' movements. If that's true, I intend to smash them to pieces and send them right back to their masters. I'll help. You don't need your bodyguards. I'll go with you. I'm sure we can manage. Fine. Tell me when you're ready and we'll leave immediately. Okay. Okay, we, well we might do that next episode. I'll save that because that's nice that she said that. Yeah, this is busted this. I don't fucking care. Nah, let's, just, let's just do this, I don't care. It's busted, it's broken. You, you can't no actually... You business here. Skedaddle! You can't actually put the things in. Do your ears work? This area is Nine off is limits. greater than... Get the fuck out of here! Something Six. wrong? Smaller than... Four. Can't put three. Can't put zero. It's busted. <gasps> you use the same number over again. Nine something. Nine? Sorry, nine. Three. Oh shit, was that was I being special needs there? Was I trying to put a three 
Three smaller than four. Oh yeah, I, I, me, it's me. I'm being. A, I'm being. I'm, I'm having a brain fart here. Four. What? Zero. I'm in. It wasn't even worth it, lads. I think I had a brain fart. There. It was actually all right. So what we've learned is, you can break into things, right? And as long as you don't actually steal anything, it doesn't matter. So we don't have to worry about doing unlocking chests or anything in people's faces. Interesting. Time to go on that. Side. Oh, I didn't want to. Fuck, Is man. Oh my god, lads! I fucking why the fuck? There they are, just as I thought. Fuck, off, man. Oh, fuck it, lads. I just I don't care. I don't care about opening that chest. I don't care. You can fuck off. Yeah. Okay. I, I pressed all the buttons because I was I was raging. Something wrong. I'm in. Right. Get out the way. Oh, this is this is by the way, she's fucked off, she's fucked off, she's fucked off. Steal it, steal it, steal it, steal it. What? I'll know immediately if anything There's is There's nobody here, okay. You cannot see through brick Something walls. Wrong with your legs. You, listen, you can't see what got here, yeah, honestly lads, I'm telling you my guy's just going apeshit. He's climbing out the things without us even asking him to. Sometimes you've got to ask yourself, do Something I even give a fuck? I don't I don't give a fuck. Fuck this mission. Right. We'll, we'll hard save here. Oh, I want to rest. Something wrong. I hate, I hate, I hate the outlaw camp already. It's, it's oh, ridiculous. Right. Hard save. Okay, lads, right. We'll call an episode here. When we come back, I'm going to explore the rest of this um, outlaw camp. Then if we don't get too many quests, I'm going to do Kaya's mission because I'm interested in that. Hope you enjoyed the episode, lads. See you in the next one. I Last episode, we got to the crater, which is the base of the outlaws. Now, we... Well, I wouldn't say we've done any quests here. We we, we spoke to the guy over there who's a bounty hunter who wants us to do a bounty. We got we tried to get scammed by a guy, a woman called Scarlet, and now she's lying face first in the dirt dead. And we also found Hank, which was the guy from the Berserkers who scammed us. He's also dead. Um, the issue is... Well, not the issue, but we got a quest at the end of last episode from Kaya. I think I want to do this. I want to get this done because this this is interesting. I want to see where Kaya's storyline goes because I would like to get Kaya's missions done so that we can get Falk back because I, I like having Falk on the team. I think he's funny. I like his little comments. So, time to go on that scouting expedi expedition to Tavar. Time to go on that and then scouting we'll do, expedition to Tavar. We'll come back here later once we don't have any companion quests. Before the cleric spies go into hiding. I need to find out what they've been doing before I neutralize them. Let's do it. Cleric spies. I like the clerics. There they are. Just as I thought. Those cleric fanatics sent machines to spy on us. Are you sure? I'm familiar with cleric technology, and these machines are acting kind of odd. Looks more like they're programmed for battle, not surveillance. We'll soon find out. Come on then. You go These first. quests. I'll be right behind you. The quests are very similar to Elex One. Infection. I'd already forgotten where they like, about it again. She teleports you to certain I places. Get a handle on it. That thing is going to happen to me. All right, let's go. I'll take the flying one down first because. Oh shit! Yeah, these these ranged combats brutal. Fuck, I'm gonna die. I'll take out this guy. Lads, what the f How do you actually, like, how do you actually, like, manage, like, more than, like, two creatures? It's insane.
Right, that's one down. Now we can con- these are quite hard, these. Like nice. you were right. They've been programmed for battle. How dare the clerics launch such a brazen attack? I'm not so sure they have. The clerics have their own problems to deal with. But we can leave that discussion for later. Let's get rid of all the machines around the fort first. Yeah. All right. And we know. If you say so. I think we know that this isn't the clerics' fault. Because when we were at the cleric base, they're having issues with their drones, aren't they? One of their drones turned on them. Ooh, a damaged alb sword. Nice. Right, we'll take this guy down because he's by himself. These guys are insane. We'll get rid of all these small portions and we'll start using the medium ones. I'm healing in a bush. Right, two of them. Get your sword out then. Shit, 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 shit. Kaya, you wanna fucking help us? I almost wish I could live here. Where exactly are we? Oh, we're just here. Right, come on then. That's them dead. Where does she want us to go? This way. Oh, wow. Oh my days, there's so many to kill. If there's a bed here, I'll rest. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna burn through resources here. These these guys are tough. Well, giving control to someone else isn't easy. I've never been very good. Every time we land after doing it, um, a rocket man, <laughs> we land on some dude. Not complaining. Medium healing portion that'll come in handy. It's kind of creepy here. All on satellite dish. Right, here we go. I 
I can see it. Kaya? Good, she's, she's behind me. Shame because you can't dodge in the air. Mm. Fucking hell. These robots are pretty tough. I'd like to shove him right down the cleric's throats. It's not the clerics. Come on. We can... Are you kidding me? So somebody else took control of them? But why? <laughs> Get behind me! Wanna die? It's got a cliff? Oh my god. Nah, no, this is ridiculous. Finish off the rest of them. Then we'll talk. Okay. Well then. This is one here, but I was dead. Oh, they're all dead. Well, I think there's one left. Here it is. Taya, do you want to go for face first, please? We did it. Right, we've got one more group to, to take down. Which is good because I can go here. Now I've noticed where this group is. There's a, there's a chest on the map. Maybe that's something I can now unlock. I'll rest in this guy's house. Get me health back. Some guy just told me you gave him permission to enter the upper district. Thought we weren't letting Oh yeah, we already know this. Thank you for coming to me. I've been able Are to end a little bit of this trick for, for, for years now. This guy's fucking living in the past. Watch out. If you think ah, you can steal off. from here, you're That's sorely mistaken. Bullshit. No, seriously, he's been robbed. It's all true. It's me. I've robbed everyone. Ooh, okay, that was a that was a harsh landing. Oh shit, we've landed right in front of the fucking bastard. And a wrap there, that's not good.
Go on. Oh, you motherfucker. How are you supposed to like, like how, realistically, how are you supposed to fight them? Because you can't dodge mid air. It, it's, it's so dog shit. It's alright because we won't get to use medium portions soon. Right. There it is. Ideally, I would like Kaya. Careful. Yeah, you've just got to bait them. Shit, this, they're all spy drones. Right. Next one, this guy here apparently. I don't mind these guys. Boom shakalaka. You're right. Must be three more guys. The seat. There's one there. Is that one there? It is. Let's get down this ravine. We'll just wait till it's got aggro on her. Uh, oh shit. Go on, hit him, Kaya. Ooh. Who the fuck are these? Hello, stranger. Interested in a trade? Interested in helping me fight these fucking things. Let's do business. Of course. Broadsword. Four grand. Is that not what I'm using? Oh, it's a better quality version of what I'm using. Plus 14 damage. Cool. A good deal. If you ever need a good deal, I didn't even buy anything. Right, last guy. Come on then. Oh my god, he got. Hiya. You're asking for this. Drop your weapon. Now here comes the pain. You're asking for this. Is he fucking so serious? What are you fucking talking about? Bro, I'm not even fighting you. Pardon me?
Lads, the fucking merchants broke. Lads, this fucking game, my days. Right, you fuck off, man. Soon, fuck me quest up. Fuck off. Get up that hill, you prick. That was de that wow. If if that's what we've we got to do, all? it's fucking terrible. Looks like it. Those damn clerics. I'm telling you, this wasn't their doing. Someone hacked their machines. And how can you be so sure of that? I took a closer look at those things, and it's just as I suspected. They've been hacked. It's clear the clerics aren't behind these attacks. All right, I'll leave it at that. I trust your judgment. Still, I hope this isn't going to become a regular thing in Tavar. Anyway, thank you for your help. You can always count on me. If anything like this happens again, just let me know. All right, I will. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I like Kaya, and I did use her in the first game, but she's so different in this game. I just. I think she's a massive fucking killjoy, to be honest. Like, she's miserable. Go back to Bastion. We're done for now. Stand by at the Bastion. If you like. So what we'll do is, I don't know, if this, if this works the same as the first game, what happens is we can just leave people in the Bastion and come back, like, at a later date once. Pardon me, once certain times passed and we can do quests for them. So I, I like that. I like the way they do that because it means you don't have to take anybody with you that you don't really like having in your party. I like Falk. I think he's, he's he's hilarious. Now let's get a bed and then we'll go and get him. Go and get him back. And then what we'll do is we'll have to make a, a conscious effort to come back here and see if Kaya's got any quests. Then we'll just do her quests. I don't get a handle on it. That thing is going to happen to me. Hmm. Oh, there's something here. Uh, a ball. Hmm. Oh. New exp. See? Look, his quest ready to go. Follow me. Follow me. Of course. And then let's see what his quest is. Hey, just let me know when you're ready to begin your next experiment. Since you asked, I have been processing an idea for some time now. Yeah? I am not certain, however, that it will bring me any closer to achieving my goal. If you don't try, you'll never be certain. So tell me, what's the plan? I want to help the Bastion. They have a problem there. The surrounding areas are full of wild animals and other troublesome creatures. I would like to go hunting. I want to try to keep the Bastion safe from the dangerous beasts. Okay, then we can do it. Huh. What does that have to do with becoming more human? Helping your friends is one of humanity's defining traits. Well, yeah, pretty much. When you're ready, let's set off. Just say the word. Uh... David first. Let's go. Okay, let's go hunting. I would like to go to the waters below the bastion. Some rather troublesome wet lurkers appeared oh, there recently. Oh no. Dealing with those seems like a worthy enough deed. Wet lurker, these are the hardest creatures in the game. 
Wet lurkers can be quite dangerous. Like all the other creatures in Magalon. Elves, for example. Was that supposed to be a joke? How am I going to beat this? We may just have to employ hit and run tactics here. Reaction Unless acknowledged. I shall refrain from any future attempts at humor. So exhausting. Where the fuck is it? Oh my god, there's fucking another one. This is, this is fucking wild, this. What the fuck? What is this creature? It's a fucking. It's. It, 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 I don't know. It's a fucking battle toad. I hate it. Oh my god, there's another one. There's another. Fuck this quest. Lads, these creatures are so shit. How do you even defend against that? Can't even stagger them. I'm just gonna have to let him let him do the work, which is which is fucking bullshit. Oh, just do this. Oh my god, we found the tactic. Oh, fuck this. Stamina. Okay, lads, we've got the tactic for these pricks. It's actually hit and run. Because I can do good damage to them, it's just that they're too hard to do anything else with. See what I mean? <laughs> Falk, do you want to give the hand here? You fancy not dying anytime soon? Bruh. You're not the one I want. Good, fight that one. I got greedy. Oh my god, this is so brutally, bu brutally bad. So that's what that attack does. Where is it? <laughs> the creature just spaz out. It's just insane. Fucking is annoying as well. One more. Got it. This, this, this five. This five. I hope this good deed receives some attention from the others. Oh my god, this five. I hope it's the kind of attention you're looking for. Oh my god, this five. More. That's three portions. We'll take these. Well, I only need one, really. We know how to deal. Uh, one good thing is, I've learned how to deal with these without getting hit. It's pure cheese, but it works. I'll take everything. Oh, nice fuel. I'll take that. Two 
two more left. Come on, baby. There they are. And the good thing is you can kind of take on a group of them like this, because you just walk... What oh. did you mean when you said, I hope it's the kind of attention you're looking for? You want people... <laughs> Falk, do you want to fucking do something? Dead. Right, let's lure him back this way. <laughs> Last time you ever seen anything like it in your life. It's actually just crazy. It's working though. And this is with our upgraded sword lads, like... We've just got the stats to do this. Then again, we, we maybe aren't supposed to do this at this time. But Oh shit, you hit us. Got it. Got him. Well, you did a fantastically shit job Are there. Are we finished dealing with the wet lurkers? Sure looks that way. Then let us see if it achieves the desired result. Thank you for your help. It Hulk is, is a always true friend. a pleasure to work with you. That is what humans say, right? It is. The pleasure was all mine. Ha! Huh. Yes, I see. How are things with you, Falk? Excellent. Being by your side is proving to be a very interesting experience. Holy man, me and you brothers in your arms. Early human endeavor to try to preserve our world is remarkable indeed. Good stuff. All right, so that's that quest done. Right, well, we're going to go back to the... Oh, do you know what we didn't do? We didn't get a fast travel point for here. Oh my days! That's fine. We'll go here. You know what it is? I actually, actually need the toilet. So, we'll go here. I mean, in real life, not in the game. I mean, in the game, Jax probably does need the toilet because he never took a shit in about 25 days, which is, is not good for his, his health. We'll rest. We'll get heal healed up. I'm going to equip a medium portion of my quick menu. Damn it. Inventory. None of the major factions have a good plan to counter the aliens. It's up to us to come up with something. Well, 46 of these. Assign a quick slot. I'll have that over there. I could use food, but food doesn't actually heal you past your your lowered health, so I'll keep them there. Right. Oh, my head. Now what we'll do is we'll have to... We need what we need to primary. I need to find a fast travel point around here. So this road looks like it might have a fast travel point and because it goes into the base there. It's going to fast travel here. We'll save it. Me. Save it. Pause it. I'm going to go for a quick toilet. It'll take me a second, and for you it'll be instant. See you in a second, lads. Right then. Let's make our way back over to the outlaw base and see if we can find a fast travel teleporter. I never even I never even considered that when we left to do Kaya's mission. Never crossed my mind. You're kidding me, that hurt me. No way. Bullshit. I'm gonna to have to call bullshit on that. A nice little lake.
Oh. Oli. The water has a stimulating effect. Keep your okay. pants up. Excuse so me. So we've <laughs> keep your pants I up. was just making a joke. Ah, humor. That's going to be for a side quest in it. Nature that I have thus far sorely neglected. Is that a fast No. It is peculiar that external influences have such a lasting effect on life. What do you mean? Had it not been for the comet, human development might have taken a very different course. That's true. And the two of us wouldn't be here. In that sense, I am glad to be the result of a catastrophe. Me too. Right. There's got to be a fast travel teleport around here. Wait. He has one, right outside the base, of course. And we found some free fuel. So we'll activate this, and then we'll go back in town. There we go, right, let's... I wonder if the gate guards say anything. Go on through. Darius. What are you looking at me for? There's a whole city to see. You don't need to know who I am or anything. I know you're not one of those purple ass freaks. You don't need to bribe me, and I don't have anything to tell you. So buzz off. That's a pleasant surprise. Are you sure you've got the right job? Gate guard doesn't seem like your speed. What'd you expect? Random ass kicking? Who's got time for that shit? <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. Here's your spending money. You're what? giving me a Lexit? I like Just this guy. Like that? Not me. It's Hector's orders. Every visitor gets a happy little chunk of change. I don't know what he was smoking when he came up with that one. You could thank him in person, but that'd mean dragging your sorry ass all the way to the upper district, and that's closed right now. Okay, how do I get there? How do I get to the upper district? You've got legs. Use them. What do I have to do to get in? That's way above my pay grade. If I knew that, I wouldn't be standing around here. You're not really much of a help. Go talk to Xander. He's guarding the entrance. Xander. Where am I now? Well, you came all this way and you don't even know where you are? Man, you're a real character. <laughs> I'm just that type of guy. This is Crater City. Home of the real outlaws, not those ass-kissing little shits who cozied up to the berserkers. Baxter's in charge around here. You may know him as Bloody Baxter. You got any other questions? There aren't any rules you need to tell me? Listen, man, you're with the outlaws now. We're not big on rules. If you get off on petty theft, you better not get caught. But here, you can find yourself without a head real quick. You don't have a city watch or anything? Ha! <laughs> That's funny. Man, we don't even have laws. Now that I think about it, we do have one rule. No outsiders in the upper district. Why didn't you say that from the first place? You don't want to go there anyway. All the fun's down here. Oh, one more thing. It's every man for himself in the city here. That means you're on your own, man. It doesn't mean you go looking for trouble, though. Not that I'd mind beating the shit out of you. But we can easily avoid that if you want. Okay, run along. Have a good time. Okay, well, trouble's already found us. Hey, mister. This your first time in town? Yeah? Yeah. I'd like to show you around town. You coming? Oh shit, okay, I'll do it. Sure, I'll take a tour of the place. Great, come with me. Welcome to Crater City. You again? I gave you 20% of my take just last week. Come now, Vicky. With the influx of strangers in the crater these days. 
danger can lurk behind every corner. It's more and more difficult to ensure the safety of you and your business from this tidal wave of This guy's players. strong armor. This also means, unfortunately, the price for my protection services must increase. Supply and demand, you know. What a dick. I don't dick. believe that 800 Alexit is too much to ask, considering the wealth of some of your clientele. Not to mention the quality of protection you receive for it. That's more than half my take. You can't be serious. Listen to me, sweetie. I'll say it slower this time. You pay the blade, and the blade makes sure you're alive to make money next week. The blade can stop his protection at any time, if that's what you want. To be at the mercy of any number of unsavory types. Okay, okay. Don't, don't, don't pay up. Can't you see I'm busy? Maybe you could fuck off. Why what do these dick. individuals live surrounded by refuse? Statistically speaking, their risk of infection. Because the Trumps. Most people aren't interested in statistics. I understand. The investment of energy required for interpretation is not proportional to the result. All kind of stuff talking something here. They would the rest say of they don't give a fuck. Noted. Uh, I knew you were smart the moment I laid eyes on you. I'll see you next week. So, how can I help you? I've got some new potions in stock. Do you want some help? Feel free to take a look at the merchandise. Question is, how can I help you? I heard you talking with that blade guy. He giving you trouble? Yeah. I was robbed a while back. Half of my goods were stolen. Next day, this guy shows up saying he'll protect me if I pay him. Everyone knows he's the one going around robbing people and killing off all the business. Then he shows up demanding payment for his so-called protection. Yeah, what a scumbag. Do you want us to kick his head in? That guy needs his ass kicked. Tell me about it. All I could do is hire my own protection. But I can't afford that. Not with all the protection money I paid a blade. Hmm. I'll take care of it. I could take care of this blade guy for you. Like I said, I can't pay anyone. Or are you planning on helping for free? What could you give me instead? What could you give me instead? And go without eating for a week? Huh. I could maybe give you 80. Can't deal. do more. If that's enough for you, we have a deal. All right. I'll take care of this Blade guy. Thank you so much. I'll be glad when Blade finally stops this shit. All right. Do you want your money back? What should I do with Blade? You want your money back? No. I just want him to leave me alone. But be careful messing with him. There's a reason people turn a blind eye to his business. He might not be good for much, but what he is good for is fighting. We'll see about that. Where can I find Blade? He struts around the city bullying people. You're bound to run into him sooner or later. Okay. Okay. That was right. impressive. And the Falk, man, lads, we're, we're going to beat somebody up. I can't wait. So what we should do, where's... We'll tell you what we'll do. We'll, we'll do the little kid's quest first, because we're, we're busy doing that. Um... Welcome to Crater City. Yeah, the kid waited for us. Go, go, come on. The mercenary. Okay, we, there's loads of people here. Skibor. There's so many people we need to speak to. Hey man, you got a minute? It's for a good cause. Real important shit. Oh, I bet you it's real important shit, lad. Everybody in this town's a scam artist. I'm listening, though. I'm listening. I'm collecting donations for the nursery. It's like a daycare center for orphan kids. Got any shards you can spare? The poor little ones in the nursery can use all the help they can get. So it's like a daycare for kids, or it is. It either is or it isn't. We can give him 10 shards, we can give him 100. Or nothing. Anyway, we'll give him 10 shards. Just to see where this takes us. Yeah, I can spare a few shards, I guess. 
That's it? Ah, that's weak, man. How many shards are you fucking putting in? I'm not giving you any more, so live with it. Deal with it. I'm not giving you any more, so live with it. You're not so charitable today, are you? Hey, I didn't have to give you shit. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Every bit helps. It'll go right to the nursery. Later. The thing is, though, if it is a real nursery, I'll give him more, but... Right, he's going up there. This kid's giving us a shit, too. He hasn't said anything. Don't keep me waiting. Give in now and you'll lose everything eventually. What type of tour is this? You've got a couple pieces of Alexa for me. What the hell? Darius gave you as much as me, didn't he? This is the worst tour I've ever been on. This guy's gonna take me to some random shop out back and try and make us buy stuff so he can get a backhander. Okay, so that'll be one thousand shards, please. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking no chance. What do you need so much money for? I, um, well, I'm, uh, hell whatever. Wait. I think that sneaky son of a bitch stole Ooh, something. stole from 50 me. shards? You son of a bitch. I'm gonna fucking catch ya, you little cunt. Come here. Gonna get ya. You like me, do you? You fucking won't. Right, where's he going? I think we want to find out where this guy lives. And I'm going to murder his whole family. Just watch. Was the death of your whole family worth 50 shards? You better not have come here with empty pockets, squirts. No, Zach. I've got something real this time. Seriously. Okay, then. Show me. Come on. Is that it? 20 Alexa. Oh, he's... That's all I have. He took 50 and he's only yeah, given him 20. I don't believe you. Come on, hand over the rest or I'll kick your ass. Really? That's all I have? Huh. Okay. I'll take your word for it. But if I find out you're holding out on me, you're going to wish you were dead. I'm going to tell him. I'm going to tell him the kid's holding out on him. Caught you red-handed. You've been stealing from me. Me? No, sir. You must have mixed me up with someone else. I will crush you. Hey, if you're calling my boys thieves, you're gonna deal with me. Come on then. And you are... The guy who's gonna kick your ass if you don't get the fuck out of here <laughs> now. <laughs> well, your little buddy over there stole my shards. I just want them back. You don't listen too good, do you? Squirt ain't no thief. I think I'm gonna have to smash in that skull of yours. Bring it on. Get ready for a whole lot of pain! Your kid's gonna be without a father. <laughs> Mate, I love this town. We just kill everyone. That guy's really taking a beating. It's your dad. Your dad's really taking a beating. Your dad's getting murdered. I hope it was worth it. Punched Zack in the face. Shit, man. You're not as scrawny as you look. So, do I get the shards back now? I want interest. Okay, okay, okay. Lay off of me, all right? I can't take it no more. Here, here's your money. Is he going to give me 20 or 50? Ah, look. See, because the kid's been holding out on him. took more than this. Where's the rest? Wait, what? Oh, I knew that little shit was lying to me. What he gets. Hey man, if you want your shards, you better talk to the kid. That's all he gave me. Hey, do what you want to him. Just leave me alone. I can't wait. I want to kill this kid as well. Where's he gone? You little fuck. You've still got my shards. You really screwed Zack over. Do you really need your shards back? Because I'm really hungry, and I need them to buy food. Hmm. How many of my shards are left? I've still got 30 shards. 
Fuck it. Fuck now it is. Now it is. Fair enough. This kid's got big balls. I, I, I'm gonna let him off. I'm gonna let him off. Fine. Keep the shards. Really? Yes. <laughs> You're much nicer than Zack. Thanks. I'm Squirt, by the way. And if you've got any spare food, maybe you could share it with me. You've got thirty. You've got thirty fucking shards. Perhaps we should take pity on the boy and share some of our supplies with him. Mate, he's got thirty Thank shards. You, sir. Why does everyone call you Squirt? It's the only name I know. My mother didn't give me a name, and I never knew my father. Oh, so Zach's not your father. He's just pimping you out. Got any tips for me? About stealing? Sure. I can teach you plenty. But he's a, it'll he's cost a trainer. You. Not cheap. I've got a fork over most of what I take in anyway. So, what do you want to know? Oh, okay. I don't actually need to know anything. I've, I've mastered everything. I've got some food for you. Really? I'll give him some fried meat. Here, take this piece of meat. Oh, fresh meat. Thanks, mister. That was remarkable. Mate, I'm, I'm a legend. What can I say? I'm a true man of the people. Now, what were we doing? Oh, yes. We've got somebody else to beat up. I like, no it is. I don't like this faction, but I like being in this faction. It's always the same. It's just ruthless and I am pretty ruthless. No, no, that's not the right one. Protection money problems. Blade. Right. Oh, he's right next to us. <laughs> Sup, bitch. Blade has no time for bums like you. So how I'll make time. Kindly fuck off out of here. What did you just call me? <laughs> what? I called you a bum, <laughs> a vagabond, a hobo. Oh, what are you gonna do about it, bum? <laughs> I can't wait to destroy this guy. I want you to leave Vicky alone. I want you to leave Vicky alone. Vicky? Vicky? Oh, oh, let me think. Um, Oh, you mean that bitch who doesn't pay her debts? Yeah. Has she sent you here to threaten me or worse? No, she hasn't actually. I just came here because I want to destroy you. Pay yourself for a world of pain. All right. You should prepare yourself for a world of pain. Yeah. You know, I can't stand big mouths like you. <laughs> It'll be a pleasure to whip your ass. Come on then, baby. Oh, right, he's got a two-handed weapon, so we can't do our normal combo. Am I gonna see a fight today? What's up with you? Get wrecked. That was impressive. What do you think about that? I hope that you're going to leave Vicky alone now. Oh shit. Yes, yes. <laughs> Blade admits defeat. Oh, that was a damn good beating you gave me. In the future, I'll pass. Smart move. Whatever. I've got plenty of other sources of income. Vicky's money was just a drop in the ocean. If you don't need anything else, I'll be off. And if I see you again, it'll be too soon. Yeah, tell me who you are. Maybe you should tell me who you are. They call me Blade, because I cut up people who ask too many stupid questions. I wonder if we're gonna get any quests off this guy. So what are you doing here? Isn't it obvious? I'm patrolling my territory. Like a dog. So if you don't have any levy to pay me, get the fuck out of here. I'm considering giving you a good beating. <laughs> oh, you're either real dumb <laughs> or real brave. Either way, get ready to die. He's gonna fight me again. He's gonna fight me again. Is he foolish?
fuck you're in the way. Come on, hit him. Oh my god, he killed us. <laughs> he killed us. Lads, for some reason, he kicked and it did damage. When's a kick ever done? Oh shit. When's a kick ever done damage before? Oh my god, he's done it again. Okay, this guy, this guy just unleashed the true power of destruction. Excellent. The second time I fought him. Not gonna happen again. We'll stick to the plan. Get wrecked. I hope he's dead. He's not. He's still stunned. Get a punk ass bitch. Is he? Is he? Is he having a permanent nap? Oh shit! A couple more punches, and that would have been it. Uh, tell me what you actually want. Ooh. I want money, bitch. Give me a few shards. I won't hit you again. Oh, so that's how it is? Okay, okay. Well, I do have plenty of other sources of income. So now we're even. That Never even. Oh, you're a tough one. I'll give you that. I don't want to fight you anymore. Okay, so he's got no more quests. That was remarkable, wasn't it? We <laughs> he got destroyed. Right, who else can we kill in here? Where were we? Oh, we saw a couple of people. Oh, we're gonna explore here, see if there's any loot. We saw some people when we were following the little kid. She's just an outlaw. But where did we go? We went across. Take this. Right, so that's the entrance. The random house. Oh, I can see a fuel cell. Yeah, baby. I'll have that. Who's this guy? Just regular outlaw. Right, so let's retrace our steps. We walk through here. This is like the market. Oh, we'll tell her that we completed the quest. Blade won't be demanding any more protection money from you. You really did it. I owe you. As agreed, your payment. It's not much, but it's all I can spare right now. If we've got 30 Conan, we do have 30, do we have 30 Conan? I think we do have 30 cunning. I definitely don't have 40 constitution. Let's see if we can get a few more shards. There should be a few more shards in it for a favor like this, don't you think? <sighs> you don't plan on taking a Lexit from me every week, do you? No. No. I just thought a little bonus was in order. Even if you're not a jerk like Blade. Well, okay. That'll have to be enough for now. Nice. I'm starting to run into shard problems. Well, you haven't got to pay this guy every week, so that's good. Even now. Good. And if you ever want to buy something, you know where to find me. See you around. Okay, what has she, what has she got? What you got? Only the best here. Grenade launcher, loads of ammo, rebel hat. The outlaw outfit is quite, uh, it's got quite good armor on it, I just prefer the, the thing I'm wearing. 
Potion of Dexterity, 100 gold. We need chemistry. I actually don't know even who can level me up on that. I'll, should I buy this? It's only 100 gold, I'll buy it. So basically, she gave me 100 gold for that and I've just paid her back. But that I've took a potion off her hands for it. That's good. Right, we'll save that there. Now, this guy. This guy is called the Mercenary. Hey, a hundred shards a day, and there's a discount for a week or more. You bear the risk. You won't get compensation if there's an accident. <laughs> Conditions understood. Now maybe tell me what they're for exactly. Uh, I see I gotta start from the beginning with you. I'm the guy who's gonna make you invincible. Seems like a pretty big claim. I drink like a fish, smoke like a chimney, and my gun's got more dings than a ripper's got teeth. But I'm still here, still breathing. So, are we in business? <laughs> no. No. Do you have a name? I prefer not to. A name is like blood. It just sticks to you and attracts vultures. One little slip up, and it's on someone's shit list. But your ass can't get sunburned if you stay in the shade. Okay, I'm not going to hire this guy because it costs money. But I wonder if he's like a real companion or if he's just off. You can just find mercenaries out in the world, you know what I mean? Now, we saw this guy here. Skibor. What in the world are you doing here? I thought you were dead. Who the fuck are you? I know you. You do. <laughs> Come on. Zakor. He's an alb. Wait, you're an alb? Shh, shh, sh shut up. And hey, takes one to know one, right? You're pretty tanned for a former Alp, too. But uh, let's change the subject, huh? They uh, sent you to accompany me to the depot, right? What? No, and I have no idea what you're talking about. You don't? Oh, uh, well, that's not good. Oh, then I guess I'll have to start from square one. But, but not here. These people are always listening. Like, always. It's safer outside the city, so... Uh, Follow me. Oh. Hey, uh, is this... just out of curiosity, what do you think of this city? Shithole. I liked my old hut better. I can imagine. But the smell here? Oh, that stench. Very enlightening. What? That musk smell? Lust, fear, greed. That whole reek, you know? It smells like humanity. I thought you were keeping a low profile. Spouting stuff like that is going to get you noticed. Look at these meat sacks. They wouldn't notice their own murder. But if it's so important, I'll shut up. You're my role model, after all. My ideal. Is that so? Oh, it is. You'll understand pretty soon. The crater is waiting. If this guy can lead us to the Alps, that's who I... Who I well, I don't know if I'm going to join them yet, but... Apparently, I need to infiltrate them so I can join the clerics, and that's kind of what I want to do. He's called Angus. We'll have to speak to him later. How far are we going to go? Right. That should be far enough. Time to talk about where things stand. Okay, so I know more about you than you know about me. You brought me out here to tell me that? No, I have a favor to ask. Nobody's business but yours and mine. Okay, so what do you need? Come with me to the depot in Ignadon. I could use your help on the journey too. You know what it's like out on the roads. There's no one else I can recruit for this. No one can know that I'm an Alp. Okay. All right, but let me look around here first. All right, but let me look around here first. Sure, I've got some errands to run anyway. Just say the word when you're ready. I'll be in the pushers district. Okay, good stuff. So we've got an escort mission. But we'll tell you what we'll do. I want to have a quick look about here. Well, I'll actually speak to this guard here. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Oh, never mind. I, I thought you were someone else. Who'd you think I was? Somebody you're not. Well, that's not very helpful. Come on. Wonder who he's waiting for. 
Yeah, this is this is like the slum shit part of town, isn't it? Like, if, if you can imagine a worse, like, the town's already a shithole. If you can imagine a shithole got like double shithole, this is this is what we're looking at now. Now we do have another quest here, actually. Can you remember? We've got to deliver flowers. Let's do that now. For the guy in the, the for one of the morgans. I forgot about that. Eh. Hey. No. What? Oh, lads! The assassination wants me to kill Dixon, but Dixon's the guy I've agreed to do this quest for. Take his wife some flowers. Come on then. Right, we'll do this now. Ah. That's very interesting actually. Random chest in the middle of nowhere. Oh, a new hat. Radiation resistance. We've never come across that yet. I like how you can find people in different outposts that like lead you to new places. He's just called Outlaw. Oh, the fuck's this? Hey, where you think you're going? I want to see the Duke. Oh, really? It's all right, bully. Oh, yeah, look, he's got fucking prostitutes. My type of place. So you're the asshole I've been hearing so much about. Thought you'd be taller. So you're Baxter, the Duke of Ateris. In the flesh. <laughs> now, what the hell are you doing in my city? I'm raising hell. Once upon a time, you used to be in charge of the Fort in Tavar. Is that true? Yeah, forever ago now. I'll tell you one thing. I'm not getting knocked off my throne again. If you're here to stir up shit, you've come to the wrong place, my man. Is that why you're here instead of on your throne? Is that why you're here instead of on your throne? You want to know why I'm not in my hall in the city center? Hector handles the day-to-day -day shit. We've heard He's of him. My right hand man. So, while he's doing that, I get to stay here and keep watch over what's really important. Like? Uh, making sure assholes like you don't try staging a coup or some shit. You've got a puppet on your throne so you could hide here in the shadows? You should shut your dumb face right <laughs> now. I have no idea what you think you're doing down here. But I know how you operate, Jax. Wouldn't be the first time you worked a whole town up into a frenzy. How'd that end again? With the ruler being kicked out, right? Exactly how it ended. I'm not gonna say anything too bad against this guy, to be honest. I think you're giving me far too much credit. I had nothing to do with the Berserkers taking over the fort. Logan, the former Duke of Tavar, was chased out of his own stronghold by an army of Adan warriors. Good to know. Thanks for that. 
But it's not like I'm gonna magically trust you now. You'll never be part of a faction. You've got no loyalty to anyone but yourself. Truth. And that's why you'll always be an outsider. You don't know anything about me. Hmm, <laughs> maybe. Maybe I'm wrong. But I've been around long enough to spot an asshole from a mile away. Fuckers like you are dangerous. I'm keeping an eye on you. You looking for new recruits to join the outlaws? I'm not looking for shit. Hector's in charge of that. He's my right-hand man. If you're paying tribute or have news from the outside, then I'm your man. For anything else, you can go fuck yourself. That's a nice list. From what I've seen, a terrace is the only place the alien invaders haven't gotten to. You mean those dark hunks of shit that fell from the sky? Raining their hellspawn and whatnot on us? Huh. We've killed more than our fair share of those feral fucks. But they keep coming. <laughs> that shit's an endless plague. At least they haven't set up one of those towers in the crater. Not yet, but I'm not so sure it'll stay that way. Shit runs downhill, right into our crater, so we're always the first to drown in it. What's your plan for dealing with the invaders? What do you think, shit for brains? Step <laughs> one, we defend ourselves no matter what. Step two, there ain't a fucking step two. What else are we supposed to do? I quite like this guy, actually. It's not just your problem. Wait a goddamn minute. Are you here trying to sell me some bullshit about working in sweet and blissful harmony with the elves and the berserkers and whoever the fuck? Oh, makes sense. Please, spare me the sunshine and rainbows noise unless you want my boot in your ass. None of the other factions give a flying fuck about the outlaws. So they can all go fuck themselves. So, I think I've talked to some of Magalon's most important people. Wonder what the old man would say about that. Oh, that was part of a quest as well. Oh, that's part of what the the doctor wanted me to do, wasn't it? Speak to everyone. But for Bastion. Right, so this guy's he's he's not very helpful. I got both my And he doesn't want to say anything else. Yeah, baby. I tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna call an episode here. Hey. Oh well, you. we're not because he's talking to me. What do you want now? I know you. Yeah. Yeah. You're Jax. You're that asshole from the north. You're the guy who wanted to enslave us all in the converters. Not true. That was a long time ago. But you're right. I am Jax. And. And I heard you're a pretty decent guy. Is that what you heard? Well, to look at you, I can hardly believe it. I mean, people talk all kind of shit about your feats. I wonder if they know how scrawny you really are. <laughs> okay, get it over with. What do you want from me? Maybe I just don't like your face. That's your problem. Nope. Because I'm not the guy who's got to walk around with it. I don't have time for this. Well, you're just gonna have oh, to. Oh, he's a companion. Oh, fuck off. Yeah, I think I'm gonna smash your face in for free. Just so I can see what you're made of. Oh, shit. Come on then. Guys, got a shotgun. Bro, put that shit away. Come on then, bitch. All this violence. Get outside, get outside. Come on, bitch. Oh, fuck with me, son. What are they doing? All this violence. Oh. Oh, he hit us. Oh, shit, he nearly killed us. I'm stuck in the fucking ground. What are they doing? 
get wrecked. Excellent. You stuck under the floor. <laughs> stuck under the floor. You fucking idiot. What are you doing in there, mate? <laughs> you got lucky this time. That's all. <gasps> Maybe you should be a little more careful who you mess with in the future. I didn't think you had it in you for such a lightweight. Ain't no place in the crater for a guy like you. It'd be better for everyone if you just fucked off. You get a bonus or something for bitching out everyone you don't like? Don't matter what my job is. What I do here at the crater is my business. I think I'm gonna have another chat with your boss. Do whatever you want, as long as you're out of my sight. So we can get this guy as a companion. I got my eye. Okay. I wonder how. He's, he, I don't think he's going to be a very good companion. He's stuck on the fucking floor for a start. Like, Tell you what, I think this might be... Lads, I think we're going to have to load the game. He's going to be stuck there forever, isn't he? Oh my god, lads, this game. This game. Hey! Let's try not to piss him off since he looks like he's a companion. Want some shards? Here's a few shards. That's what you want, right? I look like the kind of guy who takes a bribe. I don't have time for this. Doesn't make a difference. Well, you're just gonna have to. Okay. Right, right, right. Do it. Right, okay. Let's just get this guy fucking destroyed. This guy. Oh. Let's get this guy destroyed. I'm just going to tell him to fuck off. He's a dick. But I kind of have him locked on the floor. I'm going to see that's going to be a big problem. Hey. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. Your problem. That's... You're right in the fucking way, you know. You can settle this peacefully too, you know. If you, as soon as you hear the click. Come over here. You're gonna get trapped on the floor again, you fucking idiot. Right, there we go. He's not trapping the floor anymore. Happy days. Um, what is he doing? What is he doing? Right, there we go. Right, what we'll do is I want to save it here. Call an episode. When we come back, we'll go and speak to his boss. See what, see what he says, which is the guy in there. Then, I think I'm going to escort that guy to the... The Alps. So we can see what they've got going on. Actually, I might not do that. I might see if we can finish up anything around here first. And maybe get some quests for these guys. Possibly find that H character. The other boss. You know, the boss that's just standing on the throne. I forgot his name. See if we can find him. Um, I'll have a look through my quest log. I hope you've enjoyed the episode, lads. See you in the next one.